Yeah, I've been waiting all day for this. Guys, welcome back in and happy Gwent Day. I mean, Thursday. <laughs> Seriously though, guys, welcome back in and happy good Thursday. I see somebody from YouTube's over here. Mallow, what's up? Welcome in. Fuchs, welcome in. Zen and Mallow, thank you so much for taking the time to come over from the YouTube side of things. Found Maggie's live stream archive. Wait, did you find the archive for... Uh, what, did, what game am I playing? For Witcher 3? Did you come from the Witcher 3 archive channel? Guys, seriously, welcome back in. I feel like it's been forever. All jokes aside, I am going to have serious withdrawals from this game after a couple of days. Our next stream after day today is going to be Monday, and I'm going to have serious Gwent withdrawals. So we're going to have to like dedicate the whole day to that. But first of all, for, whoa, wait, Lawrence, thank you so much for the reset for nine months in a row. Welcome back in, and also Win, Win, thank you so much for the tier one sub. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and community. Thank you. I'm I'm so glad you're enjoying it here and Ryan Ryan welcome back in and thank you so much for the hunter bits first of all smiley face what are we first of all in what did buck talk to you did buck talk to you about February is that why you're first of all in me and also sons sons welcome back in and thank you so much for the reset for seven months in a row and welcome back in let me scroll back to the top I saw hold on wait I see zero zeros here zero welcome back in Falky's here too Falky are you all caught up am I making it easier now that I'm not doing seven hour streams like super late into the evenings a stretch already are you serious we're already doing stretches I haven't even done anything yet and yet my back cracked on every level possible. <laughs> Why is that even a thing? Mm. All right, thank you. I needed that though. Uh, limber for Gwent. <laughs> I suppose so. Zen, welcome back in Spazzy, guys. I think I can keep up with this. Malcolmson, thank you. Wait, hold on. Malcolm, thank you so much for the tier three sub as well. And for four months in a row, been an awesome four month experience. Thank you for all the laugh smiles and much more. It makes a difference. Keep the great work up, Maggie. Thank you so much, Malcolm. You guys, I tell you guys this all the time, but it's messages like that, that honestly bring tears to me. Not the subs, not any of that stuff. You guys know to hit me where it hurts and that's my heart. So thank you so much for the kind words. And I'm so glad you found this community and you're enjoying it, Malcolmson. An ant with the cast of gobble. <laughs> Everybody who's new to the channel is wondering what is this caster gobble and why is it so bad? Oh man. All right, let's see. Oh no. All right, hold on. To be fair, I haven't been hydrating today. Give me a second. I haven't been hydrating. Okay, hold on. Uh, Oz, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in and also unknown welcome back. Unknown welcome back in, but also unknown. Thank you so much for the gifted sub to Mallow. Mo, I, I'm going to call you Mo. Mo, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes and the channel. And again, thank you so much for taking the time to come over. I think that is so cool that you guys will find me on some other app and then take the time out of y'all's lives to come over here and hang out with me when things are live and fun and goofy. Always goofy. But purple, purple irons here. Welcome back in. Raging's here. Char Sharpie with the hydrate. Okay, I'm gonna come back for that. I'm, I've not forgotten the cast of gobble. I have not forgotten the cast of gobble. Let me just hydrate real quick, okay? Um, and then also Sharpie with the hydrate. Jirax, thank you so much for the reset for seven months in a row and welcome back in. Seven months of trying to find the exit. Seven months of Queen Ginger and her human servant, Maggie. <laughs> Time to find a seat and see what happens next, Drax. My dear Drax, thank you so much for the continual support. I don't see Ginger out there yet, but I know she's looming in my room right now, which is just down the hallway. I love how squeaky that is. I definitely need some, uh, what is that? What is the, is it not Gorilla Glue? What's the DW40? Is that what it is? I definitely need something like that because this thing is like... Can you guys hear that? The squeaky? It bothers me so much. But yes, Ginger is hanging around close. She's just not at the door yet. And so I made sure to wear ginger proof clothes as well. So WD-40. Yeah, I was right. I have, I always have like a little bit on hand. I just feel like I never actually remember to use it. You know, I'm starting to acquire quite the garage. Look, you saw me get excited. Here's the thing. You saw me get excited about a about a shredder which by the way i think i already killed my shredder um it is no longer working i've tried to reverse it i've tried to remove the gunk from it but i think i overbore it and now it is dead so my shredder if this is any sign that i think i should have spent more money on the shredder but shredder aside 
I need to share with you guys my garage because I feel like my tool collection is kind of coming along and I'm loving it so much. So I need to share that with you guys because I also have a bunch of projects for the house that I'm doing coming up here soon. So I want to take you along with that as well. So I'm going to try to post some more stories on that. I've got some big project plans. This is the year that I finally take on doing exposed ceiling beams, faux ones, faux ones. Um, and then I'm also gonna be doing some shiplap and, and just some some random things around. Plays taps for the shredder. Na, na, na. Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Juan. And Juan, welcome in. Welcome back in. And I hope you enjoy the seven emotes. Andy, welcome back in. Glide Pass here. Shal's here. Dar Pass, Devow, Joel, Spalky again. Jang is here. Kang is here. Joel's, Lawrence again. Welcome back in. Guys, I've been having Gwent withdrawals. I know it's been about 12 hours, but I haven't I haven't played anything in like in like 12 hours but i need it back also we do have a hard deadline so do remind me we have a hard deadline at nine o'clock i've gone i've been hitting the gym what two times in a row now at nine o'clock so remind me at nine tonight this is gonna go for three for three and then i feel like it's one step closer to forming a permanent habit Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Maribel. Wait, Maribel's here. Maribel, welcome back in. And I hope you enjoy the emotes and the sub. And also Paul with the cast of gobble. Y'all. <laughs> okay, hold on. That was not bad. And I don't even think I hydrated Sharpie. Hold on. I don't even think I hydrated. Also, Anon with the gifted sub to Sapa, Sap. I'm going to say sap, sap. I hope you enjoy the emotes as well. Bro Gamer, welcome back in. I just finished playing this game and from playing Gwent to watching Gwent. I just love how many of y'all will leave. You'll come back hours later. Like some of you guys will go do a whole life and come back and I'm still playing Gwent. <laughs> Midnight for you. No, nine o'clock, please. I've been so good at it. I'm building strong habits. Maybe I need to start setting like alarms on my phone, I think. Malcolmson, thank you so much for the two gifted subs to the channel and community. Y'all, if you got one of them, I hope you enjoyed the sub and the emotes. Great balls of fire, Malcolmson. Thank you so much. And Orion, welcome back in. Fuchs is here. Bunny Dung. Bunny Dung. <laughs> Bunny Dung, what's up? Welcome in. Unknown wonder how much Gwent Maggie played offline today. Look. I'm going away, right? I'm going away for the weekend. And I thought Catan was going to be what we played, but I might, isn't there a phone app? I might download the phone app <laughs> so that I can play it in the car on the way. Jayla, wait, Jayla, thank you so much for the reset for three months in a row as well. And also at the Atheus, Atheus, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the channel and community. Skywalker's here. Skywalker, welcome back in. Ish, welcome back in. London, welcome back in. Sharpie is here. Um, Deoxy, Deoxy, you've become a regular. Welcome back in. Or less lurky, maybe. Maybe that's the key. And Andy's here. Gwentry Roads, take me home. I'm never going to change the intro. I've accepted it now. This has become the Maggie intro. And also, Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Mal. Mal, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. I'm waiting to see if Ginger comes because it's always way more convenient for Ginger to do her treats in the morning. Or not the morning, but the start of the stream. It's always way more convenient. And Masonite, welcome back in. And Mo, again, welcome in. And I hope you enjoy it here. We do slightly long intros because I try to take the time You're to catch up. You're more of a crackpot than a crack shot. Falky, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Falky, I love so much that we share just this common love for Fable and you appreciate the gargoyle so much. And also we need to link up because I cannot wait to have that print behind me over here. I'm trying to get more kind of gamer stuff. Like I say, like, I guess gamer memorabilia or art in this room, it feels a little bit too minimalistic and barren. And so I don't want it to be like overwhelming, but I do want to have a couple new pieces. And if you guys didn't see in the Discord, Falky painted, well, actually, was, was it colored pencils? Falky made the most amazing piece of Jack of Blades. And that is my man. Uh, outside of Chris Redfield, that is my man. Yeah, it was colored pencil. It was so beautiful. Um, Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Yellow Duck, Ezekiel, and also Mal again. Guys, I hope y'all enjoy the sub and the emotes. Duke, Shadow Knight, welcome. Wait, Shadow Knight, you got, you got it working. I saw that in the Discord. Shadow Knight, welcome in. I hope you enjoy being able to type for once. Ezekiel, welcome in. And yes, Witcher is going really well. But today, we are staying on track. Unless, I think I did this yesterday. I never sought out Gwent yesterday, right? I just stumbled into Gwent. Like, Gwent smacked me. I didn't, I didn't go searching for Gwent. I didn't go, I didn't go searching for Gwent and Gwent found me. 
Blackadder, Blackadder, thank you so much for the reset for an entire... It's been a whole year! I have so much energy right now, you guys. I haven't talked to anybody all day. Oh my gosh, Blackadder. Thank you so much for the whole freaking year of continual support and welcome back in. Stumbled on it. I feel like I just kind of like... Uh, we were like trolloping on the horse and kind of ran into it. Trotting, not trolloping. We were not trolloping. We were trotting. We were trotting. We were trotting. <laughs> That's what we tell ourselves about Gwent. <laughs> I never choose to play Gwent. Gwent plays me. I, I need to continue. Okay, moving on. Checkered Vans, welcome back in. Nee Souls here too. Lakers ish again. Mo, MS, roll call time. Zen, welcome back in. Did you see that post that created the short version of Gwen Song? No, no, wait. Did you add me? I haven't looked at Discord since early, early this morning, whenever I posted. And then I also saw, did somebody ask, have I always liked country music? No. That has not been the case at all. That is definitely something that I think in the past like two, three years, I just found a lot of their songs to be really happy when they're not singing about losing a woman, beer, or like football losses. But outside of that, there's some really awesome country songs. But yeah, in the past couple of years, that's just been my jam. It's like happy. Yeah. <laughs> Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub. Ayo, Ayo River, welcome back in. Every time I see your name, Ayo, I don't think I've ever told you this, but every time I see the word river, especially in your name, I instantly think, do you say Lucas Graham? No, I have listened to Lucas Graham. Actually, fun fact about that. Hold on. Let me come back to that. Um, every time I see your name, Spazzy, I saw it pop up. <laughs> Story, please hold. <laughs> it's absolute chaos, you guys. Y'all. London with the three gifted subs to the channel and community. Black Adder with five more gifted subs. And unknown. Y'all. Why you break me like this? Guys, thank you so much for the gifted subs. I don't even think it's possible to not be gifted and be here. Chat doesn't want me to catch up. This isn't anything to do with me. You guys don't want me to catch up. That's what this is. I'm the wiser now. Andy, Andy, thank you so much for another five gifted subs as well. Guys, <laughs> Ali, welcome back in. Juan, welcome back in. Dead Mall. Mr. Mojo's in here too. I usually twitch when going through withdrawals. You twitch too. <laughs> Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub. Also to Patrick Nelson and anybody that just got a gifted sub. Welcome, you're stuck. It do kind of work like this. You're now stuck. I don't know if you know this. Um, have fun. Lots of food talks. Lots of poor RPG play here and occasional horror streams. So I hope you guys enjoy it here. But River, every time I see your name, it reminds me of Rivers of Blood. Super short story, but that's what I was that's what I was talking about. And then somebody asked about Lucas Graham. I've got to catch up. Xaver, Glidepath, Lakers. Guys, thank you so much for the gifted subs. I watched Bioshock first, then watched almost everything else. I love your content. Wait, that makes me so glad. Mo, I'm so happy to see you're enjoying the archive channel as well, because that has been a labor of love that Vert does, and he absolutely crushes it. Black Adder. Black Adder with another five gifted subs to the channel and community as well. And Mort and Nick, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed the sub. Or I hope you, I, <laughs> thank you for the follows. Welcome in. I don't know if you got a sub or not, but welcome in. Um, thank you so much. <laughs> Lucas Graham is for everyone. Wait, wait, uh, Lucas Graham. I haven't listened to him in a long time, to be fair.
Skywalker. Skywalker with another five gifted subs. We're ignoring Kitchen. Kitchen, get out of here. Skywalker, thank you so much for another five gifted subs to the channel and community. I will catch up. Maribel, Matthew, Kitchen, get out of here. Beastman, welcome back in. Zero. Chris, no, the other Chris. Wait, no, not that Chris. That Chris. <laughs> welcome back in. First of all, making me say the word. And yes, he did reach out to you. So are you excited about it? Just tell me if, how, like, how excited were you when he told you that? And also Buzzy Mate. Buzzy, thank you so much for the reset for 11 months in a row and welcome back in. Can only confirm the labor part where it concerns Vert. <laughs> hey, Vert, Vert has been with me for a very, very long time. He chose this route. He came to me many moons ago and wanted to be my editor. I don't know who would choose to do that, but <laughs> like I, you guys know that there's like a method with the YouTube videos. There was never an intentional reason behind doing the goofs at the beginning of the YouTube videos. That was just like, I would send him intros that were so scuffed and he was like, I'm gonna start just putting you on blast. So I fully like whenever I get the videos back, I'm like, I fully accept that something ridiculous is going to be at the beginning of this or at the end. And it is what it is. He volunteered Katniss Hunger Game meme. <laughs> I volunteer as tribute. Actually, this was uh, Vert has been around for such a long time. It was back when I played. Oh, man. Oh, what is that game called? Oh, it's a platformer. It's like a Souls S platformer. Do not say no, it's not Bioshock. It wasn't Bioshock. Uh, it starts with an R, I think. Banana Cow, thank you for the follow. Welcome in as well. And Riddler, welcome back in. Axe, welcome back in. Dombox here as well. Malcolmson, again, thank you so much. Jay's here. Jay Law is here. Unknown Masonite. Baby Bears, bro. I'm scrolling. We're scrolling. Sonic's always here. Sonic, I cannot believe how, how long you've been here either. Oh my goodness. And Phil. Phil, thank you so much for the reset for three months in a row. Welcome back in. Blasphemous. Why did I think it started with an R? And also Vert approached from the shadows. <laughs> Listening in wait. <laughs> yes, it was blasphemous. It did not start with an R. Fun fact. Um, Phil, seriously, thank you so much. I'm glad to see you're still enjoying the channel and the community. Ginger's still not here yet. I'm kind of surprised by that. I'm really just taking a slow time with the intro to give her more time, you know? She's got brittle bones. She's got brittle bones. Apollo, welcome back in. Oh, you were the one that asked about the country music. And yeah, to answer the question about Lucas Graham, he's the um, he's from Denmark, right? He's the Danish singer. He does the uh, once I was seven years old. Mm -hmm. That one, right? Uh, Malcolmson, I saw that too. It's actually National Kiss a Ginger Day. Isn't that what you told me? Yeah, so he did that song. I was in Denmark when that started being not that song, but um, his first song, Mama mom mom mama something about mama when that song was like huge in denmark that was when i actually got to be in denmark my best friend growing up um her whole family is from denmark so i got to go over there for like three weeks when i was maybe 14 14 15 i think mama said mama said that it was okay yeah it was so cool getting to be there and that's when i first found him and i remember trying to look him up when i was back here and he actually at the time wasn't on like apple music or anything so yes i had so much fun and i got to go to legoland which like i grew up liking more poly pockets and then i stole my brother's legos to pick on them and i would like leave them in evil spots and they would go to sit down and they'd be like you know <laughs> you'd leave like a lego in a very strategic spot so they slip and fall down the stairs and Getting to go to Legoland was awesome. Yes, it was the best. Uh, Spoon, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the channel and community. You guys don't try to sabotage your siblings, what? <laughs> Kay, wait, Kay, uh, I'm gonna go with Fazo. Fazo, welcome in as well. What is the origin story here, everybody? What's the origin story here? Birdie? Erty. Where have you been? I feel like I'm finally playing one of your top suggestions and you're never even here. Erty, seriously, welcome back in and thank you so much for the five gifted subs. And why why do we have a level six hype train? You guys, y'all are truly bananas. Like holy beans. Anon also with the gifted sub to Ark. Ark, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. Your face at the end of the sub. I don't even, I should have that memorized by now and I don't. I should, but I don't. 
uh Shwim Shwimi is it Shwimi thanks for the follow welcome in as well and y'all thank you so much for the hype train and anybody that I missed I saw Mr. King Yeti welcome back in Elm's here too Elm I said Devow right I think I said Devow crates here royal pain soups here gorilla glue might be something interesting choice I mean it will definitely stay in place that's for sure the gobble origin story has it been a while since i've told the gobble origin story it's not even i feel like a lot of things that have become a staple in the stream they have such small origins but they've become so big you know like like michael michael started as just my my donation alert or my uh sub alert during uh, october and then somehow i became obsessed with him and then now i'm chasing him like now it's reverse i'm chasing michael and he's running from me I don't know why. I don't know why. Uh, hold on, Ish. Thank you so much for the 100 bits. And Erdy as well. I kind of have a life. I can't be here for all the streams. Oh, okay. Sorry. But you'll be here for all the Mass Effect streams that happened in 2026, right? <laughs> Ish. And also, Erdy, guys, thank you for the bits. And Flynn. Flynn's here too. Flynn, welcome back in. You've missed all the Gwent. Don't worry. All you missed was Gwent. Flynn, thank you so much for the reset. Or the... <laughs> The 500 bits. Maggie tried chat GPT to compose her own song for this channel. <laughs> what? Should we compose? I mean, I feel like there is enough here that we could create something. We really could, you know? Flynn, seriously, thank you so much. I, if we had a song for this channel, somehow you guys would compose it with cats. It would be cats Game of Thrones, but not Game of Thrones. It would just be all in like cat meows. Speaking of cats, I think Ginger is sitting outside. So let's grab her. Let's do treat time and then let's get started on some Witcher. Or do you guys want to do treat time midstream? Do we use all of our gym ginger points now or later? The song for the channel is Cat Game of Thrones. Elena, what's up? Welcome back in. <laughs> this <laughs> Is this fire overalls in a white t-shirt? Is this what? This is fashion. This is me since I was five years old. <laughs> thank you so much, though, and welcome back in. Anon, Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Mistral. I have to catch you when you're live. I tried to go to your channel to watch your VOD. I got to catch you when you're live. Um, Mistral, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes, and I'm so glad you're back here. I hope you enjoyed today. And Unknown, thank you so much for the follow. Okay, okay, we're going, we're going, we're going. I see Bad Tay is here. Bad Tay, welcome back in. Maribel again. Yeah, so I definitely screwed up my shredder. My shredder's dead. I don't know if I should... <laughs> I don't know the procedure with that. I've had it for less than 24 hours, and my shredder died. Should I try to, like, contact Amazon? I feel like that's not normal. All I fed it was, like... I fed it a credit card, basically, like basically like, you know how they send you all those fake credit cards, not fake credit cards, but it's like, open this credit card. This one already has your name on it. Take it. And I tried shredding that and it destroyed the shredder. I tried unplugging. I tried replugging it back in. I tried reversing that bad boy. I tried putting it back through. I know not the wisest of choices to put it back through. I tried every button on there and it's gone. Boom. I've lost it. And I'm really upset about this because you guys know that there's a couple of things that I shouldn't get that excited for, but like for instance, last year at Christmas time, I got a universal socket for my screwdriver and it has been my favorite thing that I've ever received. But there's like little things that just make me really happy. I also got a rumple this year. Have you guys ever heard of a rumple? <laughs> Not rumple stiltskin. Not rumple stiltskin. It's like a traveling blanket. So when I go to like fire pits, I can just like pull out my rumple. Maybe it's not called a rumple. Maybe I'm just like, it's like an R U M P L. I think no E. I think there's no E, but I think it's called a rumple. What is this outside you speak of? Cole, what's up? Welcome back in. Uh, this weekend, I'm so excited. I'm going to smush a marshmallow on my brother. I can already tell. We always have a contest who makes the best roasted marshmallows. And I actually have a really great technique. I feel like I make a mean. Uh, what are those things called? S'more? I make a mean s'more. But yeah, he has no mercy this weekend. The rumple belongs to my dog now. <laughs> Wait, so you have a rumple. Correction, it belongs to your dog now. I just really, really, yes, The Last of Us is debuting this weekend and I'm not here. But I'm going to watch it like late at night in my room. I'm going to like, I have HBO on my phone ready to go. It's just one episode too, right? Oh, and I did confirm you guys, I'm on Yellowstone season four. I'm so far behind. I thought I was up to date. I'm on Yellowstone season four. <laughs> 
Oh, is Anna here? Anna, welcome back in. Hold on, I'm scrolling. I see Spazzy. It happened yesterday. Left at 7.30 to play a Gwent game and came back at 9 and it was still a Gwent game. <laughs> I have a problem. I will say that if we do have, like, you know, an anonymous meeting uh, or an intervention, if you bring cookies, I might give up Gwent. Like, any kind of food. Bring Taco Bell and I will give up Gwent. Okay. That's all I request. Derek, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the channel and community as well. Mal, again, welcome back in. Flynn's here. Yellow Duck, Baby Bears again. See, this is what happens is I just see the same names. Andy's here. Lakers is here. King Sparky, welcome back in. Let's meet them. Wait, the most important question of the stream, how's Ginger doing? Do you guys want to see Ginger now? I don't even think I saw y'all's answer to that. I'm all, I just now got to Ezekiel's message. You guys do this. I tried playing this and got stuck too with many buttons to remember. I play on Xbox S and I got stuck and couldn't do the mission because I couldn't get out of the part of the map. Wait, are you talking about the very beginning part? Blue, welcome in, by the way. Uh, the PP bot? <laughs> oh no, you just discovered the PP bot. All right, I'm going to have to scroll and catch up. I thought I was going to be able to do it today. Uh, Archer is here, KF. Um, the origin of the gobble. I feel like I haven't told the story in quite some time. And also, Harry, what's up? Welcome in. What exactly is a lumberjack goblin? Wait, what? That's one of the cryptids you guys have in the U. Wait, a lumberjack goblin? <laughs> Hold on. I'm not familiar with this, Harry, but welcome in. I saw your Witcher and I needed to catch you live. Well, it's going to be a lot of Gwent. If you guys are popping in for a Witcher, it's probably going to be more Gwentcher. Looking for eventually going full-time with content creation. So it's cool seeing someone else who recently made the leap. Really? Wait, that's amazing. It's definitely, it is the most rewarding leap of faith, but it also is the most terrifying. That's awesome to see somebody else doing it. I will say like, so I had been streaming for four years before I did it. I think I went full-time the same time I hit four years on Twitch, like doing it part-time. And so that is such, it's not an easy choice to make but i think it is the most rewarding choice like getting to be here with you guys almost every single day it's just truly an honor um and as long as you like keep that mentality you will crush it um cole <laughs> you can't time out vert you can't time out vert did he try did he ask to time out vert event and give me sugar thanks for the follow welcome to the channel and community who'd you do get out of here translated to thank you so much <laughs> Sarah Tone is here as well. I've got to scroll back down. I also see Spoon. Spoon again, thank you for the follow and welcome in. And Canadian, welcome in. All right, we're scrolling, we're scrolling. You wanted to ban Doug? Is Doug even here right now? I haven't seen him yet. I haven't even seen him yet. <laughs> oh man, I haven't even greeted Doug. He is here. Oh no. Pat, welcome back in. Diablos, welcome in. Uh, marbles, of course. No, Anna. Uh, we have marbles at the end of today, actually. I did forget about that. All right, yes. If you guys are new here... Okay, I'm going to start switching over. I got to ban Doug. But if you guys are new here... Um, I have made a deal with my community that every 10 deaths, you guys get a marbles game. And so we did hit 10 deaths. Although one of the deaths was really bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. But that's fine. I will... You know what? I... I'm not without taking pity on you guys, and I know that you guys really need a marbles game of 2023, so, you know, I'll give a dog a bone. Welcome back to Dad Jokes with Slyfoot. Back at it again. What shoes do ninjas wear? Sneakers. Need an arc to save two of every animal? I know a guy. <laughs> I have heard that one. I like that one. What was, the, what was my favorite one from yesterday? You were on fire yesterday. Dawn, what's up? Welcome back in as well. Yesterday, I accidentally swallowed some food coloring. The doctor said I'm okay, but I feel like I've died a little inside. I see you got a before. <laughs> Sly, you make me so happy with these. I died a little inside. All right, back at it again. Let's see. Try unplugging it, plugging it back in. I've tried this so many times. Rem uh, if you guys will see the next episode, I think I talk about it, but I had to wait and talk to Verizon yesterday the day before and i was having internet issues and the first thing the guy asked me when i got on was he was like have you tried turning it off and back on and i really thought that was a meme and apparently it's not and i was like yes yes i have and he did not like my tone and so my experience was really negative with them he was a really sassy um which i get it honestly probably doing calls on a day-to-day -day basis and people mistaking like your router with your modem is probably so infuriating from an it perspective 
It's eight degrees Celsius. It's freezing right now. What is this outside you speak? All right, let me ban Doug real quick. Oh, why you gotta do Doug so dirty? I'm scrolling. First step to admitting you have a problem. Mm -hmm. I don't think I don't think you guys really understood just how much I was gonna become obsessed with Gwen. That's the thing. When y'all suggested this right off the rip of me playing this, I don't think anybody expected me to actually like it as much as I have. The one episode I think is like an hour and 30 minutes. Is that gonna be the normal? It's always gonna be about an hour and 30 minutes. And BZ and North Stars, guys, thanks for the follow and welcome in. And Aries, Aries, oh my gosh, I get so happy whenever I see you in chat. Hey, Maggie, who probably has the, the whole closet of overalls. Does it shock you guys that I only have two pairs of overalls? It's actually just these, so you keep seeing the same overall. <laughs> it's just these and my painting overalls, or my now turned into like every type of overalls that now just has a... Uh, I'm not going to finish the sentence, but there is a substance on it that is all covering it and it is not paint anymore it's anytime i do a project i always get a bunch of something on it something something dark side i will never say that statement because i know you will quote that so fast first rule of gwen is you do not talk about gwen the second rule is you do not talk about gwen you know i've never actually seen fight club or if I have, would I tell you? Uh, speaking of movies, though, if you guys are not tracking, I did add our movie night for January is going to be Monty Python and the Holy Grail. And that is going to be on the 20th at 730 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And then March is going to be Princess Bride. And I'm also going to be streaming. We're going to be doing a stream on I figured it's been Valentine's Day with Gwent and Geralt. So we're going to be doing a couple streams and we also might have something special for the discord that month but i don't want to say it yet because i want to keep you guys in suspense so time to upgrade to verizon fios that's what i've had i've had verizon fios and i'm having problems with it bylo what's up welcome back in it's good to see you return and i also feel like i've missed so many people guys if you popped in and you said hi welcome back in thank you for being here first and foremost and i hope you guys enjoy this playthrough of gwent so i gotta also i need to tell you guys what i did last game I can't even remember what we did last game. I don't even mind Gwen as long as maybe we isolate it towards the end of the game. So maybe I should... Can you have multiple markers on the map? I haven't actually tested that. If I can have multiple markers on the map, maybe... Maybe I could like set the markers and then at the end of the game we go back for the last hour and play it. I think the only the first one because I know the third episode is 70... How do you know the third episode is 75 minutes? That's so specific. And Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to line it up. And to Blave, you better be there for the Princess Bride movie night, to Blave. I better see you there. And Echo, welcome back in. Dead Mall and not a meme. Power cycling can actually solve a lot of problems, but it gets really annoying talking to a bunch of tech support when all you've done for the last 10 things is on the scripted questions. <laughs> I will say that I think that I am that, I don't know. Is this like a, I hate when people chalk it up to like generation things, but I don't like the automation. I'm that person on the phone when I try to do a help desk. I'm like, representation. No, representation. Represent. <laughs> I just want to talk to a human. Is that so wrong? Mr. Monkey, welcome back in. Fight Club is overrated. I feel like everybody quotes it, but nobody actually is legit talking about seeing it. Adam, welcome back in. By the way, London, I saw Aries again. Your addiction to Gwent waiting for the final five. Is there a mini game in Final Fantasy VII? Or is that like the the combat would why would that make me want to play that anon thank you so much for the gift of the bz as well so i gave culture wallace on and now i'm a fan but it led me to zach bryan and now i can't stop binging country okay so there's always going to be stadium country who cares like the music that you like it doesn't matter but yes zach bryan is amazing my favorite song uh if you want a cowboy i think it's if you want a cowboy is really good um pretty much all of his songs condemned is really good but Coulter wall Kate McCannon is really good. And then Living on the Sand, I want to say. It's called Living on the Sand. Listen to that one. I get really sad girl country. I go really sad. I love sad music. It doesn't mean I'm a sad person. I just think that I like emotions and feeling. And the fact that some people can convey such strong emotions in lyrics and a song, it's just the most beautiful art form to me outside of games. And if you like that, um, who else? Like right now I've been listening to Wolf by the, is it the first aid kit? I think that song, it's been out for forever, but it's just my total snowboarding song. You know how you have like a playlist for certain things you do? That's my snowboarding song right there. IX, welcome in, by the way, as you wish. Exactly, exactly. Victor, welcome back in. Gotta head out. All right, Falky, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. And if I don't see you, I've... 
I won't die. Hopefully I see you Monday. This is the last stream until Monday of next week, you guys. Um, what is the airspeed velocity of an unladen swallow? Red, no blue. Ah! All right, so let me scroll. I'm the speak to the representative, yeah. Just let me speak. I'm always the guy that spams zero until I'm talking to a human operator. Exactly. I know that that's probably so annoying for a lot of companies, but do you say the country blues? The country blues. I will say country country music does some fantastic sad. Like if you're feeling sad, it can get dark real quick. But it also is some of the happiest music I've ever listened to. But I'm so glad to hear that you gave it a try and you en are enjoying it. I think I also pasted Smith and... What was it? What did I post? It was, I can never remember their names. Smith and the Shanes, it's a chain and the Smiths. Shane Smith and the Saints. They have really fantastic music too. But I love it so much, nobody calls me and I work in telecoms. Are you kidding me? I've, nobody calls, everybody uses the automated system. Fair and also boss guys, thanks for the follow, welcome in. And Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to AJ. AJ, I hope you enjoy the 70 emotes. And Ernie, Ernie with the gifted sub too. My name is Inigo Montoya. You killed my father, prepared to die. All right, let's go. I love sad songs. Oh, we haven't seen this one. Oh, we did meet Kira, Kara. We did just meet Kara. Witcher set off to find it with Kara in tow. The title alone sounds really sad, Victor. I don't think I've ever heard that actually. I can only listen to country music if I wait, wait, if others play it, or you did you say if you're drinking or others play it? To be fair, country music can be great when you're drinking. There's lots of talks about beer. But yeah, I would I think a great way to ease into it too is Zach Bryan is fantastic. He is very good and he also like I want to say I believe he was in the military too and then he also was like up and coming very quickly like I think TikTok did wonders because something in the orange blew him up like and then I know he did condemned for Yellowstone and honestly I think Yellowstone has some of the most like apt and beautifully placed songs in any series that I've like listened to but I also haven't seen a lot of series to be fair. Princess Buttercup. Princess Buttercup. I haven't seen it in so long, so I have to, I need to rewatch it. My favorite quote though is, I'm not a witch, I'm your wife. Ernie, also with the gifted sub to inconceivable. <laughs> but seriously, some of the best actors that they piece together. I like the BLT. And if you're like me, I always wanted to try that chocolate that, uh, what's his name created? The like, you know when he coats it in chocolate and it's like a horse pill, basically? I always wanted that for some reason. It just looked so good. Chris Stapleton is fantastic. Tyler Childress. I gotta give you guys my my playlist, like my country playlist. Only country I like is not talking in a beer or heartbreak. <laughs> the beer and heartbreak songs, no. Also Johnny Cash. I placed today at the, is it the Highway Bin? That's a collection of Willie Nelson, oh gosh. It's like four of like the all time greats, but they did a couple great songs. Um, Randy Travis, I always talk about Randy Travis though. A friend and I are working on Inigo versus Pirate Wesley. Wait, wait, hold on. I did not finish saying that. Uh, never hear country music, too much of a listen, but it'll, uh, if it's good, I'll listen to it. I'm kind of that way with any kind of music. I will always give anything a chance and I'll listen to it. And I used to, before listening to country, I was really into like tropical house music and like EDM, I guess. I guess I would call it EDM. I, I think that was kind of like the genre that I listened to before, like Matoma and Kygo, like before I would say he got, I don't know, his latest songs have not been doing it for me, but now I want chocolate. The pill that looked like it was. It looked like a gigantic milk dud. That's what it was. The mutton lettuce and tomato. <laughs> the only country I listen to is Johnny Cash. I mean, that's not a bad. It ain't bad. That ain't bad. Remember that you said you take care of today? Uh, yes. Yeah, I do. I do. Okay, so today, today, just for right now, actually, let me do, let me just do this real quick. Let me do this real quick before we get started because there's just one thing. Omnito, welcome back in. And also, Anon, thank you for the gifted sub to JR. There were a lot of things, okay? 
let me do this real quick. All I'm going to do is I'm not going to mute all the alerts, but for the one off sub alerts, I'm just going to mute uh the sound so you guys will still be able to see it i'll still be able to see it it's like a good indication for me but i'm just going to mute the sound of individual ones so hold on let's just do that real quick i feel like 2014 2018 was great for electric and medium yes lately i feel kind of let it down by it i don't know if anybody else has felt like that side note does anybody have a is there a date on arcane coming out by the way dawn all right there we go so i'm gonna do that and it should be good now. Um, Don, how are you doing today, by the way? And Alan Walker faded was such a classic. You're right. Also, chain smokers. I feel like something, did they fall off? I feel like I haven't heard chain smokers in so long. Is that um, are they still a thing? Do they still produce music? And then there's somebody else that I'm thinking of. Guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in, cost and also give. Guys, welcome. All right, let's do it. Let us do it. Also, it was so cool. Whoever posted that one song or that the one artist, I did have Jamestown Fairy. Not why do I always say Jamestown? It's not Jamestown. The fairy, the fairy song. I did, I did have that one in my album. I feel like a lot of times I won't always remember the artist's title unless they have a very generic name. But I'll always remember songs. I can definitely do. I love Chainsmokers. I also need to ban you. Hold on, Doug. Thanks for reminding me that I need to ban you. Inevitable Sunset. What's up? Welcome in. No, I have not. Uh, <laughs> or timeout. Oh, Doug, you just reminded me. No, I've never. I've always, so I do game reviews on my website and I was just talking about how just to make it easier, except that I like word vomit. So I feel like to make it easier though, it'd be really nice to do it in like a podcast form almost, you know? Um, Parachute by Chris Stapleton is the only song I'll ever drive to. Wow, I haven't heard that in so long. I need to paste my uh, playlist for you guys and I need you guys to add to it for me because I am I feel like I used to, especially when I was commuting, I would always be finding new songs. And lately in the past year, I just haven't been consuming as many songs as I used to. It's like the less you drive, the like I mostly listen to songs when I'm driving or cleaning. But now I feel like I've replaced music with podcasts, which is funny. You just asked about that. And Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Inevitable Sunset. Inevitable, I hope you enjoyed the sub and the emotes. I know we have to change it. Tell me when it's been exactly five minutes and I'll untime him. And Blowy, what's up? Welcome in. And yes, we are. I'm good. Got to go out and have some. Got to go out soon, but I'm here till then. Well, great. You'll be able to catch at least one uh, one Gwent match, right? I don't even know if I'm. We've got to be close to it. A podcast is a great idea. I think it would just be an easier way to get all of my ideas across because it is while I can put my thoughts together better on paper. And I think that I still feel like my personality comes out when I write y'all. Like whenever I give you guys updates and things like that, I feel like you can still get a sense of my personality. But there's just something really nice about being able to talk about it because I feel like you have a lot more time. No, you have a lot more time to work with. All right, so we're headed down here. I don't want to meet Kira yet. So yes, have no fear. Your caster recaps here if you guys weren't here for yesterday. And Dazed, welcome back in. Cliffs, welcome back in. And Anon, thank you so much for the gifted subs to Dazed and El Paco and Major Gold. And guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. Okay, so at the end, yes, we just met Kira. So we actually did the, uh, is it the Blumberkin? The Lumberkin, the Blumber, the Lumberkin quest. So we were doing the Baron quest basically throughout the majority of yesterday's stream. And then we ended up doing Kira's. So we just barely met Kira. Instead of going down here with her though, I would like to take on a few more side quests. We did level up to level five yesterday. So my goal is to get to level seven, but again, we have a hard cutoff at 9 p.m. today. So hold me to it. Becky the botchling, exactly. Welcome back in, by the way, and Prime as well. Uh, yes, yes, the baby lumberjack, pretty much. We named the botchling Becky, Becky. So uh, that's what we were dealing with. But let's go ahead and do some side quests. And you know, if we run into somebody who deals in Gwen, I can't help myself, okay? I can't help myself. And now see what you mean about the TR rolls. The TR rolls? Wait, wait, oh, the Texas Roadhouse rolls. <gasps> I forgot about it. You tried Texas Roadhouse. What did you get? Tell me your entire order. And also Chode. Chode, thank you so much for the... I just can't believe it's been 55 months. 
<laughs> there's a few of you guys left, but there is uh, there's actually way more people than I ever would imagine that have been supporting me for over 50 months. Chode, I hope you're doing well. I'm never unsubbing. <laughs> Joe, thank you so much for being one of my longest ever supporters and welcome back in. I hope everything with you is doing well. I'm about to head to the gym. You're always on the go. I respect it. No worries. Get out of here. Go hit that. I'll, uh, mm, what day is it for you? We do need to go to Midco. We do have to go here first. All right, we're going over here real quick. Andreas and Toxic, guys, thanks for the follow and welcome in. Screw that. Becky's dead. Becky's still alive. Okay, Becky's very much still alive. No, we haven't met the Baron's kids. Oh, you bring up a good point. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, so Cho, thank you so much. You're doing splits, training, MMA, so I'm going to go beat up people. Okay, cool. I am too, just in game. Just in game. We're doing Family Matters. You're right. I was sticking with Wandering in the Dark, but let's go back to Family Matters as our main quest. Yes, 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 yes. Philo, thanks for reminding me about that. Four months is close to 55 months. <laughs> Kitchen, it's not about the amount of months. It's the quality of the month. <laughs> it's the motion of the months. Uh, wishing witcher contracts, treasure hunts. We've got a couple of that. But base, basically, I really just need to get to leveling up so we can have better equipment. We can take on more tasks and things. So I'm going to change my main mission. So let's see where this has me going. Every day is leg day. Dude, leg day is my least favorite day. You know what the best day is, though? Oh, that's right. We have to go all the way over here, and we've never been. Isn't this Novigrad? No, Novigrad's up here. So, okay. All right. Let's do this. Uh, my favorite day is definitely back. Back day. And then noodle arm day. Noodle arm day. Hi, Demolition. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. The best day is Marbles day. I can't believe we are playing Marbles tonight. Raj, welcome back in. 48 minutes into stream and you're already done with intro. Come on, Roach. Raj, we made so much progress with our Penn State conversation. And you really want to just take it all away. I'm basically the table of this channel. I'm the table of this channel. <laughs> the one that all of the all of the spilled food goes on. It's like the drippings of the food. Oxenfurt. Oh, that was Oxenfurt. So you're a man well traveled. Hold on. Hold up. First the armies pass, then now that I think about it, I don't think I actually want to be here. Yeah, we're going to do marbles at the very end of today, right before I jet off for... We have played Gwent in this area, so there's no need to do it. Okay, so let's go hit up all of these question marks. We'll do four question marks. We'll do four question marks and then we'll come back to it. Um... Naughty Peach, welcome back in. You like back day? Back day is my favorite. Back and shoulders are my favorite days. Legs, hate chest, could do without it, honestly. Carl, where's Judy? <laughs> Sonic. Um, yeah, I definitely like back day the best. Best day is pizza day, personally. Okay, you're not wrong. Supo, welcome back in. And Cray, I may be on European times, but I'll stay however long it takes to play marbles. And what is 9 p.m. Euro time? Um, 9 p.m. I'm trying to think about it. You don't like back day? Naughty Peach, you don't like back day? Move it. No, 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 sorry. We're gonna do four question marks. Four score and seven years. We're gonna do four question marks. Mama Bear, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. It's my first time on you live. I discovered the last of us playthroughs. Wait, I'm so glad that you're enjoying hey, yeah. that and welcome in. I always say this for the YouTube people, but thank you so much for taking the time to come over here from YouTube. I really appreciate that, and I hope you enjoy it live as well. I'm very chat focused. Come on now. For the record, I always feel like I gotta warn YouTube because normally I'm very meticulous and I move pretty. S I guess I move pretty slow here too, though. But seriously, welcome in, Mama Bear. Great name. Let's see. I'm gonna take Thunderbolt real quick. Oh. -ho. We always start off with either a decapitation or a nice little roasty toasty. Let's see. Sean. And trivial with the gifted sub to noodle arms. All right, I'll have you know that we are going to make these, instead of limp noodle arms, they're gonna be cooked, they're gonna be uncooked pasta arms. This girl, you guys have created a fiend out of ginger. Ow! 
Are you in your guts, Eddie? Ha! I started with the combo platter. Hold on, I gotta read that in one second. Mama Bear, I hope you enjoy it in here. I told you, decapitations. Are we going back to Death March or did she stay on easy mode? All right, first of all, we're not on easy mode. It's still difficult. Just because I choose not to feel pain 24 seven with the other, with Death March, we're still doing blood and broken bones, but I think, I think maybe Monday we'll start back on Death March. I think now that I've gotten a lay of the land, I feel comfortable with combat. I think we can go back because it is seeming a little easy. Did you say uncooked? Hold on, y'all. This is a matter of Texas Roadhouse. I got to scroll back up real quick. Four question marks or four rounds of Gwent? Zero story missions and one round of marbles. Four question marks, two Gwent rounds, and then we'll go back to the, the main, one main mission. It's so weird that they didn't pull all the active quests on the map, so you got to use the mod for it since looking into the menu is so annoying. Wait, what do you mean? Super Snack, welcome back in. And Mr. Welcome back in, too. Um, and Sean, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Mama Bear. Mama Bear, I hope you enjoy it. the ginger emotes and the channel. And just again, thank you for taking time to come over here. So I started with the combo platters, bacon and cheese potato skins to wings and the snake bites. The snake bites are really good. I know exactly what platter you're talking about. Wait, you didn't get fried pickles? I ended up getting the pulled pork sandwich. You got a pulled pork sandwich. You didn't even get a steak, but I did try the sirloin steak and the roadkill steak. Okay, never mind. Holy cow, you went all in, Victor. You don't mess around when you get food. I respect that. All right, as long as you got at least some steak from Texas Roadhouse and John, Mr. Snatch, guys, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Always the one stupid archer just hanging in the back. Always. And when again, thank you. I feel like I kind of like glazed over that, but thank you so much. And James, welcome back in. All right. I feel like I'm caught up now. Death March starts out hard, but once you get decent gear, it feels pretty easy. I feel right now it seems a little too easy as is. The thing with Death March is that you have to spam Quen. That's what I'm kind of already doing in this one. I'm trying to get used to doing that as is, but I'm so glad that you tried it, Victor. You have done Taco Bell, right? We already... We already talked about that, right? Let's see what we have right here. Sly. Three like Moth yesterday. What do you call a wife of... Yes! Yes, he says. The ghost of a chicken. The poultry ghost. Guys, the poultry guys. That's my favorite one. Mm-hmm. That was my favorite one, Sly. Best one by far. All right, we'll put these boots on. Wait, no! But my gold boots. Not the gumdrop buttons. This is going to be a continual problem with Witcher, isn't it? I'm going to have the boots that I like aesthetically, like the gear I like aesthetically, and then I'm going to have the better item for me. Sean, thank you so much. And Ransom, no, no hour intro. We're not messing around. Guys, I did the math, I crunched the numbers. If I keep up at this pace, we won't finish Witcher until January of next year. Sly over substance, please. Style, sorry, style over substance. I'm still stuck on sly foot. Six stream, welcome back in. Long weekend of skiing. What? That's awesome. Was it actually real snow? Was it real snow or artificial? Roach, get back here. All right, we're going to do this. You have to slaughter in style. All right, so we stick with the gold boots. It's the fashion souls. Uh, scas Scassaday, what's up? Welcome in, by the way. And I agree with that statement. I do. I'm out in Colorado, so real snow all the way. I think this year for my birthday, I do want to try to do, cause I think March, is the end of March still ski season? I just feel like if I don't snowboard except for once or twice a year, I'm never going to catch on to it. No hour intro equals two hour intro. <laughs> what? It just becomes two hours of mediocre gameplay because I'm in the middle of talking to you guys while I'm doing this. Nate, what's up? Welcome back in. It has been a minute. Happy new year. And Brewski's back in here too. Brewski, hello. It's eating Let's into the bread time. All right, here we go. Abandoned site. All right, so we need to win this back for the good people. Why do you call it a road? <laughs> the roadkill steak? You wouldn't want a nice roadkill steak. Look, you joke around, but uh, All jokes aside, you get a roadkill moose in Alaska and you're set for like two years with that amount of meat. Oh. Oh. 
All right. Run away! Ow! Run away! Okay, I need to- No! How much damage do the bolts do? And I didn't heal and I even have- What's it called? I even have it. And I still didn't even use my, uh, my thing. Do I hear Kate McCannon? Do I see Kate McCannon again? Need a big phraser for that. Already, I missed your long message before that too. No, you definitely have to. How many are Gwent games already, chat? There's been zero! Oh, yeah. Ye of little faith. Oh. All right, we're going to the main quest. We're going to the main quest. We ride for... We ride for Rohan. We're going. Come nope. on, Roach. Cat... Wait, is I'm Cat here? I'm Cat, welcome back in. No, it is true. Like, if you get a whole moose, and there's... No. Oh, you go on the moose kill list, right? I met somebody up there that did get the moose kill list. And they said that it lasted them like months. Like you do have to have a huge freezer. You have to have a massive freezer for that. But I think that's really awesome that they actually utilize it. It also goes to, a lot of times it goes to families um, that really need it. Like I think there's special requirements to getting on the, the kill list. Muda Moose, no. Muda Moose, welcome back in. It's not the main quest, no, but it's, it's a side main quest. It still constitutes a main quest. It falls under a main quest. It's just the... It's the family matters. We're trying to find Tamara in Oxenfurt. But it's still a constant. That's it, Roach. Tamara counts as it. Fall and four, guys. Thanks for the follow in Raj with the 321 bits. What do witchers do when they are not killing monsters? They kill time. I think I went the wrong way. They kill time. Or waste time. If you're me and don't save, we end up wasting a lot of time as a witcher. Thank you so much for the bits, Raj. Is this a new town? Does have a bunch of wild animals? Yeah, they do have a lot. Oh yeah. There's some kills in there for sure. It's like, it's kind of like going to like, you know, like Cracker Barrel go, though. Go. It's always fun to look at what's on the walls at Cracker Barrel. What is happening here? Clay witch? Mm. I doubt there is actually a merchant here. In fact, there isn't a merchant here that we know of yet. So. I even had moose. I've had reindeer. And I didn't like it at all. But I also had it in a diner. So I don't know if having moose, or I'm sorry, reindeer in a diner makes it very good to begin with. It was like a reindeer sausage, like a reindeer breakfast sausage. Tons of moose get killed by getting hit in vehicles. Also, you have to remember, like, it sounds really bad, but the moose will F up. Uh, honestly, most cases, I think, like, a lot of people, the people die in the, the hits with the moose because people don't really understand. I didn't even understand how large a moose was until I finally saw one in person. And you don't even want to be near them. Like, there's no part of me that wants to be near a moose. Like, I don't go hiking in Alaska. No, sir. Mm. But it's making use of what happens, too. Don't make it through the winter to freeze to death. Yeah. Well, also, you have to remember, too, like, they get hit and they don't, they often, like, don't die from the impact. Like, they'll wreck the car. They won't die from the impact. And so when, like, the authorities get there, they'll call the moose list. And I think you have about, like, two hours to get there and pick the body off of the, like, pavement. The blacktop. Graduated today, so I can finally be a full-time cast of your Omnino. What's up? Wait, congratulations and Lost Tunes. Welcome in and build as well, guys. Welcome in. Chocolate mousse is not mousse. Oh, by no means. And I also saw I'm, I'm Cat. Congratulations, that's huge. Wait, graduated uni or what was it? Hit. Welcome in and King Momo and also Club. Is it Clav Clavia? Clav Valia? Clav Standard. Bali Clava. Valia, thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. All right, who's oh, this guy? Standard Jew, I challenge you. Boots a bit big, maybe. Careful not to trip. Mm. Out, I say. I am Ronvid of the Small Marsh, bound by a sacred oath. Oh, that's rough. No. My sympathies. <laughs> to honor made Bilbury fairest of all maids I know. I knew it was going to be a maid. By a hundred knights to the death. Now, draw your sword post haste, for I'm 99 left after you. 
This poor man got conned into fighting a hundred knights. By the time he's finished with this quest, his woman will already be gone. She will be married, gone, had babies. He's basically been friend zoned and he didn't even realize it. Peach is amazing. Thank you so much and welcome back in. No, I love I love Christmas. I love Santa. I had to try a reindeer for science. Okay, it was for science. No, I've never tried moose. It's not as common. I don't think it's harder to find. I also wasn't like seeking it out. He got night zoned. It does sound like Monty Python. Oh my gosh, it does. Deb Grow, welcome back in, and also Sway, guys. Seriously, welcome in. And if I missed anybody, hello. All right, let's do this. Why would you want to fight me? Hmm. Let's convince Why him he's getting blood on. Don't recall doing anything to offend the maid Bilberry. Well, uh, why? Um, oh. Then swear, swear, maid Bilberry is the most loveliest of all. He Thing could just is, go back and say, "I've, I've killed a hundred. on her. Aha! Ah! I shall wash your scorn away with thy blood fiend. Stand and fight. I don't want to fight him. Really? Guys, he just got absolutely bamboozled by this fair maiden. I can't kill this man. I... <laughs> All right, well, let me make it a fair fight. Okay, wait, hold on. Oh, okay. Okay. Mistake. He's too... This poor man. Do no. it. It's I time. Feel... Oh, he yields anyway. Okay. Strike Fair him enough. down. Yes. Luck stood with you. But, but the next time we meet. Next time I'll kill you. Get out of my sight. Go back to me. I Bill thought it was going to have you actually kill him. For being an ass. Quick, before I change my mind and break your bones. We shall meet again. Whenever I get on stream, Maggie is fighting somebody. <sighs> Okay, instead of fighting, we should have just played a friendly game of Gwent, honestly. Just a Gwent run. No fighting. Just Gwent fight. <laughs> Y'all. Rip. <laughs> I wanted to call her Burberry. This is just... Found another one. This is... Oh, that is perfect. Does it think I'm... <laughs> oh, what a compromising position this is. There's... It thinks I'm going upstairs? It's gotta be, right? The duck walk? No. <laughs> Please, Gerald. I'm gonna need to see your duck walk. Do they even still do that when you join the military? Do you still have to do the duck walk? <laughs> Henry Cavill definitely does not do that. Johnny, what's up? Welcome <laughs> It's his legs. Look at how- oh my gosh! First of all, we're in armor. Think about that. Yeah, you- you do. I had to do a duck walk when I joined. You do. First of all, his Achilles. Yes, Adam, you know that Achilles are my weak. Ever since House of Wax, like, Achilles are- bleh. I hate that. I hate that so much. Anything with Achilles. But the fact that he has armor and it's bending absolutely 90 degrees. All right, let me get out of here. Let's go. Rest in peace, ankles. <laughs> All right, I'm back on track though. There's nobody to play Gwent in here. Roach, come hither. Bucky, what's up? Welcome in. And guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. There's been a couple people. I did the duck walk for MEPS back in 2202. So I joined in 2015 and I did the duck walk. So I don't know. We need to find somebody who's joined more recent. No, I don't think ours. Mine's still decently recent, but it's tr oh, I don't know. 2015's not as... It's not really sounding as recent as I want it to. I was in 2018. Did they, Sly? Wolf Shadow, you know the scene that I'm talking about. They do it? Okay, so I think whenever they do, like, slicing of the Achilles, it's always more for shock and awe. Let's go! Sorry. It's always, like, the shock and awe of it. I've only seen it in like three movies. I think Pet Cemetery did it as well. Blue Train, what's up? Welcome back in. I need to get across here and get to the other side. Uh, 2015 does sound like ages ago and I don't like that. Okay. I don't like that. I don't. 
Have I been to that town? Whoa there. I was in the Air Force. You know nothing, Jon Snow. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Have we been? We have. All right. Uh, there's also a hostel. They do it in hostel, and it's also I just wish I'd never watched the hostel series to begin with. You know nothing, Jon Snow. What's up? Welcome in. All right. There's a bunch of loot. Trusty arms for all sorts, steel swords and strong maces for the men. I shouldn't do it. I shouldn't do it. We need to, no, we need to, uh, mm, mm. I shouldn't do it. I think, I feel like if I walk away from this, I will overcome my addiction. If I walk, if I can walk away from this, I will overcome it. Oh, was he really? 22 years. That's amazing. It's also really awesome when you can do more than a full 20. That's huge. Lucas, thanks for the posture check or the no you. Just one Gwent match. I mean, this might be the only one in the town and then I'll go back to the quest. I promise I'll go back to the quest. I'll go back to the quest. Wait, let's see if he has Gwent cards first. Oh crap, I can't. I forgot that you can't back out of this menu. We get some cards mm. in too. I'll be a happy man. I could get a great card. Exactly, exactly, Hugh. Okay. I promise I'll go back. Okay, it's begun. And so it begins. <laughs> Once the addiction, I'm like, I need Gwen. Like this weekend, if I don't download Gwen on my phone, I'm going to, it's going to be a problem. We go again. This isn't my favorite music though. Give it a second, it'll start up. Ginger wants food. You gotta get your Gwen experience. How else do you become a pro? Thank you, thank you, Judicium. Thank you, exactly. All right, so let me look. Okay, so I'm gonna use no help from you guys. I'm gonna see if I can absolutely just pee pee smack this guy. Okay, so we've got two spies on the table and actually, the only thing that I'm gonna trade out for is this guy. Let's try trading out this one. Do we get Scorch? Oh, it's GG. I think I could also try to trade out one of these three because they're level fives, but I could possibly get a two or a one out of it. But we've got the Dragon Boy as well. You have to play them all to get the deck. That's true. In order to get a complete deck, don't you have to play a, all of the people? I guess maybe some of them sell cards that you could buy from them as well. Is it random too, or does every single merchant and person in the game have scripted cards that they give you? Like when I received this dragon card, remember? I got him from the most unlikely of merchants. I've got to Gwent them all. <laughs> you have to generally play every single NPC. Yeah. I'm gonna trade one of these. It's probably gonna be a bad decision, but I'm still gonna win no matter what. Zoltan is such an amazing. I've never heard of Zoltan. A level one archer. I also am not familiar with this leader. Hold on. Learning lesson more than anything. Pick a biting frost card from your deck and play it instantly. All right, that shouldn't impact me too much. That's a pass. All right, let's just start right off the rip. Let's start with the high spy. Do I have my medic on the field? I don't have my medic on the field. What is that? That's like an Uno reverse card. Reverse, reverse. Can be placed to either, oh, can be placed in either close combat or ranged combat row. Cannot be moved once placed. Interesting. During specific quests, but they should be obvious-ish. Yeah, core, obvious-ish. Mm. I can still win this, even using my spies, but I think I should go ahead and use my other spy. I'm just gonna go spies out. Sp spies out. Skies out, spies out. What did I get from that? My dwarf. All right. If I can bait her into using Biting Frost, that would impact her a lot. But I think at this rate, let's just let her win. I have a decoy. But you can't place a decoy on their deck, no? Witcher Thronebreaker game? It's just going on PC or is that the one that's on your phone? Skies out, thighs out. Many cards are actual characters in the game. Oh, I don't think I've met any of them. 
Yeah, I can only decoy my cards, so... I could place a card to bait... Oh, let's place a card, bait out a card, and decoy it. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I kind of want to use... Let me remember what this one does. Destroy your enemy's strongest close combat units if the combined strength of all are closest. Okay. Mm, let's place this and then decoy it. Or I could have placed the other one, but... Pretty sure it's just on PC, but there is one for the phone, right? I don't trust that at all. You're telling me that... Should <laughs> I have six cards? If I can bait out another card? Actually, let's give them the opportunity to pass first. The one on the phone is completely different. It's not like this at all. I don't even know if I want to pass or I just want to keep pressing them and then just... I'm going to keep pressing and make them have it. <laughs> I just... Have you played... No, I've never played Magic the Gathering. I've never... Thornbreaker is the app. Isn't the phone one just heart zones, but with Witcher characters? So it's nothing like this at all. I think there's something fun about playing this. I'm going to make them use all their cards. I think there's just something really fun about using or playing this game in between like you're you're i just imagine genuinely being <laughs> Geralt on missions and then oh gwen 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 like you just get sidetracked the whole time they passed i guess i should just scoop up the victory with one of these scoop up the victory with the six. Oh, i didn't even see my four too shy uh, yeah, so I can win this round and then I'm just gonna lay all my cards out next round. I think this might be the fastest I've taken somebody down. Might be the fastest. Sam, no! Magic is a huge strategy game. Oh, I just missed that. I need to see the difficulty, Banana, because I don't trust that these people are actually playing like this. Like, this AI is questionable at best. Magic is a huge strategy game. If you like strategy games, Magic is on. Is this on steroids? See, I've never played a game like this before. There it is. <laughs> there it is. The best one. Lanzi, what's up? Welcome in. So we won the first one, but yeah, we have to win one more. But yeah, him passing makes it... Like, especially if I can get them to pass first, the first round, I just need to beat them out by one point at a minimum. This is the part of the song that's in the YouTube video I found. Thank you. I will use that for the intro. We will go back to Gwen. Y'all, thanks for the follows. Welcome to the channel and community and holy unholy, welcome back in. He does have medics. How do you know he has medics? He might have medics. I'm sorry, you said might. That's fair. But I also, it doesn't matter. I have my leader as well. They have two cards. I have my leader. Scorch that. Oh, yeah. I never, so I don't think I'm learning to use Scorch how I should. And Craig, welcome back in. Let's see what their last card is. They passed with one card left. Mm. That's what it does. Gotcha. So it clears any of the same. So because that person had two of the same card, I was able to scorch both and not just one. Whereas normally, if they're not identical, I would scorch just one. That's why it's OP against monsters then. Ah, Moon, what's up? Welcome back in and thank you so much for the hunter bits. Howdy. Howdy, y'all. <laughs> uh, I need to see. I need to see Jon Snow. I, 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 it's gotta be on normal, right? Like if I just start out, let me just place everything. Thank you so much, Moon, and I hope you have a great day at work. I'm gonna miss you this weekend because I'm not streaming, so I'm not gonna... Uh, I'm gonna... Come back on Monday and you're going to be back at work. So if they have the same value, that's why it's incredibly helpful with monsters. <gasps> My man. What's your go-to Texas Roadhouse? Mm, little Lemon and also Get Trek or G-Trek. Welcome in. <gasps> that is rough. One point to 59. Thought you said no stream today. Can't stay away from Gwen. No, today's the stream. I'm not Game streaming this weekend. Over. No stream this weekend. 
Shillard. Hey, there's nothing wrong with the overkill. Okay, there's nothing wrong with a little smackdown. I've, Lord knows I've been smacked down before, so. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta, I know, treat others how you'd wanna be treated. I know, I know. Uh, no, the stream was today, which I don't normally stream on Thursdays, and then no stream Saturday or Sunday, but I'll be back Monday. I gotta go beat my brother in Catan for his birthday. Welcome back to Dad Jokes with the Slide Foot. Out of points after this, out of points. I love how you've been making it count as well. All right, let's see this real quick. I gotta see that in one second. Hold on. Uh, somebody stole all my lamps. I couldn't be more d delighted. I couldn't be more delighted. I like that. Let me find this card real quick. My wife tried to apply to the post office, but they wouldn't let her. This is awesome. So we actually are getting pretty close to having a deck of Nilf Guardian. But, oh, it's a spy too, but that's an insane, that's not a good spy, right? Like if you have to give them seven points to use a spy, that's not good. I mean, it's still a spy, but you wanna find spies that are lower, right? Like the dream one is the one, the spy that's like worth one point. Rayumo, what's up? Welcome in, by the way. Welcome to Overkill. <laughs> It'd just be like that. And then let's also go into options real quick. They said only males work here. <laughs> I didn't even read the rest of it. What's the difference between a hippo and a zippo? One is really, one is really heavy and the other is a little lighter. I love the fact, especially if you don't know what a zippo is, but the other is a little lighter. <laughs> Please. Mmm. It's gonna be near the difficulty of the normal game. It's normal. Should I up the difficulty of Gwent? Cause maybe if I get, maybe if I get smacked back a couple times, I won't want to play it anymore. So maybe I can train myself to not play Gwent. Slide, those were really good. Those were actually top notch. There's a zero spy as well. I need to find that one. Or worse because they have higher strength values. Yeah, I guess there's certain, in y'all's opinion and floppy pickle, what is the, not, don't tell me like the best deck per se, but what's your favorite, um, what is, what are they called? I, I don't know, like faction to play or a group, I, um, team. What's your favorite team? Should I, ta -da? it's either normal or hard. It's easy, normal or hard. Might not be, it's not that hard on hardest difficulty. Uh, it's not what it used to be. I'm sure it's easy to feel taken advantage of too, Azzy. Tweety, what's up? Welcome in. Monster is top. Even, I feel like the only time I've really lost Gwent has been against somebody who's had a monster deck. So I'm not looking forward to, I need to actually talk to him. I need Trust to not just take, I'm sitting here just trying to take Show me your wares. Stuff. Northern Realm is actually really fun. They start you out on Northern Realm and I like the cards. I know I'm gonna finally feel used to my deck and then they're gonna pull me from it and I'm gonna have, not that they pull me from it, you can choose the deck that you want, but I wanna get really proficient at all four decks. It's four decks? I think there's four. Yeah. You think Nilfgaard? The Brotherhood? Which one's Brotherhood? I think I left it on normal. 35 stamina. Your saddle won't tire easily. That's actually a really nice saddle too. I just don't think I want to spend the money on that. Let's buy this. We'll buy that. What is that? Leather scraps. All right, let's go to crafting with him. I haven't found the right things. I don't think I've seen mirrors. Lockdown and also Darwim's and Silicone or and Little. Guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. They get hooked and then they really start playing you. <laughs> just wait, 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 just have a freeze in your deck to demolish monsters. That was my mistake is I couldn't. I even threw two freezes in and I still couldn't beat her. It's um, Master quality weapons. You capable of making them? Who do you think I am? A Tory. It was a the Tory. girl the master craftsman with the blacksmith. I forget. Why everyone's heard of him says he's retired now, so no. Ain't no one can do what you ask. Oh. Okay. Just because he's retired doesn't mean might not help out a friend. I help my friends out in return. Craft something for me. Like you to craft something for me. I know I already looked at this, but there's that. I don't know if anybody else is like this, but I can't stand in my dialogue with him it looking like I haven't had that option. So now that everything's good, we're good. We're good, so it's good, long. it's fine. 
can thanks for the follow and thank you for the posture check and then we also have already if my back cracks this is that what's sitting do i have that bad of posture i have that bad of posture that it cracks so easily sienna sienna what's up welcome back in all right as promised we're getting back on track i'm not looking at the town anymore royal welcome into whoa Hold on. Don, I hope you have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. And yes, play as much Gwent as you want. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I hope I see you next Monday. If not, have a great rest of your weekend. Uh, and also Doug, let me remod you. Um, Back onto the main quest. Not side quest, main quest. I need to go into world map. Take this one off. So you can't place multiple markers, which kind of sucks, because I wish I could place them on the people that I want to. Uh, we're running through so many towns. We're running through so many towns on the way. And there's a merchant in this town, too. But a promise is a promise. Let's go! Set my youngins to pick mushrooms yesterday. It smells like went. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> no. Sienna, how's your day? Excited for Friday? Are you ready for Friday? Did you see I added, we're doing a Dead by Daylight night? And two movie nights? All right, Don, I'll see you Monday. All right, go yeah. Roach. I understand. Oh no. Come on now. I I keep thinking Roach is like our horse in Red Dead. Get up. All right, I will get there faster on foot. Why well, put a question mark on a quest map? So this is the weirdest thing. I we're oh you must have not. Maybe you didn't hear me yesterday. This is the weirdest thing. But I totally understand that there is this bright orange yellow marker telling me where the quest item is. But unless I put my green marker, my brain doesn't want to follow the path. <laughs> it's such a weird Maggieism, but it is what it is. Did I mess with Pokemon cards? No, I've never done Pokemon my entire life. Now I'm starting to think I probably should have. All right, let's call Roach now. Ah, there you are. Lovely. Roach always comes from where you're not looking, correct? Hey, yeah. It appears that way, at least. Did I miss the events? No, I just... Oh, random event. Oh, no. Uh, no, 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 I just added them today. They're happening next Friday and the Friday after, I think. Mm. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Let's remember, I need to get in the habit of doing this. Necro, right? Mm. You can do custom waypoints, but I don't know how many. That's what I've been doing is the custom waypoint. Uh, I've been doing quests in a little, ow, shit. I need to use swallow. Yeah, I've been doing, uh, remind, I need to meditate after this. I've been doing custom waypoints. But I think you can only do one, I believe. All right, before I talk to him, hold on, let me... Do you think he'll still be crying for help if I meditate real quick? I know you're in pain and you might die in these three hours, but I need to meditate, sir. I mean, a different one to hold X. Oh. I think Roach always... Oh, I see, I see. Oh. There's already so many markers on the map and I fully understand that, but I will. <laughs> uh, uh -huh. All right, we're just gonna place it a little nice. Okay, so there is a merchant in here that I did not Gwent play. So just do a nice little, mm. Mm. Need a cat version of this. <laughs> For the Shakira Witcher music. La 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 la. I've gotta learn it. All right, let me help this. Real quick, let me loot these bodies first, and then I'll help you up. Huh? That you'd have eaten me alive for certain. Roach is a double Corpses agent for CIA. I believe it. Thank you for not leaving me there. 
suspicious. Seems luck's with me at times after all. Luck? Guess things could be worse. You get infected recently? That why you haul corpses? What? Hmm. No, it's my job. Well paid too. <laughs> oh. Thing is, you're not a witcher or a that. mage, so you're not immune. I'm no foul mutant, thank the gods. But no worries, nay. It's just, well, no illness ever holds me. That's just an insane immune system. Are we going to chalk it up to an amazing immune system? I would like that. I would love that. Y'all, thank you for the follicks. The follicks. I saw cleric and I combined it with followers. Cleric and man and juju. Guys, thank you for the followers. Welcome in. Technically adds another stream until completion. Every time I get sidetracked with Gwent, is that what you're saying? Mo, thank you for joining the Discord. I hope you enjoy it. Yeah, will you do community events? Um, I'm not gonna say regularly. I'm trying to get more regular this year. Uh, a lot of times, like towards the holidays, they kind of die down. But yes, this year I'm trying to do a lot more. So we're doing a movie night at least each month. Time I was on my way. How did this bill happen? How did this happen? Listen. Axel snapped first. Ben, bye. So I poked me in underneath, see if I could fix it. Then out of the blue, a howl from the woods. I keep hearing about this beast. My like there's a beast somewhere. A wolf had already clinched her hind. The cat tipped and whoa, the cargo fell right on top of me. Your horse ran off. Aye, damn thing bolted. Ain't that my luck. If it don't rain, a wagon of stiffs pours on me head. Oh. Ought to burn your wagon. Gonna need a new cart. I would say Gotta so. burn this one soon. Can't I just bury the stiff somewhere near? Cart's still fit for fixing. Anyone Aww. learns you carried plague victims in it, no one will ever hire you again. Why would they need to learn? I won't tell if you don't. <gasps> Asking You'll me to lie for you? For miles around. Oh, needs must, I suppose. Got anything to start a fire? I'll with? give him the money to buy a new one. Fidel, what's up? Welcome back in. I haven't seen you in so long. I hope you're doing well. Hmm. Okay, so we need to light this on fire. I will give him the money for an entirely new one. And Natty, what's up? Welcome back in. Thanks for coming back. I'm glad to see you're enjoying it. Uh, I mean, I guess I can just do a little shoo shoo. Do I have something for burning it? Can I not just igni it? Okay. Well, well, lit up like a bale of straw. <laughs> I would say so. I don't remember this guy, but I remember his voice. I ran into you. Thanks Didn't... for your help and wise counsel. Here's some more. Go home, burn those clothes, and scrub yourself thoroughly. Yo, sure, sure, but I'll just tell because you true, he doesn't no catch it. Could touch me. Sure hope so. Farewell. Do you think he does multiple voices, Raj? Fuck it out, that stinks. I'd say so. I feel like we should burn it and probably move it off the main road. Move it off the main road, burn it. We're not hanging. Gwen is relevant for some quests, so it's a valid way of getting more powerful. Move it. And it also just makes me feel good. <laughs> more than anything, it's just my fix, okay? Some people. Like, if I had a. Honestly, I guess we'll just have to do like a White Claw and Gwent night one of these days. Where we're just playing Gwent and drinking some claws. Because there ain't no laws when we're drinking claws. Yeah, so he never gets infected. I feel like I wouldn't trust that. Just because you haven't gotten a couple illnesses here and there, I wouldn't trust that I wouldn't get the plague out of anything. The accents in this game are incredible. It's a generic posh queen's English accent. Are we too many characters Let's to not go. reuse actors? It wouldn't make sense for sure. I feel like, um, I think Anna's talked about that before. Like when she'll voice act, a lot of times she'll do multiple roles. Okay, let me hop off here real quick. I have an arrow in my back. I'll do like multiple back to back. Also, I just missed whoever's first time it was chatty. Don't call yourself Poppy. Do not. All right, before this guy, go go arrows first. Bandit. Dude, the arrows are vicious, and I feel like it's really hard to just start running. Like, it's so hard to run at them. No, not that guy. Not that guy. That guy. Oh. All right. Let's try using R. Nope, wrong one. Wrong one. I meant Y. 
Geralt used to be an adventure. He can block that. I did learn that before, didn't I? He's blocked it before. You just have to go back around their backside. This is how you know he got attacked in the middle of the night. Although, was he sleeping with his neck scarf? Like, he was sleeping with the neck piece. Or maybe that's his style. Maybe his style is just the boxer brief. King Danny, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes and welcome in. I guess his style is just boxer, boxers and a <gasps> chicken sandwich. Nice. And a chicken sandwich, they've got bees. I feel like he had to have bear traps. Oh, please tell me you can't run into bear traps that have already been laid. Please, sapphire, amethyst, deer hide? Oh, there's so many things. Hmm. Have you had Simply Spiked? The cursed, wait, the cursed poppy. <laughs> the chicken sandwich is fantastic with a floppy pickle, with extra, extra, extra floppy pickles. Anon, thank you so much for the gifted subs. And y'all, if you just got one, I hope you enjoyed the emotes and the sub. And humans ain't real. No, I have not tried Simply Spiked. Is that by the creators of Simply, um, wait, Simply Lemonade flavors? The watermelon yesterday. See, I don't know, watermelon and lemonade together? Simply, maybe, maybe I have. Are they black cans? Are the cans? I think the cans are black, right? Natty. Natty, thank you so much for the tier one sub. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and the content. Thank you so much. And I hope you enjoy the emotes as well. Lay, welcome in. All right, so going back into my inventory real quick. I have a bunch of things that I don't actually need. Have I picked, do I like? Oh, I pretty much like every type of pickle. I used to not, but jerkins, aren't those the mini pickles? They're like the tiny ones, right? They're like the small pickles. We need to go to alchemy, that's what I need to do. They're white cans. Hmm. I Trulies, do Trulies have a dark can too? Maybe I'm thinking Trulies. I suppose I am. Retro, thanks for the follow in Anon as well with the gift of some delay and Ribo. Ribo is back. Y'all, thank you. Floppy pickle is my, it is my safe word. So if I ever say floppy pickle, it means you can spoil. I made such a crappy promise. I'm gonna stick with it, but I am gonna go to this hidden treasure though. We're right here anyway. Maggie walks into a sandwich shop and asks for a floppy pickle and they just start telling her <laughs> sandwich making tips. <laughs> they start spoiling their secrets. Hey, I would not mind if Jersey Mike's did that. Their sandwiches are way too good for their own good. I also went to a sub shop in Alaska that oh, it was incredible. It was the best chicken bacon ranch sandwich I've ever had. And I know I talk about not liking bacon that much, but... I know I talk about it. I don't know why the alert just panicked. <laughs> Crazy for mob. I'm sorry the alert didn't work, but thank you so much for the five gifted subs to the channel and community. Thank you. Y'all, I hope you enjoy the ginger remotes. I don't know why the alert froze. Anon's breaking the alerts. I can already tell. The alerts are broken from Anon. <laughs> no, I used to not really like bacon. I do like it in a sandwich form. But seriously, crazy. Thank you so much for the five gifted subs to the channel and community. Unless that alert's just broken. But it shouldn't be. I haven't changed anything. Hmm. Oh, do I like... Are you talking about like beef jerky? Do I like jerky? A hundred percent. I have some downstairs. Peppered trapper jerky. Woo! You know I already packed that for this weekend. Juiciest and Jord, guys, welcome in. And thank you for the follows. Mm, all right, it should be right here. A hidden cache up here. I've already got it packed. A glyph in the most unlikely of places. Mm. Some of them are working except for the one that you just played. <laughs> it's right here. At least it's, it's underground. Huh. Okay, let's go over here. 
Oh, okay. I don't think we've encountered anything like this before, but hold on real quick. Old crunchy. I do like just a classic crunchy. Um, can I even, is it pop? Oh, my man, my ghoul. Mm. A classic pickle. What am I thinking? Mm. Have I ever tried a pickle sandwich where the bun is replaced by a pickle? No. I don't, I feel like that would make the sandwich so soggy, but I guess you don't have the bread to make it soggy because the only thing that gets soggy in a sandwich is the bread, right? You'd have to use those large, you know those really big pickles? Don't make it weird yet. Mm. I saw mortadella's top tier. I was thinking about a portobello mushroom is what that made me think of. A good grilled portobello mushroom is fantastic. Mm. There's a sandwich shop in Jersey that does it. I mean, I would definitely try it, but you guys know I've tried my fair share of weird pickle foods. There's pickle chips at Trader Joe's, but there was also the horrid. Do you guys remember the pickle fiasco from last year? <laughs> remember when I tried the pickle peanuts? <laughs> they were the most disgusting peanuts I've ever had in my life. <laughs> they were disgusting. Yes, they were pickle flavored peanuts and it was horrid. Key to a treasure chest and crumpled notes and a smoking pipe. Senpai. That's how you know you're in my channel, is when you hear pickle five million times. And Christmas cow, welcome back in. All right. Soldiers have come, whether ours or theirs, don't know. Don't really matter anymore. I heard them riding down the road, hid, nailed the door shut. Maybe they won't get in. They spent the whole night killing and raping. I saw it all through the cracks in the wall. Bit my finger to the bone, trying to keep from screaming. I don't know if anyone else managed to hide. Maybe not. I saw them drag Antosh out. He had hid in the fields next to the haystack where he'd stashed his things. They failed him. They flailed him. Oh, they flailed him. They've heard me. Know that I'm in here. I didn't open up when they pounded. I thought they'd burn me out, just like they did to those who hid in the granary. Then they got on their horses and rode off. Quiet now. All I can hear are the flies circling the bodies. I tried to knock open the door open the window, dig myself out, make a hole in the wall or roof, nothing doing, nothing doing. Interesting. I heard people who came to rob the corpses. I don't know of what all's left is soiled shirts and foot wrappings. I called for help and they didn't answer. Only ones who come now are the ghouls. Damn. He really couldn't get back out? I found that so hard to believe. Pickle flavored almonds? I don't know about that. Anon. Nerd plant red guys. I hope y'all enjoyed the sub and the emotes and thank you so much. Hmm. Yeah, we do have to make sure we're taking time to read the items. All right, Geralt. Come on. <laughs> All right. Just a little jump up and away. And also to ja Hills. Hills. I hope you enjoyed the emotes as well. Channeling. Channeling. What's up? Welcome back in. All right, so where is the treasure then? We have the key to it. Let me meditate real quick, actually, to get my swallow back in case we encounter anything. How long do I have to meditate to recoup my items? Let's try an hour. Okay, just an hour. You posted a picture in the Discord of what? Wait, I missed it, of what? And Anon as well, channeling. I hope you enjoy the subs and welcome back in. Pickle and nuts, a Maggie memoir. <laughs> what? This was the Maggie memoir, the horrid curse of the peanut, the pickle flavored peanuts, and we're summarizing it as peanuts and nuts, a Maggie memoir. Please, chat. Let me use my Witcher senses. What am I doing? Omnito, please. And pee pee smacking? Now I'm known for pee pee smacking too, on top of all of this already. <laughs> Fidel! Fidel! That's so interesting. There is something down below, so we need to find the entrance. There, brush, no. Fidel, thank you so much for the reset for two months in a row, and I hope work's been going well and everything. We haven't talked in so long, but thank you so much for the continual support. There is something here, though. It has to be down below on the hillside, right? 
I know we've got bodies here. We have this loot. Oh, the amateur repair kit. Hey, that is worth its weight in gold. All right. Not the villain longsword. Nerd. PP smacking pickled nuts. Okay, well, when you put it like that. So I don't think it is, in fact, under here. I think it's even further. That's the door to the home here. Mm. He said that person was hiding their stuff. I hear something besides... It's got to be down here, right? Like, down here and over? Lord, Lord, what's up? Welcome back in. No. Maddie, welcome in. I don't know if I should be... Uh, maybe it's further down in here? Um, maybe ah. I don't know. No. Oh, that's what I keep seeing. I'm trolling myself. Ignore me. That doesn't explain the old key, though. Hmm. Pickled. <laughs> the pickle chaser. Some call me the pickle chaser. Has Ginger eaten any fingies yet? No, I asked you guys if you wanted to see her in the, the start of stream or midstream. And I actually didn't even catch up to the point in chat where I got to see that. So, uh, all right. Welcome back to the main quest. <laughs> back to the main quest. God, this is so far away. There's so many things that we can encounter in the meantime. We need to ride sure and ride true. Where my roach at? All right. Mm. I need Move to it. make my own homemade pickles. I found the recipe that I want to use. Even NG made pickles. And I still have yet to make my own homemade pickles. Help us, everyone. Welcome back in and angelic. <laughs> it kills me because I know you're right and it just didn't occur to me. For whatever reason, Marauder's Bridge. Uh, I don't even know if I should go over here. It didn't even occur to me to fast travel. Oh, that's so painful. It's okay, we're already almost there. I need to stick to my... <laughs> I need to stick to it now. Right, let's go. Sorry. Okay, thanks for the follow in Anon. Thank you so much for the gifted sub to Obi-Wan. Now I just, I, I'm too hard-headed. Roach is preferable. I love the quick upbeat of the music and then it goes well, away real quick. Roach. All right, but also if we hadn't done this, we wouldn't have cleared out some other camps. What? Lost your nerve? Mm. Is it just the two of them? Roach is preferable. To be fair. Come here. Level nine deserves too. <laughs> um, I guess I'll just use Quinn. Conjuring! Bastards conjuring! He's conjuring! Call me the conjuring. We should watch the conjuring in October. Do you guys know the next Friday the 13th? So tomorrow's Friday the 13th. But the the next Friday the 13th is actually in October this year. We've got to do something spooky. I mean, you guys know Octobers are always fantastic, but the fact that we also have a Friday the 13th, finally watching my favorite streamer, George. George, how are you doing? Welcome back in. I also think it's so, I, I'm so happy that you tried Fable, and I think because you did, you can appreciate this comment, but I think I finally met my match. There's a double Friday the 13th, yes. I've met my match, George. This is probably going to come in as my all-time favorite game. And it's only the beginning. Bear fat. I'm gonna take everything we'll sell when we get to the next town as well. Do it, do it, Lay. Definitely replay it, especially if you haven't played it in ages and the, with the next gen, it's just <gasps> the sunsets and the sunrises. Like, I'm not going to say unmatched because I've seen some incredible views in games. But they are some of some, they are some of some of, <laughs> they are some of my favorite. Nothing will top the scene in Last of Us 2 at the farm for me. Just because that's my dream. My dream within a dream. Slow now. Whoa. But it comes in pretty close. Run, Roach. And you're nowhere near the meat and bones of the, or the potatoes, too. 
<laughs> exactly. No, I'm just at the beginning. Like, I'm picking up the scraps of calamari left at the appetizer. Uh, Nerez, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. So we've never been here. This is Oxenfurt. Did I see a math? Math, welcome back in. Come on, Roach. I know. This is only the beginning, which makes me all the more excited. Did you play Ghost of Tsushima? I haven't yet, and I need to. I've kind of talked about this before. I've thought about doing it for YouTube, but I think until I start doing way more than three uploads a week, I don't think it would be manageable. Just because of how many... Am I, oh, am I going the right way? Just because of... Wait, also Mini Cooper. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the gift of some to Floppy Pickles. I can't believe there wasn't already a Floppy Pickles one. Yeah, this is the bridge we're taking. That's it, Roach. So I'm already close to the quest. I'm just saying that if I run into Gwent here on after, I feel like I've uphold, upheld my promise. So I think if I run into Gwent players along this route, it should count. And also Anon to refit and Joe. Guy. Oh, oh, sorry. Sorry. Sorry, y'all. It counts, right? That? No passage. Bolt, no passage. No. Case of the plague surface in the city or something. The plague? Uh, no. Which it's an order. In the city. It's an order, so I don't. Unless someone's got a pass. A pickle in a dream. It's gonna be the title of my memoir. A pickle in a dream. Uh, to answer your question, I personally fell on the side that loved Last of Us 2. But I also... I also think that I am pretty good at seeing multiple perspectives. I I hate the phrase perspect, uh, perception is reality. And so I love how that game challenged the way that I thought. I thought it was just beautifully done. And while I was frustrated very often, I just found the whole experience to be very memorable and uh, pleasurable as well. So I loved it. I've got a pass. What kind of pass are we talking about? I'm just gonna say I've got a pass. This what you mean? Let me look at that. Mm -hmm. uh, missing a seal, the red one. Okay. Impossible. Department of Civil Defense forgot again. They're really off their heads these days. Oh, maybe I can. It happens. So be it. You may come through. That was way too easy. Come through. I didn't even have to persuade anybody or Jedi mind trick. So this is our first settled area. In settled areas such as cities, villages, camps, paths tend to be narrow and ops. Oh, I guess maybe not. Maybe where the Baron lives. Is that technically a settled? I guess that would be a settled area. Paul, what's up? Welcome in and thank you. <laughs> it is my, I think it's so funny how much you guys have liked the mug. Cause I used to never, okay. I would never drink out of it. And then one time for Red Dead 2, I drank out of it. And now I won't drink out of another mug. Mm, this isn't Novigrad. I thought this was Oxenfurt. Is, wait. I'm unfamiliar. It's in Oxenfurt. Oh, okay. It is Oxenfurt. Okay, you confused me for a second. Long live, etc. Et I had a new appreciation, actually liked the second one until the ending again. After Tommy was it ruined the whole thing. I think that's like a huge part of it too though, is that she didn't have the closure. And so that's a huge part of it. But the ending for me is what solidified how much I loved it because I really do feel like the forgiveness was the best form of revenge for her in that moment. And she was learning to forgive herself and Joel. And it's just so, it was, ah, it just was so beautiful. All right, let me go to the mission first. Also, can we appreciate the infrastructure here? Yeah, the music's really relaxing. <gasps> I do, I need to shave. Although I kind of like, look. I kind of like Geralt with a little bit of scruff, but just like a little. Anon also, Vlad, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. Haircut. Redania. It's 427 and the barbers, this is a dedicated barber. He's standing here ready. Sir. Greetings, master. What can I do for you? Got a razor and shears? Good. Make me look decent. I don't know. He kind of looks good right now. You like everyone with scruff? What's new? <laughs> Chris Redfield with all the scruff in seven and eight. Ooh. Shave head and ponytail. 
Ugh, I kind of like my long hair. Just to shave? I guess I can only... You can't pick the length of the shave? Guns up. Welcome in. I mean, I... What's a shaved head and ponytail? I don't trust that. Uh, I should have kept the scruff. Return it, take it back. <laughs> Instant regret. Also, do I see little, I see little blood marks. He cut me. This man cut me. Or maybe those are just my scars. Probably my scars. This barber kind of sucks. There better be other barbers that allow me to pick. Do we do the shaved head and ponytail? Just kill the barber <laughs> debacle. We don't go around just slaughtering people. I did that in Fallout New Vegas and I would slaughter the gamblers that I would lose to. <laughs> mm, I guess I'll just go. I'm, I'm not giving him any more of my money. That was the most so botched shave job I've ever had. Now I just have to meditate just to pass time to get a beard. I don't even think I meditated that long. Hold on. Hold on. Now I'm just actively lit. Wait. Y'all. Do you have the DLCs? Yes, I do. And meanwhile, Geralt just falls asleep. Ew, ew, ew. I'm not going to waste any more time, but I'm going to steal everything. What else can I take from this man? I surely can take his whole life. Ginger. It's too late in the evening. Uh... No, 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 you just reminded me of something. There was something you just reminded me of, though. <gasps> when did I... That... those Y'all, when did I hit level 6? Because I did not see that whatsoever. Did you say pretty witcher? <laughs> Go for the beard? I need to grow the beard. I'm just not gonna meditate the whole time just to get it back, though. I'll let it naturally grow back, okay? You heartless monster. Drez, Drez, what's up? Welcome back in. And guys, thank you for the follows. Hello. I'm gonna put two. Um. I don't like this second combat round. I just need to put into it so I can unlock this third level. Although. I could put more into signs, but I think to make the best use, let me just go ahead and throw two into this. And then... Wait. Oh, that's right. There we go. So I should have unlocked, did I not? The next time. The next time I'll unlock this, right? Or no, you have to have six points in this row to unlock this row. Did you get in bangs too? <laughs> I never want to go back to my bang error. Wait. What just happened to my mutagen? Hold on. 5% attack power, what was it before? Wait a minute. All right, so if I put this one here, plus 5% attack power. So nothing happened to it. I thought something, because I saw both of the red markings leading into it. If I apply this over here, Oh, it's giving me a plus 15% attack power. So if you have multiple of the same, what happens if you have three of the same? Does it give you an even bigger boost? Wait a minute. Five went to 10, then 15. You're right, it was already 10 before with just the one, correct? Let me remove that. So it was at 10, and then it went to 15, so then it would go to 20 if I have three. Not too shabby. Is that worth it for me? The game does not always alert you when you level up. Oh, Maxim, I didn't know that. I think it might have been right when I passed through the gate, possibly. No, that's too much XP. Maybe. But that's huge. It took me so long to level up last time. I do want to use this one. So let's go ahead and throw my Igni on this side, and then we'll make my right side. Yeah! Okay, okay. That's amazing. Oh. All right, let me pick these leaves. Choke to death on three pounds of steel. On three pounds of steel. That person looks like they'd want to play Gwent. Also, what are all of these? Who knows? What if you could play Gwent with all of the soldiers? 
Five went to ten to fifteen. <gasps> Look at the stained glass. Look, somebody left a perfectly gray bowl of tomato basil soup. Or is it ketchup? I, mm, same thing, debatable. There's no grilled cheese next to it whatsoever. I know my boots are amazing. There's a lot of guards in here too. The random NPC voice lines in this game are so good. That's why I think, I just, I know this is such a bad comparison, but I think that's why it's becoming my favorite is because it has some of the best parts of what I loved so much about Fable. Like it's got this whole beautiful fantasy world of the Witcher and you've got funny NPCs, you've got great quests, you've got side quests. It just feels like me in a game. They're underground. So we can go underground and there's all these plants. Gazpacho. Wraith, welcome in by the way. It is the gazpacho. It did look kind of cold at this point. Uh, men, menthol, welcome in. All right, so they're in here. What is this? Okay, we're going inside of here. I think they're, ooh, what? How are you gonna place a treasure chest? Not let me open it. Cast to play Gwent, I need it. It's been 10 minutes, I need it. <laughs> My fix. Keep that open. Must be on this side. Here we go. All right, so we're going to I'm find his daughter. Tamara, the bloody Baron's daughter. Your brother said I'd find her here. Voitex and you, sir. How else would I know she was here? It just feels suspicious when a game keeps getting better and better. Wait a moment. The trust issues. I'll fetch her straight away. Orange juice, welcome back in. I just love the level of detail for such a massive game. This cat doesn't hate me. Ah. Oh. Remind me to Who never shave again. Me? And who might you be? My father sent you. Yeah, to see if you're still alive and well. I'm Geralt of Rivia. I'm quite alive and extraordinarily well, Geralt of Rivia. Better than I've ever been in this rotten life of mine. And now that you've seen me, I bid you farewell. Oh, wait. We've nothing more to talk about. I thought it was Professor McGonagall with the cat. Yeah, we have to get away from the beer list. I need my beer back. Right back. I needed to return it. I'd rather shave some of my hair off and paste it on my face at this point. Father's worried about you. I don't blame you. Uh, she's younger, teenager, so let's appeal to... All right, we need to... Yeah. Your father's a vile man. You're angry and bitter. Can't Mind game you. her. Why did you help him then? Why did you take this job? Because he knows something about someone dear to me. Promised to tell me if I found you and your mother. Got it. A bit of blackmail. Just his style. Well... Now you found me, you can tell him I'm alive the and doll. I'm never The doll, we need to give her the back. doll. I do want to find out her side of the story as well. Stud Muffin, welcome back in. And also, wait, wait. Their eyes starting to twitch. We need more, <laughs> we need more Gwen. What am I going to do with four days away from Gwen, guys? And Ollie and JP, guys. Uh, let's hear her side of the story. Because I actually, I think the Bloody Baron quest is very curious. Like, it, it just, I think, sets up the pace for the whole game and shows you that the entire world of the witcher like they try to stay out of it but at the same time it's it's hard not to make judgments about the characters you meet and there's more to his story before i agreed to look for you your father told me his version of events tell me yours mine it's dull as life amidst the swamps my earliest memories are of a drunken father lying under the stairs caked in mud and clutching a bottle next mm. dozen years pretty much the same father would drink, disappear for days, then come home in a rage and send furniture flying. Thank the gods for war. I was glad every time they sent him off. And the quarrels. I remember him screaming at mum, the thuds as he beat her, then her mm. sobbing. I'd hide under my bed and long for silence. That's the long and short of it. Multiply by 19 and there you have my life. Finally, we'd had enough, mum and me. He crossed the line and we fled. Hmm. Uh, that's what I want to know why her mother miscarried. The deadbeat dad. Um, it was interesting though, because in her eyes, like, he said that he would never lay a finger on Anna. It was solely 
Like she, uh, Tamara, is it? Tamara was like the one person that could calm them down. It just is so interesting. I don't interesting. mean to cry, but I know your mother had a miscarriage. His doing? He shoved her. She fell. That's how it started. We were alone. But the curse. No one to the help. curse. Blood everywhere. Worst night of my life. Sorry. Must have been hard for you both. Mum was in shock. She was raving that it was better this way, that she never wanted the child. She must have had a fever. She was losing blood the whole time. She didn't want the child? Said she'd sooner cut open her gut than bear another child from his seed. Wojtek claims your mother had strange marks on her hands and that a monster dragged her into the woods. That true? The monster we is what I want to know about. Liver. Suddenly, Mum cried out, bent over, almost fell off her horse. I rode up to her and saw something strange. Her hands were on fire. And then that creature leapt from the woods. I don't know what it was, but it roared so fierce, my nose bled. I wow. saw it topple trees. I've never been so scared in my life. And that... that thing grabbed my mum and disappeared into the woods. I wanted to turn back, go after them, but the, the horses panicked. Now I don't even know if she's alive. She seemed pretty fine not knowing, though. I've got to be honest. She seemed pretty unbothered by it. But now I guess we'll look after Anna for her, so we'll figure that out for her. Minnie Cooper, thanks for the new <laughs> you. This turned into an episode of Dr. Phil. I was just thinking about, remember how I told you guys yesterday that I'm so impressed by not just the voice lines and the dialogue and the detail in each and every story. Like, yes, this is a main quest, but they're so well thought out. And then on top of it, like they're good at feeding you information, but I can't get over how incredible they do at the, the posture and the stances of every single character, you know? What will you do? What will you do now? find my mum you realize that oh she is trying to don't worry i'm not daft enough to believe i can do it alone i've got some new friends now powerful friends they'll help me what about your father let's ask about the friends first yes anna's here my only issue with the game is that there's like six americans and everyone else i think that's like the area and the location right though isn't that based on that and swid what's up welcome in and guys thank you for the follows welcome in the voices volumes? Yeah. Is that, does everybody, is that a consensus? Do you feel like the voices need to be raised a little bit? Who are these friends if it's not a secret? No secret. Heard of the Church of the Eternal Fire? A priest helped me contact the Redanian witch hunters. Righteous, brave men. They'll help me. Hence the candlesticks in your room. So you believe in the Eternal Fire? Once the heat of the fire has set your heart aflame, it gives you strength and leads you down the path of truth for the rest of your life. I hope it'll bless you with its warmth one day. Thanks. Thing is, fire's tricky. It's easy to get burned. What about her father? Yeah, it's fine on my end. I'm a little worried if I turn it up on my end, it's gonna be way louder. Dream, what's up? Welcome back in, by the way. They sound fun to me. The music is a little loud in comparison. I can, here, I'll turn the music down just to, a uh, little bit, because I think I hear that too on my end. What about your father? Who? Don't remind me, I shouldn't oh, have shaved him. him. Don't remind me. <laughs> I don't care. I know. I won't go back to him. That bit of my life? Forgotten it already. Well, well. Oh. <laughs> a witcher. Never thought the Baron would stoop to hiring a monster slayer. Though I hear you're good at tracking things down. God, he just looks like an asshole already. I can just tell he's not. Hmm. The warmth of burning you. The warmth of burning. You know, whenever I think about that, I think of the first episode of Castlevania. That's all I think about with Dracula's wife. The Baron's desperate. Who are you? True to you I know it will I grow vague still. Haven't introduced yourself though. Grada. Witch hunter in the service of His Royal Majesty Radovid of Redania. I'm certain you've heard of us. Rings a bell. If the Bloody Baron sent you to fetch his daughter, you'd best face it. You will fail in your task. I appreciate your I have concern, to say, though. But I don't need it. It's got some As massive tomorrow, shoulders. She can make her own decisions. Hmm. <coughs> Noble of you. Church of Eternal Fire. A killer for hire abandoning his bounty for the good of another. The Hunters and the Church of the Eternal Fire, thank you. So the Baron hired a witcher to find his daughter. He kind of looks like the guy from Sherlock, you know, in the first one with Robert Downey Jr., the 
the Lord Blackwell, I think it is. Where will you take her? The Baron's Jesper. We don't really need to find out about that voice line. Need some beard growth talks. Yes. Where are you going to take her? <laughs> Tomorrow must rest. I just She's don't get why. Experience. When the warmth of the eternal fire has restored her strength, we shall see about finding her mother. Before you go, your father asked me to give you this. Clara? Father told you to give me the Clara. toy. Funny how he thought to buy me back with a memory. Tell him one gesture could never make up for a ruined childhood. So long, Witcher. In spite of all, I'm... Well, I'm grateful you gave me a choice. Didn't force me to go back to the tyrant. Hope you know what you're getting yourself into. I should leave the toy so on the table. And good luck. I'm sure I will. Or maybe it will give us the option to. And this cat doesn't hate us. What's with that? Giant Frenchman? Nibbles. <laughs> There's got to be a reason why this cat doesn't dislike us, right? Mr. Nibbles. <laughs> smoking pipe all right well we're gonna loot her just because i'm i'm not gonna strawberries oh my god that looks so good i'm not gonna get anything from her father because i didn't bring it back so or i didn't bring her back so we might as well take all the money from her home netflix is doing the spin-off castlevania series focusing on really we're going back to more belmont i'm actually okay with that i hope it's good though do it yourself hold on i need to read this book for y'all mr Nebels. do it yourself how many times have you cursed a tailor for sewing a shirt more crooked than the infamous home in Novigrad? How many times have you argued with a smith who proved unable to forge a simple horseshoe in a month? How many times will you steal food from your children's mouths because some armorer demands a Koviri fortune for a ho-hum helmet? Enough! Basta, I say, and so should you, Basta. Empowered by the tome you hold in your hands and a few simple tools, you shall be able to perform basic repairs all by yourself and perhaps even create something from scratch. So show these extortioners from their crafting, oh wait, wait. So show those extortioners from their crafting guilds who shall make the fool of whom. Roll up your sleeves and get to work. <laughs> the Basta Casta. Oh, I feel like Basta is not a good use here. <laughs> the Basta Casta. <laughs> Anon, Brandon, and also TJ, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed the 70 months. And Homo sapien as well. Mm. Basta is Italian for enough, not to be confused with pasta. <laughs> Wait, so pasta, pasta. Is that even a question? Can you ever have enough pasta? I take it back, I take it back. Enough casta. Enough casta. Stop. All right. Oh. A dumpling and some dried fruit? Mm. Mm. No, Aries. Wait, I think I did, but what was it too? And Wally, thank you for that. That actually is very insightful. Uh, Casta is something for throw. I think it actually means... I remember looking it up one time, and doesn't it mean to throw or something of the sort? For anybody who's kind of new here as well, I know I'm picking up a lot of books. Well, what I'm slowly doing is reading them as I go, but I'm picking up as many as possible. And yes, I have a bunch of ladles, okay? Oh. A ladle for your thoughts, please. Cast is throw in Swedish, at least. Maybe that means in a lot of languages as well. This game did a good job at having witchers be cold and ruthless, yet Geralt ends up being very opinionated and political. Uh, I talked about this in the quest with the Baron, but you see this, like, just a, sw uh, a small, like, tinge of sadness when they're burying the Botulin. Another do-it-yourself. And I just, I think it brings him down a little bit more, and it shows you that, well, I think you guys told me that the mutation process or the, um, yeah, the mutation process is supposed to, like, null your emotions. It doesn't completely take them away. And I feel like that comes across in this. Maybe not in the books, but I don't know about the books. Craig, have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. And I will see you on Monday, hopefully. Okay, so wait, wait, wait. Why does Mr. Nebels like me? Why does he not hate me? Not that I'm miss being hated by cats i love it but i still feel Choked weird to death on three pounds of steel. All right. 
there is this right here. Do you see what I what see? I All right, I finished the quest like I promised. I well, I, I got to the next part. Today, say the word, I'll have it tomorrow. He's not gonna have it. Hmm. <gasps> Be still my beating heart. But let me see what he has in stock. Let first. me see. Might pick something. Mr. Nipples wants treats. Ginger wants treats. I think I hear her right now. Could be a shapeshifter or a witch spy. Oh, paint. Item needed to be complete. Wait, wait. Item needed to complete a quest. They show you when you need an item as well? That's amazing. Wait, that's fantastic. I'm really glad that they do that. That's such a small thing, but it makes a big difference, okay? Other than, like, instead of just running around to a bunch of different people, hoping you find the quest item? That's such a small detail. That is so cool. Only 11 deaths. What? When did I die? Oh, yes. I do remember now. I do. <gasps> Bug catcher. No. Were you just playing Dead by Daylight? Holy cow. Bug catcher, thank you so much for the raid and welcome in. And y'all, if you are here, we have raided her a couple times, but I absolutely love Bug catcher so much. She's a variety streamer. She does a lot of horror. She does a lot of Dead by Daylight. She's an insane uh huntress main i found her off stream one time and then i i looked her up because i saw did you i think you did have it in your title right so i saw that she was streaming and i and just ah oh, bug catcher thank you so much for the raids and guys please go check her out and also if you love candles go check out her candle company she owns a small business and it is the best candles you will ever smell and i am a candle connoisseur so i really mean that but guys, welcome in. If you're new here, my name is Maggie or Casta, and I'm currently playing my first game or my first, I guess my first playthrough of Witcher 3. And so we're just a couple hours into it, but thank you so much, Bug. Mm, how do you combat candle suit? Oh, that's a good question for, that's a good question for Bug Catcher. <laughs> Ernie, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Soul Drainer, by the way. And anybody who just followed, thank you guys and welcome in. Um, I have some of my alerts turned off right now just because we're doing a lot of story. We're doing a lot of storylines. But welcome to the game of Gwent, where all I do is play Gwent. A couple hours into the story and a couple dozen hours into Gwent. All right, look, guys. <laughs> I have a slight obsession. I also play Dead by Daylight in my off. I, I never stream like multiplayer games, but it is my preferred choice of games when I'm off stream. And so we need to play Bugcatcher. We do need to play. And you were playing heavy. Were you playing heavy rain the other day? I think you were playing heavy rain. But anyway, guys, yes, please go check out Jess and Jess. Thank you so much for the raid. And guys, with that, sorry if I miss anything, but we've Doubt got we need to wait till tomorrow. I've got to scratch the itch. I haven't played Gwent in like 20 minutes, so I need to scratch the itch. Jason. Tomorrow's Friday the 13th too, Jess. Oh, if I was here this weekend, we should definitely... Ah, we need to play Dead by Daylight soon. Regardless, we got to play. All right, we're going with Northern Realms. We're keeping with the same deck. Let's crush this guy. Bloody Baron's taken three streams and we probably won't finish today. Don't do me like that. X for Jason, Jason X. Not even that bad of a movie. I don't care what people say. It was my favorite one in the series. Uh, all right, guys, I say we ditch the clear weather. Keep catapult. I don't know, actually, we have none of our... I'm gonna ditch this guy. Alan, that's not Alan, that's Steve. Just a tiny bit. Thanks for the follow and welcome in as well. And yeah, guys, if y'all are new here, I like, um, I'm full variety streamer. I like cats, Taco Bell, the gym, and Chicky Chicky Lele. Yeah, we're back on Gwen. I think I'm going to remove the clear weather. Had the best kill in the series with the frozen head smack. The frozen head smack? For which one? Oh, gee, oh, you're talking, oh, when they get, on <laughs> yes. It was right at the beginning. We were supposed to watch it last October. I need to watch it this October. I know exactly the one you're talking about. I hated the one where they go to New York, though. That one was so strange. And Erdy, thank you so much for the gifted sub to RCT and Raven. Hold on. Is Erdy... I didn't get any of... I don't have my medics, and I don't have any of my spies. I think I can still win this, though. Dude, that's shite. Jason in New York? I don't think it was called Jason in New York, was it? Decoy that bitch. Decoy. My spy now, yoink. 
can exactly exactly jess have you played this whole game by the way and also sim simba lily thank you so much for the tier one sub i'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and community thank you wait and you also subscribed for three months wait thank you so much for paying the whole three month subscription thank you uh, that's a lot of faith in me <laughs> i really appreciate it i'm glad to see you're enjoying the community just one more game another spy i should have decoyed that spy oh oh all right he's going spy build let me go ahead and do that grab two cards and maybe i can get my spy back really really george have a good night thank you so much for your yeah aren't you on australia time get out of here go to bed simba lily thank you so much three months of gwent streams that's what it is it's investing in the gwent I see. Hmm. I don't know if I want to lose this. I need to bait out more cards, though, because I'm already... Mm, let's just full send. Jason takes Manhattan. That's what it is. That's the one where they go to New York. Simba Lily. Thank you so much. Loved finding your videos on YouTube. Oh, you popped over from YouTube side of things. Thank you so much. I'm glad that you're enjoying the content. And thank you for taking the time to come over from YouTube. I like Jason Tuesday. I'm just enjoying watching this because I don't have a good system. Living abroad for a year, next year I'll have another. Oh, wait, that's awesome though. Okay, so I baited out this card real quick and I don't have clear weather anymore. That's really cool. Living abroad for a whole year. I always wanted to do a semester abroad and I never actually did it. I'm gonna slow, mm. let's just, mm. I would rather bait out the torrent, the rain now than later, but still. Let's place a five in the front line. You're nuts. <laughs> With Gwent? No, I'm just at the beginning of it. I remember at the beginning of this when I tossed out my clear weather card. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Buzz, thank you so much for the follow and welcome in. You know, I think I know why I have this obsession with it, though, because I was the person in Fable that would always play the mini games. Like, I would spend hours making pies and, and blacksmithing. I would spend hours blacksmithing so I could buy up the entire area. I can still win this, but we're kind of matching each other in cards, and they're going to do a lot better than I'm going to do, I think. Pie, yes, you can bake pies in it. Yeah. You can bake pies in it, and then I would do the blacksmithing for hours so I could earn the currency to buy up the entire town, like all of Albion. And then after that, I would just crank up, well, in three, you can crank up the rent. So I would crank up the rent, charge them out of the roof. And then once I had enough money to own the entire like world of Albion, then I would go back down to low, like I'd lower it back down and the people would like you again. So you're only a tyrant for a little bit. You have to have a short stint of tyranny when you're playing Fable, you know? An unknown human, thank you so much for the tier one sub. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel as well. There's been so many new subs. Thank you guys. And also Corelli. Corelli, thank you as well. I didn't really play Gwent when I went through this game, but I'm enjoying watching it. This isn't a great round right now by any means. We're kind of matching each other and I bet he has a pair. He's gonna drop a pair, isn't he? I think I should pass, and then he'll have to play another card if he wants to match me. And I still have my leader. What does his leader do? The spies are really good. Die, welcome back in, by the way. Um, and Erdy, thank you so much for the gifted sub to die. Um, the spies, they do count for the opponent. So like the spy that he has on my bottom layer, right? So the spy, he plays this. So I do get an extra point, but he gets to draw two cards from his deck. So spies are really good because you can get more points or more cards. And so you see right now we have two rounds left unless I win this. And he's going into the next two rounds with seven cards. But he has two weather cards, so he's got to have some strong ones. I'm going to pass and he'll have to play another card if he wants to beat me, which will give us the same amount of cards in our deck, I think. Yeah. So he's trolling himself. And this is playing AI. <laughs> so he just trolled himself right there, but now he has four cards. Unless he has a couple more spies, this is in the bag. So I just need to win the next two rounds. That was so bad. 
Mr. Neevils. I need to go grab Ginger too, because I gotta run to the bathroom. All right, he is playing spies. He's got the spies on spies. He, oh, he used a medic. But that gives us points, so I'm actually okay with that. We're going into this round with the matching, and remember that my, all right, let me look at this. Witcher 3 is such a cool mini game. <laughs> something to do when you get tired of playing Gwent. That's pretty much the, honestly, the core of my playthrough, I think. It's just a little side of, side of Witcher 3. Pignum Penetral Fog. The fog's gonna apply to my archers, so let me go ahead and just play my one archer this round. Or, yeah, let's play the archer this round. I wish... Alright, so we're gonna pass and win. That feels really weird. So, he just passed... So now I'm going to take that victory. And because of my... Because of my allegiance or my region, I get a new card because I won that round. So what did I get? I got this guy back out of all the card decks. No, I'm awful at poker. But you know that I get... Do you see this? When have I ever been able to hide an emotion? Guys, the, I... <laughs> Who was I talking? I think Anna and I were talking about this. My face, like, is so expressional. I can't hide anything I feel. So I'm horrible at poker. My eyebrows betray me. Like, I would get a good card and it would just pop up. Like, <laughs> do you see this face? <laughs> All right, we're just gonna wreck his soul. We're about to end this man's whole career. And it's the one eyebrow. This one eyebrow is its own. It's its own. I'm sorry, I got this card back. I didn't get the two. So now we're in the third round. We both have one victory. So whoever wins the second one. So now I just place everything I have and I wish he had better ground troops because I want to smite his little tush. His little cheeks. Your face betrays you. I've heard that about my face before. <laughs> Also, you asked me about my Texas Roadhouse. So my Texas Roadhouse order is like, so I order first, like they naturally bring out, you know, the rolls. So then I order another thing of rolls and then another thing of rolls. <laughs> I'll have three layers of rolls, but I always get the, the floppy pickles. I always get the fried pickles. I always get the fried pickles and then I always get the, I think I just do the small sirloin. I do like the six ounce sirloin. Why would you place that? I always do the six ounce sirloin with loaded baked potato and they have actually have really good salads. Like the side salads are amazing. So I do like a side salad with a ranch and then a ranch for my salad. They see me roll. <laughs> uh, another one bites the dust. Also real quick, wait, I just missed. Nitz, I saw you've been here. Big man, big man, welcome back in. And also, wait, Ops, welcome back in. All right, another victory under the belt gotta give him the good old pp smack fire and more guys and both thanks for the follows welcome in y'all and Erdy, thank you for the gift of the wicked ops Ooh. we did win something from him right i didn't see the title of it oh dole was it dole dole blathana scout oh so he can be used for either the front line or the archers i'm not a Crazy about it. What'd you say? You can use your eyebrow for what? No, one of my eyebrows, like I can control this one or I can't really control this one. This one, it just pops up. It's like flying. It's like a little bird in the sky, just flying up. Look, my eyebrows, most people have very oh, like, I feel like What's some people this? have very symmetrical brows. I ran into a piano when I was younger and had to get stitches. So one of my eyebrows just like, Obviously, it just flies. It's like a solo bird flying out there. My eyebrows are not Defeat sisters. They're not twins. They are like distant cousins. They barely know one another. The there we go into here. This person might have Gwent. We do need to finish the... Oh. Never mind. Sorry. We do need to finish the Bloody Baron quest line today, though. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Dwayne Johnson eyebrow. Is that a thing? All right, let's go in here. No, my brother. Ah, oh, I've told this story so many times, and this sounds so. It sounds like I've messed up, like relationships with my siblings. Long story short, somehow I ran into a piano when I was younger, 
And then I just, it was like right on the corner bench of this like beautiful Steinway. And it was like right at the corner. My, my, a witcher. And then a week later, I did it to my other eyebrow. I get something interesting to do. Sure doesn't look like you're short on work. So this, the Redanian army order. But there's no pleasure in it. One after the other, same thing time and again. No finesse required. Looking to perfect your craft? Of course. Crafting's like Wait. plowing a maid. Fall into a rut and well, sure you'll get the job done, but there'll be no hoops, no hollows, no standard ovation. <laughs> so got any special requests for me? Help me stay on That form. is quite Still the uh, about armor, aren't we? Is that a metaphor? Uh, that was quite what the else metaphor. Would it be? <laughs> You're setting this up so bad, Ernie. Make it sound like I ran into piano as a kid, I didn't get <laughs> somebody dropped me during a trust fall. Like it just sounds like I had a horrid childhood. Falling out of bunk beds, just banana. Show me what you have in stock. <laughs> what did the piano ever do to you? That's what my dad said when I. That's like his prized possession, and I kept putting blood on the piano. Uh. All right, I don't think there's. Oh, what is that? A little tail? A little fur scrap? A little scrappy? Uh, let's see what he can craft for us. Actually, I haven't been getting any. Oh, hold on. Hmm. Do we go again? All right, again. Should we charge that every 10? Is it every 10 Gwent games as a marble round? Is that what it is? Let's hold play on. cards. Gwent wouldn't be bad. I hear, I hear little trill. Or I was hearing her, but I it wasn't her. So if it wasn't her, what was making cat trills outside my... Got into trouble as a kid? She's not... <laughs> uh, I feel like I didn't get into that much trouble. I don't think I was that much of a troublemaker. I had my moments, for sure. I feel like I was always getting injured. Like, I always got injured, but I've never broken knock on wood now that I'm going snowboarding this weekend. Oh, here we go. But I never broke a bone. I just feel like I should add to this with some coconuts and like a little. So sad I'm gonna miss marbles because of time zones. Well, would you guys, cause we are doing it late tonight. Would you guys rather do marbles at the end of tonight or like at the end of Monday or at the end of Mondays? Or we can save them all for Saturday stream. If we save them all for not this Saturday, but the next Saturday, it would be like 3 p.m. Eastern. You guys can stock up your marbles rounds because we're only gonna play one round of marbles if you do it today. Cause I'm not dying nine more times. Would you guys like to stock up your marbles? And why not today on Monday? Because I'm not gonna die nine more times from here in Monday. All right, we have two decoys. This is good, this is good. Replace this guy, good. No spies, one spy on the table and no medics. Replace her, I'm thinking. Another triple J. That's actually not the worst thing in the world. All right, let's crush this guy. You want to stock up, please? I stuck around just for the marbles conversation. Pie. I hope you have a great rest of your weekend. And yeah, it looks like you want to stock up. Can we start a poll? Let's start a poll. Dead Nitro, what's up? Welcome in. Uh, do you say it's getting dangerous now that I'm confident playing this game? I'm gonna have to turn the difficulty up to hard. Maybe on Monday we'll come back and we'll turn the Gwent difficulty up to hard and then we'll also... That's the dream card. He has the dream card. And you can't decoy it because it's a... That is such a good card. I've never... Oh God. I've never been attracted to a card. <laughs> I've never felt this feeling before. Oh. Counter offer or three games of Halo? You can't counter offer. Y'all are not in the position to counter offer. Oh, now that is my type of hero right there. Mmm. That means though. I need a hero. I'm gonna do a spy too. Although, I could have. Mmm. Mmm. It's a lot of trebuchets. <laughs> it's a lot of. She was a mysterious fellow. <laughs> The guard. She's attracted to a card and I can't even get a text back on baseball. <laughs> yeah. 
Gaslight, welcome back in. Orlando, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. <laughs> uh, he passed, by the way, so let's just uh, get a quick little swoop swoop. The only downside to this is I have to play two cards. Mm, I can play one and get one back, though, if I did a decoy. But does it keep the points? Yeah, I can play one, get one back, and then... I sh feel like I should wait because I bet he has more spies. So what's going to be the best for me? Let's do this. You know what I should have done? I think looking back, I should have placed one of my top guys. Gaslight. Gaslight, thank you so much for the five gifted subs to the channel and community. Thank you, Krooper, Blue, Rico got one, Ball, and Blue Orange. Guys, I hope you all enjoy the sub and the emotes, and welcome in. Thank you so much, Gaslight. That one worked. How come crazies didn't work? Crazy. I'm telling you, put on your, your Tinder, whatever dating apps, 401k and a Gwent deck, a stacked Gwent deck and skills. Okay, looking back, what I should have done was place one of these here. Maybe use my leader, maybe not. I have two decoys. I have half a mind to get a decoy back so I can go into the next round with more cards. But if I decoy, it does correct. If I decoy, I do keep my 14 points, right? Your value is reduced by the card amount. That's right. Okay, so let's pass now. Okay, I couldn't remember. I'm still learning the decoys, but y'all are right. The decoys are actually OP. What did I win? I cannot lose this guy. I want to get rid of him and I cannot lose him. Yes, I played Bloodborne. Bloodborne was the reason I got my PS4 actually a very long time ago. Okay, let's hope that he has some more spies. Hmm, this might not go as planned. If I place everything into this round, I can win. I can do this. All right, garbage patch kid. We way. Thanks for the stretch. Anyone else having problems with Twitch? Mm, let's do this one. I think. Oh, how do you guys not hear these? Oh, Gaslight, seriously, thank you. And hold on, I just missed that message real quick. I was stopping by for a minute, but I'm busy a night ahead of me. All right, all right, Gaslight, I hope I see you Monday. If not, have a great rest of your weekend. This is my last stream until Monday. So hopefully I see you Monday. But I was starting to look at my schedule for the month, you guys, like for content creation. And we're definitely going to have some weeks where we stream five days instead of four days because we have Witcher and we have Gwent to play. And Scooby Snacks, thanks for the follow. And Danny Boy, Danny Boy, welcome in. I think you might be the first streamer I ever watched years ago. Definitely remember it was Bloodborne I was watching. Really? Wait, have you been following for that long or did you just refi me? Oh, this person just ruined my whole night. Damn it. Let me get this back and pass this round. Because what are the odds that... Wait a minute, hold on. Things were played. So I played Bloodborne a long time ago. I did my first playthrough on stream and then I also did a BL4 run a long time ago. Draw an extra card at the beginning of the battle. Of all three battles? Or at the beginning of the total battle? So this is what we're going to do. We're going to decoy this card back. I'm going to let them win. They're still placing cards. Oh, we are definitely letting them win this round. I missed all the good old Bloodborne. Naughty Peach, Naughty Peach, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. And yes, I hope I see you Monday. I'm going to pass because there's no shot. I know I could have decoyed, but nah, I guess I probably should have decoyed this round. Yeah. Fiddlesticks, I should have decoyed that round too. I wasted a decoy. Unless he has a spy in this round, then I did not waste it. Purple Iron. Did you see my posture was like a gargoyle? Did you see that already? What's the point of... What is that card? Just a switcheroo. Let's all... Fingers crossed. Everybody cross your fingers. That there is not a torrential rain. Tarantula or rainfall. <laughs> uh, legendary. I hope you enjoy this up in the emotes. Mm -hmm. Tarantula. He cannot have a spy because the deck doesn't have any spies, but he used one. Drash, he used a spy at the beginning, right? 
I'm not imagining that, y'all. I could lose this, actually. There was one. It was the... He has one card left. I win. My leader. My leader. Was not the usual PP smack that I give somebody, but it's okay. Wait, what did I just do? <laughs> I guess I'm just using up all my cards. <laughs> now I'm just using all my cards. <laughs> Why did he do that? Nico and Sorin, guys, welcome in. Third day in a row I stopped by and your plank went. I can see, you guys have already been killing it with the memes. I already see all of the memes incoming. Anytime I tried to watch Maggie's stream in the last couple <laughs> months, went. Elise, is it fun to watch me play Gwent? Is it boring? Erdy with the gifted sub to Bylo, Bylo, I hope you enjoy the emotes. Mm, Erdy, thank you so much for all the gifted subs. The PP scrap. <laughs> he had no choice. He didn't have to play it, but he would have lost anyway. You always have a choice. All right, go back to our deck. Natty, wait, Nat, what's up? Welcome back in. Personally, I enjoy it. Stop by lurking. Please play more Gwen. MF or FM. Welcome back in. I feel, I don't know. I'm really entertained by Gwen though, but I think I think it becomes truly entertaining once the person understands it and you can see like the strategizing happening in real time. That's when it gets really fun. Like sitting here and watching me get better and better. It has to be a little entertaining. All right, I'm out. Bye. FM, thank you so much ah, as to me, well. To me. And I hope you enjoy the emotes. And Erdy, thank you for another gifted sub. Oh, apologies. <laughs> I don't think I really have people call me. That's got to be a new nickname, Borealis. Jennifer's Bay. Beware of trolls. Should I pick up all of these? I feel like. Oh, stop climbing on things. Hmm. I love how I'm like, stop Geralt, even though I'm only the one in, I'm the one in control of him and I'm actively telling him to stop. Okay. I feel like I should pick them up. Cause the more that I have on the map too, the more I can stumble on them. A troll's been seen. Monster in Oxenford. By orders of the most magnanimous ruler. Any itinerant monster slayer reading this notice is obliged to abandon any currently unresolved contracts and immediately devote himself to tracking and slaying this monster. The beast in question has befouled the cradle of human intellect, the city within the <laughs> whose territory lies the oldest of academies of learning, namely Oxenford. Okay. Beast in Oxenford. So the contract was before that. Woodland beast. And there's a swindler about... <sighs> Beware, there's a swindler. Oh, you meant Yennefer. Soul Drainer, I hope you enjoy the lurk. And thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, before I look at those. This this side of the <gasps> what if the bar, maybe Witch. the barkeep will play me. To the tavern. To the tavern. Um, I'll go back and read them when I do the quest. But in the meantime, I don't click on them because I don't think I'm taking on any of those contracts. But actually, I suppose we should go look. Milo, thank you for the follow. I'm glad you're enjoying the community. And Chad, wait, Chad, Chad, welcome back in. Artie, thank you so much for another gifted sub to Chad. Main quest. Oh, we've got a blue quest on the table too. Okay. I need to shape up. I need to start, yeah. Mm. So we need to go back to the Baron about Tamara, investigate all remaining leads in Velen and find the Baron's wife. One more round of Gwent, and then we'll go find the good Baron's wife. I don't know if I can apply the word good, but... Lucky charms. We don't serve lushes, shavers, caretakers, or students from Philosopher's Hall. Do I look like a, um, any of the people from that list? <laughs> Doesn't hurt no. to check, just so it's clear how things stand. Ginger so must be super sleepy. From... Rather not talk on it, all right. What's your poison? Pick your poison. Mm, I can get over how good. <laughs> so I just need to grow my facial hair back with him. Uh, I seen you made it to Novigrad making good time. No, this isn't, this isn't. Why does everybody think this is Novigrad? I guess when you're zoomed in, it does look like it, right? Or is Oxenfurt in Novigrad? Oxenfurt is in Novigrad? 
I'm still getting used to the map. One more round, that's something. Mind if I have yeah. a look? Spookish, welcome in. The cast of Beard Stream. <laughs> if I do a cosplay, it's gonna be me as Witcher with facial hair. You might me. Uh, I should try to sell some things, you're right. We're getting close to max weight. You make a good point. I need to go to a blacksmith and sell some of the weapons that I have. It's adjacent to Novigrad, okay, so it's near it. Right, because Novigrad is... Be still my beating heart. All right, let's go. What you selling? What you buying? Not with just anybody, and always for high stakes. With you, I might. Oh, guys, I think he's gonna be difficult. I'll play on your terms. I think he's gonna be difficult. Commander's horn. Special card is limited. Ah. Uh, well, I can't do any of these, but... So, maybe I should pull a commander's horn in there. I don't know if it's the best thing I have, though. Hmm. Let me go back to my things. He's gonna be hard to beat, I think. Maggie with facial hair, be still my beating heart. <laughs> mm, I think I should toss out clear weather. I'm trying not to lean on anything other than like decoys. I've never used a commander's horn before. Before. A commander's horn before. Before. All right, let's toss out clear weather. I really want to get villain. All right, we'll go back to the quest after this. I mean it. I played the Baron, so we did play the Baron. We got one decoy. We've got the uh, Broskis, Kira, Care. Oh, you're right, they are based on people. All right, we just pieced it together. We've met this girl for the first time. Last last stream, at the end of last stream. And Erdi as well with the Gifted of Angelic. Angelic, I hope you enjoy the emotes as well. Now you're right, so all of these people I will meet along my path. Wait, that's, a oh, here we go, okay. And we have a spy. I would say this is a pretty good deck. This is a pretty balanced deck. Let's stick with it. Is it a challenge time? Yes, we met uh, Kara at the end of the last stream. Yes. Some are also from previous Witcher games. See, I think the more and more that I play games though too, I really wish, like I like playing things in sequ sequ sequential order because I do like picking up on the smallest uh, like Easter eggs that carry through. That's why I'm really excited to go back to Ra or go to Ragnarok since we played all the OG God of Wars. I think that a couple of you guys have said that they make hints at some of the things from the original three. And also Slippy, welcome in. Okay, so he's starting out really, let's just go ahead and place this on the board. Possibly give him a win. He is a spy. I don't know if I want to, I'm gonna, hmm. Do we decoy the spy, use the spy, lose the round? Or should I hold out and see if he has any more? That'll give me 13 cards going into the next two rounds. We're tied right now for points. That's a high level spy to decoy though. Replayed the 2018 God of War. I just did that in like, oh, this was like July, September. Dresden, have a good night. If I don't see you Monday, have a great rest of your weekend or I won't, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for being here. I can't talk. Mm. Be aggressive. Yoink. I, I got the commander's horn off of that. And I have my scorch too. So I can, oh, he passed. Oh, okay, he passed. And I, okay, wait. Should I, oh, mm, I, this is such an easy victory. But I could also give it to him and I could get two more cards. So I could use the spoil, the spoil. <laughs> I could use the spy. And Peach is amazing. Have a good night as well. Um, my next stream is gonna be Monday. I hope I see you then. Mm -hmm. DK, DK the spoy. Why can I not talk? It's because I'm trying to talk really quickly. Spy boy? But I can also use the spy. The spy. 
my lips are going numb. That's what this is. Uh, I don't know. I kind of want to win the round. Yeah, I can easily take the round. But if I use the spy, that's giving him 14 points. Let's save the spy for the next time. Let's go ahead and place two mid-level characters. Hear me out. I know, I know. And then pass, and I get a card back, and then we'll go into the next round. So we already have a win, and then I can throw everything. I like having a win in the first round, because then you can absolutely put everything into your second round. And sometimes I feel like, he's baiting you? You think so? I mean, I guess when somebody passes that quickly. He has a leader, uh, no he doesn't. Wait, hold on, real quick. Uh, cancel your opponent's leader ability. That's not gonna be the best out there, but that's okay. All right, let's go ahead and start playing this girl. That was the card that I wanted. I gotta start with the spy. Why didn't I start with spy? There's definitely times in God of War Ragnarok where something happened and I went, oh, that's so obvious. And then I remembered it was not obvious unless you know about it, the myths. See, and that's why I really decided to go back and take the time to play those. Not only were they some of the most fun games I've played on stream, I'm just having fun playing the like blast to the past. But, um, I also just thought it would prep me for understanding, I think also just trying to understand Kratos a little bit more. The commander is not the best card to have right now because I don't have a lot of, wait. No, this is disgusting. Hero and a healer and a spy. See, this is why we should have saved our decoy and lost it. You can bait out a ton of cards once you will and they won't stop throwing out cards. The AI has been really, that's why I've thought about upping the difficulty before. I think I might pass. Hear me out. I don't have anything to steal any of the spies. And then I could go into the final round with these boys that will proc off of this commanders. I have a million of these and I also have the scorch, but I could easily scorch them, right? I could scorch that seven off of the table. Oh. Choose one card from the discard pile and play it instantly. No heroes or specials. Isn't that what she just played right here? Or she just played the spy. She pulled the spy out of it and that's why I have five more points. Mm. Ice, welcome in. I hope Gears of War Remaster Collection is a thing. D are they whispering about that? Because you know I've wanted to play Gears of War. I just don't know if I want to go back to the OGs. Didn't we talk about how it hasn't held up that well? Yeah, so I know she revived the spy. Mm. Play this round. I know my dudes. Oh, because I have so many melees and then I can use the commander sworn. All right, let's play at this. Yeah, I think I can win this round no matter what. But they have nine cards. Oh, you. Ooh. I think I did get played. But I'm still having 20. This is still boating okay. I say put everything into it. I think they're playing the long game and hoping for a third one. Dude, I haven't played Brandon, wow. And also Core, welcome back in. Um, I have not. I'm gonna put all my cards on the table. Wait, Scorch impacts me too. I shouldn't have played it. I should have done Scorch first. Oh. I'm not gonna get the proc on those guys now. That was such a bad move on my part. Commander's Horn can go on your siege too. You don't have... Oh, I didn't know that. Full sun this round? I'm interested to see if they're not gonna pass because they know they'll lose, so they'll keep playing everything they have. Another healer. That's not bad. They pulled a two out of that. Un. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do this one. Rumors are coming that there are two or three remaster remakes. Isn't it crazy how we're getting to the point where everything's becoming remakes? Oh, a 10 archer boy. And he has six more cards, y'all. Should I Scorch? Destroy your enemy's closest combats if the combined strength of all are his. This doesn't impact. Okay, let's use Scorch the next round. I'm putting all in. Oh, sorry. Torrential rain. 
Y'all, I don't think I can win this. But I could win if I go into the next round. I think I need to pass. I need to pass. I don't want to give up that easy, but it's five against four cards. Yeah, I'm going to pass. That was garbage. Keep Scorch into the last minute. Yeah, I'm going to Scorch on the next one. Oh, I got two more cards. He's playing the long run. Jones, what's up? Welcome in. He's playing the long run. I knew this wasn't going to be an easy battle because I think somebody said he gives up a really good card. I don't... I, I think I'm going to lose. I shouldn't have put all of... I knew he was baiting me. As soon as the character passed really early on at the beginning, he was baiting me. Okay. Scorch might save us. That might be our only redemption. <laughs> that might be our only redemption. Never mind. We're not redeemed. We're not redeemed. I'm going to use my... L oh, it negates each other. No! Oh! I should have placed it down lower. I know. Did I get to pick where that place is? They have two cards. I'm losing. No! No! I didn't... I, I still wouldn't have won if I doubled my siege, though. I still, like... It was 19 to 2070. 2070. 27. Perhaps you should come back when you've got a better deck. Or when you learn to play. <sighs> All right. Hmm. Let's go. Oh, I remember no, you. No, 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 no. it be? I remember Grand you. Point. Why not? I'm playing. How much did I lose from that? I'm going back. We're doing it again. The sass that he just... The disrespect. This is fun, though. I like when I get a little challenge. He's one of the harder quest players. See, I didn't realize he was a quest player. Commander's Horn. Okay, so we have Scorch in our inventory. We don't have our spies, which is kind of meh. Should I reroll Commander's Horn? He pee pee smacked me. <laughs> Ginger has not come out, y'all. Jones, thank you so much for taking the time to come over here. I hope you enjoyed that playthrough. I'm getting, I'm losing, I'm getting trash docked. So keep the commander's horn or no? No, the four is way worse. Okay. I don't have the double ones of these, so let me toss this one out too. Okay, we got our spy back. Castle losing and getting trash docked reminds me of the 12 games of Christmas that y'all lost. I recall you lost, sir. Redraw Sabrina over the four? Oh, because if I ever redrew the other guy, I could have had the bonuses on it. I need to hold my... Oh. I need to hold on to my... Okay. We're gonna hold on to the decoy. We're gonna bait out some more. Ginger sensed Mr. Nibbles and decided to get off. She's been hiding in my bed all day today. The picture that I post on Instagram, she's just slowly becoming one with the bed. And Anon, thank you so much for the gift of sub to Jones. Jones, I hope you enjoyed the ginger remotes and the sub, and I'm so glad you enjoyed the last of us playthrough. Um, all the marbles games would say otherwise. That's because I floppy pickled a lot. All right. Okay. Got some aloe for them. I don't want to steal his guy back yet. 14 to 12. Should I decoy and let him... He's got so many other spies, though. I feel it in my bones. Commander's Horn can easily get you 20 plus points in if it doubles a row. This is a pretty... With that seven in that front row, this might be the round to double that front line. I'm just saying. Actually, no, I'd get way more points from doubling my... But if he has rain again, you know he's going to have rain. Aries, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. And oh, I didn't see that. Thank you so much for gifting me a sub to Mars's channel. Thank you. I really appreciate that. I love her most so much. I love the high one. That's the best. Commander Sworn can easily get you. So I think we'll hold that for later. I would say we keep using... Should I use the commanders right now? Mm. I need to hold on to the commanders. 
I need to bait it out. Great, Ben. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Aries, have a great day at work, and I hope I see you Monday. Okay, he just placed a 10, but he probably can get his 10 back, if I had to guess. So, should I... Mm, we'll see. Anon, thank you so much for the gift of sub to Joe. And Joe, I hope you enjoy the sub as well. Welcome back in. Sure is getting a lot of use this playthrough. Not this playthrough, the lead. I barely floppy pickled after the first three days. Have a great weekend, Aries. And a good day at work. I mean, we're trading one card for one card. Yeah, I hate his leader card. Knowing his leader, I should have... I maybe should have played my deck differently. Decoy that and toss the round. You think I should decoy, like, his spy? But that gives him a lot of points. That's the only thing is I don't want to decoy that spy. I feel like I should play the five and just keep baiting out cards. I know I get two extra cards, but... That's a, he has, he's gotta have other spies. You say abort? Pass the round. Queen Persephone, welcome in. Yes, Gwen, decoy the next round until he revives. That's what I'm saying, I should hold the decoy for the next round. I know, but I feel like since I, I feel pretty strongly that he has other spies and decoying a seven that's a lot of points towards him and if i'm going into the next round already at a loss save spy for the next round he'll pass after you decoy tom what's up welcome in i just don't think the right thing to do is to decoy a seven spy although i could end his career with scorch too all right, I'm gonna follow track. Okay, we're gonna do this. I got another. He decoyed his own spy. I could place a six and make him place another card and we could just one up. Yeah, let's do that. Or should we place the spy and win? Let's place the spy, lose this round. No, 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 place the spy, lose the round, but win the war. Night City, it's not my fault that there's so much here. Siege and hope for rain. Do you think, do you think if I placed a siege, it would bait out a rainfall this round? Ooh. I like that. I like that. If it baits out rain, that's worth it. And this is why I was gonna hold my beak for. I'm definitely. You've been saying real. Have a great dinner. I'm sure I'll still be playing Gwent when you come back. <laughs> Thank you so much for hanging around, and I hope I see you Monday. So I consider Nilfgaard the best deck in the game. It basically autopilots itself. <laughs> oh. <sighs> I'm still gonna I'm <sighs> play the spy. He'll not play rain for one siege card. Oh, I got a decoy back. We can decoy a spy, y'all. Annie passed. Decoy this, uh, decoy my spy. Should I decoy the spy and win? I say decoy the spy and win. Decoy the spy and win the round. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Nits. <laughs> okay, so we got that bad boy. We have Scorch. Annie passed, so now I need to place a seven, uh, an eight. Should I just place this one? That cost me one card, but... Or do I place the Spy and I lose the round? But then I get two more cards for the next two rounds. There's two strategies. I either win, but the Spy is a front line and we know I have to Scorch at some point, or I'm going to scor Scorch at some point. Spy and lose. Win the round. Oh, Rob, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. No, don't place the seven. No, the seven is my Scorch. No, no, no. Adds enough that you can play this by two. 
I don't think so. No, I don't think so. Spy and Scorch. I feel like I should save the... Oh, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. So if I play the Spy and then play the Scorch, he loses all that frontline points, and then I get two cards. Plus, is, um... Is Novengrad... It's not Novengrad. Uh, Nilf... Is his deck Nilfgaard? Is Nilfgaard strong in the front line? Like in troops? The two. The two and a six. He could medic the spy back next round if you play that this round. He definitely has a medic in the deck. But wait, 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 wait. He could medic the spy back next round if you play it this round. But if I play it next round, he wouldn't be able to medic it back. I know, I can't believe- play the 8 and pass. I'm more inclined to play the 8 and pass. And also, I, is it Iron? Iron, what's up? Welcome in. And thank you for that tip. Mmm. Yeah, I feel like he will medic it. Alright, we're gonna catapult, we're gonna win. And then we'll see what happens. Ooh! I vote Spy Scorch pass. It is interesting. Oh, I got a medic! That's- this is awesome. No, 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 this is really good. So wait. Ooh. Okay. I should play the spy right off the rip, actually. Or no, I should wait for him to put a medic on the table before I spy with my little eyes. Oh, he's about to get PP smacked with my Scorch. It's a good thing I saved my Scorch for this round because you know he's going to get the bonus off of that. Yes, you could Scorch with medic. Yes. But if I spy next, he can medic it back. Whereas if I wait for him to place a medic, then he can't pull the spy from the deck. Lose this round, he'll use a spy. Yeah, now you can't bait out all of his cards this round, win the third. So should I just pass? Or you, I'm sorry, so okay, gotcha, gotcha. Use the spy, then pass, lose the round, win the war. Yes. So now pass. Yeah, that was my... No, I have a second decoy in the deck somewhere. Miro. Thanks for the follow and weave. Welcome in as well. His medics don't revive his spy anyway because he's on the table, not in the graveyard. She is Yennefer? Yennefer's only a level seven? Yennefer was a medic. We knew he was gonna medic it back. We knew he was going to medic it back. We knew it. We knew it. All right, so... I'll just start playing. I don't have the double up bonus from this. Did I already play two decoys? I thought I only played one decoy. The amount of spies in this deck... Disgusting. Mm, but she's a hero and a medic. That's true. So she's not a whole level 10, but she also is a medic. I feel like it would be hard to find the best of both. I don't know. I think we still have this. He has rain in there too, by the way, and he has eight cards. They're made up of spies. Anon, thank you for the gift of sub to uncle. Uncle. You decoyed the seven spy. Should I use medic and pull something back? No, Ginger hasn't been on the She hasn't been at the door. Hold medic. Another medic? They just get cards on cards on cards. Devgro, Devgro, welcome back in. And Micro, by the way, this is a classic nilf card. Now I see why everybody dislikes them so much. I mean, I only have everything to play, so I just have to do it all. He's got... I would do anything for a fog right now. Medic, use the medic. That does the medic do again. Should I use the medic now? Nilf is even more spy heavy than the northern region. Ugh. Choose one card from the discard and play it instantly. 
It's just gonna play something randomly. Yeah, it just revives the card randomly. I think I should do it. Use artillery. I also... He has nothing for me to scourge. But I do get seven points from that. I'm gonna lose. I mean, it's... Yeah. Such a garbage... I do get to pick. Such a garbage character. I mean, the best one I can do is Kira. I don't know if I can beat him at this point in time. Kira is the best I've got. Yeah, I think we're going to need to keep Sun. I took Sun out of the pile. So if I'm going to beat him, it has to be that. Yeah. You can choose who to re revive. For some reason, I thought you couldn't. Okay, I've got a different strategy to beat him next game. It just gives me one point. Oh, a double biting frost. Or in the middle. Yeah. He has three cards, though. Just lay it. Yep, there it is. Okay, but I can do this next one. Three rounds and I got it. I have the commander's horn for the archers. So I think we need to keep a commander's horn, but we Perhaps need to get a clear sign. When you've got a better deck. How about you shut up? <laughs> Master? What are you planning with that sword? I can't attack this target! I can't even smack no, him if I get I frustrated with him. You. All right, this is what we're gonna do. One more. Why not? But you know KT, my rules. what's up? Welcome High in. Stakes, always. This is what I'll we're gonna do. Mm. All right, so we are going to throw clear weather in there. Should I throw two clear weathers? I don't know, clear weather, and he's pretty heavy on the middle level, but that could hurt me as well. I say just keep the clear weather. I'm gonna murder this. Um, yeah. Really, what's up? Welcome back in, Kitty. Katie, I hope you enjoy the 70 motes. And Anon, thank you so much. And Queen Persephone, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, and Tom as well, guys. Thank you. I'm glad you're enjoying your time here. Uh, uh, uh. uh. Okay, so let me go back in here. Let me remove some stuff. Keep the decoys. Keep the commander's horn. I just don't have enough spies. Did you say I'm under arrest for a Gwen addiction? <laughs> uh, I promise I can stop at any time. I know I can. I mean, all that did was add a clear sun. I think I should add two. I put a fog in as well. Okay, we'll add some to the mix. Okay. Mm -hmm. Gwent is not only for Wednesdays. I did say that I was going to tone it back today, didn't I? Okay, after this round, we'll fully focus on quests for like 30 minutes, okay? Just like a little bit. I'm so shocked Ginger isn't here yet. Well, the leader ability is negated either way, so it doesn't matter which one I'd pick anyway. But this one, uh, to answer your question, Queen, this one doubles your artillery section. And Maris, thanks for the posture check. Uh, I'm never sitting right. Mm. All right, so this is good. We've got a decoy. We have an impenetrable fog to crush his spirit. So unless he wants to put a clear one on the table, but we don't have Scorch. Ditch this guy. Okay, this is a garbage. <laughs> no, I have my medic and my spy. I actually have a medic and a spy. So we know that he baits. We know that he does the bait and switch. <laughs> you never played any Gwent when you were doing a playthrough? I can stop at any time. Funky. <laughs> the chicken leg. Funky. Thank you so much for the 11 gifted subs to the channel and community. Why 11? That is my lucky number, but that's funny. Guys, I hope you all enjoy the 70 emotes and thank you so much. And Anon with the gifted sub to desert. Anon, thank you. And Funky. Welcome back in for 11 deaths. There we go. Now I have to stay at 11. It was for 11 deaths. Imagine if you died 111 times by now instead. Oh, well. <laughs> Trying to buy my deaths. Funky, seriously, thank you so much for the 11 gifted subs. Y'all, I hope you enjoyed the ginger remotes and welcome in to the cast of shit show. Okay, let's place it on the table. Always stay ahead by one. 
Saved it for after the main story. Probably wise. Ooh, I want to meet her. And it's probably for the best. You know what? I think the problem is I used my spy too much in the first round. <gasps> okay, we got spo- Decoy. Ah, uh, he stole my spy. I gave him my spy. That was a poor decision, wasn't it? Mm. Noodle arms are 11 inches. You think that's even 11 inches? <laughs> it's even less. 11 centimeters. Um, trivial with the gifted sub to 11 deaths. All right. And desert welcome back in. All right, let's see. Let me strategize with the cards that I have in place. I need to wait for a spy. I could place a six and keep him on his toes. <laughs> he must have two. He's got to have two. And also Russ, welcome back in and hello. And Anon with the gifted sub to Russ as well. There cannot be anybody here that's not subbed. You guys are truly bananas. Thank you so much. I totally forget to talk. So you're good. <laughs> oh, I've got to talk it through with my chat. It's how I got, I think it's how I got better so quickly. Like, I know I'm losing this round, but I definitely have grown a lot in the past, like three streams of playing it. So I'll take it. Now trap him with the fog. I think that there's going to be a round. I think a future round. Look at my cards. I would say stay on top of him and use the fog later on. Because if I use a lot of my archers this round and go into the next round with less archers, the fog won't impact me. And I could decoy, but I'm going to decoy a spy. Interesting. You think decoy artillery even for this? That is such an interesting move. He must have a lot and he's got to have like three spies left. And also Aurelia, thank you so much for the gifted sub to sister. Sister, welcome back in and I hope you enjoy the emotes. Thank you Aurelia and also Hugh. I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes as well. And George, welcome in. Uh, Amir, <laughs> what's your opinion on our Lord and Savior Amir? Uh, I think that he has the best portrait of Siri in his office I've ever seen in my life. That's the only opinion I have on him. Sister, it's great to see you again. Okay. I think... I have a fog to wreck him later. Should I place a four or should I decoy and lose? Decoy, use fog and pass. What? Use fog? There's already fog on the table. Why would I fog? I definitely don't want to use fog. No, I haven't played one or two and I need, I'm going to, I need to go to the store tomorrow on my way so I can read. Um, I'm going to try to read the first one on my weekend trip. I know Ginger hasn't flown through the door. She's feeling bad. Okay. This is what we're going to do. Pass and make him use the card. That's what I'm kind of thinking. I would rather decoy a spy next round than, than anything. Make him use one more card to win. He'll probably use a spy and then I can't steal it. He's throwing? He has to be throwing. I don't even know what's happening to the game anymore. Holy snap peas. He just played me so much, Bear. Thank you so much for the 50, another 50 gifted subs to the channel and community. You guys, Dinos, Farb, guys, anybody that just followed, thank you for the follows and welcome in. He just used all his spies so I couldn't take advantage of them, I think. Holy cow. Bear, thank you so much for all of the gifted subs and anybody that just got a gifted sub. I hope you enjoy the channel and community. He just passed, by the way. I'm so confused. He's Medic and the, the opponent sent those subs to distract you. 
bear's timing. A bear always like is strategizing the timing on those, I swear. Y'all, thank you so much for the follows. Bear, at least you did it when I was actually live this time. Thank you so much. I came back just in time. I just had a feeling Bear would gift. See Sienna. Y'all, I hope you give a big thanks to Bear if y'all got a gifted sub and just thank you so much, Bear. Anna, thanks for the follow and also Sentinel and Zuck. Anon, thank you so much for all the gifted subs. Why is there a hype train right now? Ugh. He used the four spies and he's still down four cards. Y'all, thank you so much for the level six hype train. Bear says hi now at the beginning. Bear will use an emote. Bear uses emotes from time to time again. Okay. Let me just place like... You know what? I'm going to use a fog next round anyway, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to use this guy because I'm going to place a fog and that's going to bring that down to one. So let's use this. And pass. And win. And then we should be fine. Bear is bananas. I, I have a, an emote called Bad News Bears and I can't even use Bad News Bears anymore. Victor. Victor, thank you so much for the reset for three months in a row as well. Time truly flies. Like, no kidding. All right, we'll see what I can decoy. Bear is actually Anon. I don't know, Erdy's been forgetting to put Anon on a few times, I think. Okay, so we know that he is Yennefer. He's gonna pull back his medic. Hmm, I should not be able to lose this. There's no way, right? <laughs> decoy the medic for two spots. Oh! Uh, I've still got it though. Oh! Oh, wait, wait, wait for him to play it. Uh, oh, we've got it. He's gonna ruin me? You can revive a spy, I assume? Yes, I can. Revive the spy. Oh, I forgot that his spies counted. Yes, no, we've got this. We've got this. Canadian Bear, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the channel and community. Holy beans, y'all. Thank you so much. All right, place this one. Okay. I should decoy the medic back. Decoy my medic back. Oh, I didn't decoy my medic. I didn't move it. Okay, maybe I trolled myself. No, I didn't. All right, place fog. That was so weird. He must have had a really terrible deck. Birdie has a non question mark. Spazzy. This doesn't line up. He threw in the first round. It just doesn't make sense to me. I almost like I've already won, but I kind of. <laughs> oh, that was so weird. He threw. I guess third time's the throw. Third time's the throw. He had a good hand, however, he ruined his hand by playing the fog. He placed all three of his. I don't like losing, but that don't mean I don't do it with grace. Oh, the as if. The prize are yours. You You've just been playing a while. Gotta know where I can find some interesting cards. In Novigrad, there's Oliver the innkeeper. He plays, though he's far beneath my level. Oh. Velen, there's the barkeep at the inn at the crossroads. Y'all, thank you so much for the hype train. Thank you. Whoa. MPO, welcome in. Streamer RNG <laughs> kicked my ass a few times. That was just the weirdest thing. He had no reason to use all three of the weather cards. <gasps> okay, everybody pause. Oh! Ah! We got her! <laughs> she's ours! <laughs> yes! And she's part of the Northern Realm! It's my first, this is my first, uh, what is it called? Oh, no, it's not. No, it's not. Not my first special, but still. All right, there we go. We got her. I can't remember who gives them the Thaler card, but he is awesome. So this is what, so, so far I'm still trying to, oh my gosh. And she's a play for every team. Of course she plays for all teams. Oh gosh. Okay. That's awesome. So the next deck that I'm getting close to be able to actually play would be what? Nilfgaard? 
We need more spies. We need all the spies. Uh, Presto, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. And also Aeon. Oh, man. <laughs> that was not a long... I got to work on making my gobbles longer. Okay, so what I need to do is focus on quest for just a little bit longer. No, I never... That's the weirdest thing, guys. I was never into Pokemon... Oh, sorry, dude. I was never into Pokemon cards. Yeehaw! I'm a cowboy! I was absolutely never into Pokemon cards. Or the game. Like, I've never even played a Pokemon game, period. Okay, we're gonna fast travel back to the Baron. So I'm gonna make... I'm gonna be kinder to myself. I think... I'm gonna be kinder to myself, and we're gonna fast travel to... Crow's Perch, and then where's our thing here? Western Gate. Okay, so we need to go back to the Western Gate. We need to go back to the witcher? Baron. Are you a witcher? Do you think the hairdresser nice. would play me in a game of Gwen? Take a bad unit card out of the Northern Realms? Oh, because I just placed another one. You're right, because I placed another one. I almost missed that. Always be kind to yourself. More Gwent, please. <laughs> this is just becoming a Gwent stream, isn't it? I already see it happening. All right, let me fast travel here. Uh, joke, what's up? Welcome in. Take the Yarpins card out. It's so bad. The Yarpins. Wait, let me look at my deck. Um, Ollie. Wait, Ollie, thank you so much for the Prime sub. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and community. Thank you for choosing to use your, your Prime here out of all places. I really appreciate it. My what guy? Oh, you're talking about Yarpin? But because I got Yen, I was able to... Okay, yeah. Yeah. Yarpin is like a thorn in my side. He kept popping up every time. Ice, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Come on, cast a minute. Gwen is so much fun. I've been admitting it. Spoiler, the best way to beat the main quest is to collect all the Gwen cards. I mean, that's not much of a spoiler since Gwen is the main quest. <laughs> Spazzy, you're definitely onto something. Spazzy, thank you so much for the 100 bits. I think this is really becoming a Gwent playthrough with a side of Witcher. It's kind of like... Can I just beat people up? Yeah. Yay. Yeah. Oh! You've upset the guards, they might attack you. Okay. Fair enough. Do you think I... This is the only person I've ever lost to, multiple times. I've yet to beat Yo Joanna. I've yet to beat Joanna. Oh. Hmm. Mm. Have you said, Rumpel, what's up, welcome in. We're pretty mad when my dog came with them. Wait, what are you talking about, Schmeagle? You can try, you have the melee scorch. I do have the melee scorch now. It's possible. But let's talk to the Baron real quick. Do a bit of story progression and then we'll come back and talk to her. Just a little bit of story progression. Add more, what's up? Welcome back in. Everybody's so scared of me. All right, they're so immature. Baron's guard. I love just the noises that they all make whenever you pass them. You take your money and beats you up. That girl wrecks me every time. Uh, she is, she's the first monster. I think we fought one other monster deck, but the other monster I'm deck listening. we fought didn't have half of what, what she you had. Come to me with? If you guys want to see it, ooh. Rogue status, Rogue, I hope you enjoy the emotes. Um, all right, so we have a couple things to talk to him about, but how do you wind up here? I actually do kind of want to know how he winded. Let's, let's exhaust his dialogue. Being witches and villain? He's definitely an interesting no character. Peasant babbling. Common folk see witches, wizardry, devils, and who knows what the fuck else, every which way they turn. Yeah, we'll have to throw in. Well, with Scorch and a Blizzard, we should be able to negate um, a lot of her cards. Plus, I've seen her deck twice now, and I've come back with a lot of things. I didn't have Yennefer before. I didn't have the Scorch. I think I can beat her now. How do you wind up here? Just curious. Exactly, Queen. It's no secret. I was a Temerian soldier. More units smashed at the war's start. Soon after, we'd lost hope of regrouping, driving the foe back. Mm. Those who remained wandered north. Others, deserters or merely broken men, joined us. We were a snowball rolling down a slope. By the time we reached Crow's Perch, I commanded a sizable force. Just march into the fortress, make yourselves at home. 
With Nilfgaard advancing, the local lord had fled, abandoned the perch. Once yeah, this rogue. war's over and Nilfgaard's victorious, the Black Ones will grant me a title. All talk of a self-proclaimed baron will cease. Oh, I didn't realize he was self-proclaimed. Maybe I missed that in dialogue earlier. Uh, Spazzy, enjoy the gym time and frogs. Have a great night. I hope I see you all on Monday. If not, have a great rest of your weekend. And I guess a great start to your week. I'm so excited because we didn't do a Monday stream this week. So I'm so excited for next Monday. And we'll be back to Witcher. Use Frost against Can't Monster Deck instead of why you made a deal with yeah. the Guardians. Yeah, what for their... What could I do? For their Cast stabby troops. at them and die a hero. Fuck a hero's death. Fuck death. Rather live as a mm. traitor. Ere long, none will remember it. Temeria is no more. Happy no Gwen team. Drugs, thank you. The local Nilfgaardian garrison doesn't look that strong. What of it? Even were I to attack, cut them down to a man, others will come soon. Black ones will flood this land, mm. take control before long. Sure as we've all got arseholes, they will. <laughs> all right. Okay, so back to the quest line, though. So we gave the daughter this. Gave Tamara your gift. How'd she react? Probably not like you'd have wanted. She threw the doll away. Mm. Threw it away? Gods, I hoped, despite all. Oh. Yeah, I need to remod Doug. <sighs> but what of Anna? Still don't know anything specific, but I'm on her trail. Well, For will Sarah? you stand there like a knob? Find her! I mean, I think this is going to end with neither of them coming back, even if we find Anna. Ooh, I don't know if she's going to be alive or not. Whatever this beast was that stole her, I am intrigued by that, so I'm excited to find out the answers behind so that long. so long farewell lord trapula i haven't seen you in so long welcome back in and jink as well no eu friendly streams this week but next week we will next week we'll be back to my normal schedule so yeah this week's been a little crazy but next week we have monday wednesday saturday and sunday i'm thinking about making sunday next week an eu friendly stream as well and legendary welcome back in i shaved his face we're not going to talk about it okay I'm never shaving him again. Never. I will shave it for later. All right, wait. Let me remod Doug real quick, and then I'm going to run to the bathroom, and I'm going to grab Ginger. We'll do a quick Ginger break. And also, V-Trip, welcome back in, too. All right, so remodded Doug. And Blue, what did you say? I like how you are in quest dialogue and just thinking about Gwen. Is it obvious? Can you guys see it in my face? I'm sitting here strategizing my next Gwen game. All right, I'll leave the music up because should I leave you guys in the Gwen music or in this music? No, I'll leave it in this. What was the dad joke? What dad joke did I miss? Your Gwen streams have ruined my sleep schedule. Oh my gosh. I would say that how many hours do I have in the game? Hold on. I feel like at how many hours I have in the game, I've still done a decent amount of time. Okay, we're, we're finishing up the Baron quest on my sixth stream. Yeah. No, I haven't done the cure quest yet. I'm holding on. I'm holding off on doing the cure quest. You're sizing up if they have cards or not. <laughs> wait, wait, something about EU friendly stream. As an EU, I welcome EU friendly streams. Runkle, welcome back in, by the way. Okay. Googling Gwent strategies. Okay. Oh my goodness. Look at that. It'd be a squeaky toy today. Oh yeah. Is that so? Okay. Can you keep them? entertained for a little you gonna hang out with them all right i will give you guys dinner and i will be right back y'all all right Gingy, keep them entertained i'm gonna run to the bathroom i'm going to the bathroom he's so cute he's so cute showing off your short tail oh get those scratchies get those scratchies <laughs> all right i'll be right back
trick or treat? <gasps> Did somebody say treat? Are you gonna give me my chair back though? So if you give me my chair back, I will give you treats. How about that? How about that deal? Ertie, Ertie, thank you so much for five more gifted subs to the channel and community. <laughs> Can I have my chair? No. Oh my, it's like clockwork. It's like clockwork. Really? Every time? We're just going to start. You're just going to sit? Oh, okay. You've made me do this. I didn't want to do this. She sits. Do you realize that she stands right until? Yeah, she's just baiting out snacks. <gasps> Is this what you want? Oh. Look, she's not even getting up. <laughs> she won't get up. <laughs> she's keeping her chair. Game <laughs> over. There you go. There you go. All right. Who's giving you treats today? You get five treats. Okay, a fat treat. <gasps> Say thank you, Aravind, Val, Raj. And hold on, I'm going to scroll back. Can I have the seat? Take the seat. I'm going to take the seat from you. I love you. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I love you now. But I love you. I won't be tempted by your delicious trickery. <laughs> yes, she will. Just like I don't play Gwen all stream long. Okay, hold on. Also, wait, I saw sound and zen. Guys, thank you for the ginger treats. Okay, you ready? You hungry? You hungry? Here you go. Oh my god, giddy, giddy, oh giddy. <laughs> I have to hide behind her so it doesn't choose to look at me. All right. Guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome to the channel and community. Oh, you just batted it down. You can't bat it down. Okay, I gotta hold on to you because you're yeet. <laughs> um, ma'am, that is not your treat. That is my finger. And now I just don't feel it anymore. It fell and all she ate was my finger. <laughs> you're so sloppy. You're so sloppy. <laughs> <laughs> she's like that's not my finger that's not it okay two more because you dropped two how could you drop two <laughs> my cat's looking over at her right now <gasps> what kind of cat do you have ginger doesn't even look like she's 16 she's so young all right get two more <laughs> you good finger licks Finger licks? Okay. Where's your other treats? One more because you dropped it, but that's your fault. <laughs> do not fall, please. Do not. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> do not fall. She's dropping them on purpose. You're right. She does go straight. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you looking at? <laughs> it doesn't even hurt when she bites my finger anymore. You have Scottish folds. Oh, I think those cats are so cute. All right, I did get her one more. I don't even feel it anymore when she bites my thumb. Okay, I see. No more. Don't you look at that thumb. Don't you look at that thumb. Okay, that's all you got. You got six. You actually got more. Okay. All right, ready? Torloni. And now we give her two aliens. Alien. I have to do alien ginger emotes. Alien. <laughs> She's like, oh my goodness. Alien. It's so much better when you're like underneath her and you see her from like looking up. Alien. <laughs> I gotta make a ginger alien emote. That's what we need to do. I love you so much. I love you with my whole heart. I do. You gotta pay the troll toll. Guys, thank you so much for the cat treats and all the new faces and follows and also Nay. Nay, thank you so much for the reason for seven months in a row and welcome back in. All right, Ginger, will you help me win this Gwent round? Is that a yes? Is that a yes? <laughs> you did a yes. She's like conditioned by fingers. <laughs> oh, this light paw to you. That's what you want. 
Okay. You want to say goodbye, chat? Say goodbye. Say thank you for my treats. I leave now. Sign Ginger up for Gwent. <laughs> we'll see if she'll play with me. I doubt she'll play. But. Ow. That actually really hurt. Do not smell my finger. Mm -hmm. No. Joke. Um. What? <laughs> what? Uh, I've been having chat kind of help me with Gwent. We're kind of playing it together for the most part. What? What is your favorite color? All right, let's actually go ahead and that back. Hold on. I need to grab this real quick. Ginger Marigold. All right, you are going to hang out with me while I play Gwent. Frogs, what's up? Welcome in. And fully fresh and everybody that just followed while I was... What are you doing? Thank you guys for the follows out here you just like smells you like ran, smells ran, pan, she was ran, licking a cheese it earlier hold on i like it i like it yeah ginger actually used to be even more like bright orange but you know when cats get older sorry you know when cats get older and they kind of like fade a little bit I think it's because she's been laying in the sun too long. How she's, can I help does you? nothing but sunbathes, but... Uh, no, we haven't... Well, we've met Yennefer. Wait, I, I don't know. I've, I haven't met Triss, so I don't I don't know her yet. <coughs> Your boy, what's up? Welcome back in. Hello. Mm. Is Ginger team Yen or Triss? Yen or Triss? Which hand? This is... This is Yennefer, and this is Triss. Which hand? Which one? You have to decide. You have to peek. Really? Nothing? Are you gonna peek? Oh. It's Team Yen. It's Team Yen. She likes Siri. She's neutral. Triple fisted. Triple. A wise man once told me. When you- wait, 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 what? It's Yen. The answer's always Yen. Uh, when one door closes, another door opens. Other than that, I'd say it was a pretty good car. <laughs> Triple fisted. Thank you so much for the reset for nine months in a row, and welcome back here. What are you doing, by the way? Are you gonna, like, hang out with me? I'm about to play Gwen. Are you playing Gwen with me? Okay. Okay, guys, so this is the monster one, but... Wait, that's so cool, Admiral. Are you gonna do it? You have to do it. You gotta go. You gotta go. Are you team Anna? All right. So for this, we're gonna remove the impenetrable fog and the clear weather, and we're gonna place the biting frost twice. I'm gonna increase my chances of getting biting frost. Well, we do have scorch, but yeah, let's increase that. Because I also like cats and Taco Bell fully fresh. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place. Thank you so much for the follow earlier, and just thank you. And also, wait, wait. Is it Skurser Witty? Skurser. I'm gonna say Skurser. Thank you so much for the follow and the Prime sub right off the rip. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and community. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Thank you. I'm so glad that you're enjoying the community. Both Yen and Triss are toxic. Geralt deserves better than him. Geralt deserves... I don't know what Geralt deserves. I haven't... Oh, we have Yennefer, too. I don't know him enough yet to... F oh, let's toss this. Toss it. Oh, okay, I'll take that. Uh, I'm a Domino's kind of gal. I like uh, Papa John's. I'm a Papa John's. But I do like Taco Bell. And Fully Fresh. There have been so many new subs. Fully Fresh, thank you so much for the Tier 1 sub as well. And also, there have been so many gifted subs. Either way, thank you guys for the support. And I'm just, I'm so glad to see you guys are enjoying this channel. And Ginger? <laughs> she's just sitting on me. I've never seen her do this. I think she's, she's trying to bait out treats right now. This is catastic. Okay. So monsters don't have a lot of spies, though. So let's actually go ahead and throw out our spy. Let's go ahead and just make him believe. Make him believe he's got a chance. Geralt and Yen deserve each other. You'll notice that more when you delve into the universe. So I'm going to pick up that first book, you guys. <laughs> I'm 
I'm gonna pick up that first book that you guys talked about. Oh, guys, I got Scorch. That is the power of monsters, but they don't have a lot of cards. So I'm gonna actually pass the round and I'm gonna save my stuff for other rounds. I do kind of want to end their whole, I'm gonna end their whole career. Um, should I decoy back? I, they don't have a lot of spies to begin with. So I feel like I should decoy back my one person. What are you whining about? Are you, oh, can you not move? What are you doing? Why are you getting grumpy at me for no reason? I can give you treats. I do. Hold on. Scorch him right now. The thing is, Ginger, too. Man, Raj, you gave her too much credit. She doesn't even remember she dropped the treat. Hey. Hey. Here you go. She doesn't even remember. Decoy him and throw. I'm thinking decoy, get it back, and then I still have one more decoy. I could frost, I could scorch, but I think I'm gonna need them for the next rounds because the monsters notoriously don't have a lot of cards to begin with. They pull a lot of cards from their deck because of the like front line, but I'm actually gonna pass. Yeah, the opponent passed. I guess if I frosted it, I could win. Oh my God, wait, no, I should have frosted, right? If I, <clears throat> if I frost. They all go down to one, and then I can just place one more card and win, and then just place everything on the next one. Yeah, let's frost. But it still gets doubled. Remember, it's still doubled, but all I have to do is beat 14. So let's just place, I should have decoyed earlier. Um, We know that we're gonna scorch. I could double that up later. I also, okay, so I don't wanna place any, mm -mm. uh, Scorch. Oh, and then also Scorch on top of it? See, I think I should save Scorch for the next round. Decoy the, decoy the decoy? Oh, decoy the Scorch. I see what you're saying. But I still don't think I have enough points to win, even if I... Even if I Scorch, I wouldn't have enough points to win. Use one more card, then decoy them back. Pass or use Frost. So let's... Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Oh, but I get points from that. Oh. Oh. So then decoy my Scorch. And then just place like a five. Oh. I see. Matt, thanks for the follow up. Okay, Ginger's happy again. And then pass. And I have one point. Oh. That's disgusting. Scorch end ended the monster's whole career. Dro, thanks for the follow welcome in as well. All of his cards have the same strength. Yeah, and then I'll be able to, ho oh, ho, oh, yeah, that was dirty. All right, let's just win this round too. Mm-hmm, it was really lucky that I got Scorch. I haven't even played Yennefer yet. And what is, uh, hold on, let me, I need to get well acquainted with all of the leaders. This one's Sauron, I always love Sauron. Double the strength of your close combat units. <laughs> He's got nothing. Oh, that's a vicious leader. Why do I feel like we're gonna win a leader from her? I really hope we do. Hoth, oh, thanks for the follow up. It's not really good. I can't scorch that off the board though. If you go to third, you can win with her. Mm. I think we can just win at this game. I don't think we need to do anything. And I get to revive a card. So unless they have insane weather, like an insane fog deck. That is, how many leaders are you allowed to have in your? They have two cards left. Well, I can't scorch that. You think pass right now? I have two of this and then I also have my leader, but that could all be derailed if they have one. Yeah, try and win this round. Bleed them even more. They'll play their last two. That's what I'm saying. Oh, you're saying if I pass right now, they'll still play their last two? I didn't realize you can have as many hero cards. That is, so basically at the end of the game, but you've got to play harder people. Like doesn't Gwent scale as the game scales? I was thinking play the six to bait out one more card. Yeah, cause if I bait out at least one more card, we know they have one card. 
they have one card left. Should I skip? Or bait out both? Actually, I get seven points. I might as well just win this round. Bait out the last one? Yeah, all in. Yeah, there's no point in taking it to a third round. That's fine. We're just gonna Scorch, that gives me seven points. And then I get to double up my last guy. We passed, barely. Barely, but we didn't have to take it to another one. What are you doing? You're just being creepy in the background there. Yeah, so the monster, I don't know. A lot. Somebody said the monster was one of the most OP decks, but I don't, you're, I feel like your entire career is derailed from one frost or anything else crone. A crone. Another victory under the belt. And like I said, every time I say that I'm gonna focus on quests here, we end up here. I know, right now I'm cocky. I know it's not gonna last. A crone. Looks like Nautilus's sister. Used to be wagon showed on market days. All right, so we need to go find Anna. Huzzah! <laughs> Huzzah. I wish I could just put Gwent music on even during the main game. Maybe I'd play more of it, you know? Monsters are OP. See, I just, I feel like I want to go Nilfgaardian because I really like the just... Spy is such a dirty and fun parry, and I think. Like, you get to place it, you get more cards. I just want to be able to have endless cards. Like, remember when the guy at the tavern just wrecked my soul? I want to be that person that wrecks souls. The soul wrecker. Sly, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel. I actually, is my main quest? Investigate all the remains. Leads in Velen and then find Baron's wife. What, uh, what leads are we missing? Is the best deck aside from the Northern Kingdom? I actually think that, I think they start you out on a really good deck. I personally like the Northern Kingdom. Wait, I saw something about. Franz, welcome in as well. Uh, Nilfgaardian, definitely the best deck aside from the Northern Kingdoms. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the monsters, but I would like to master learning to beat people with all of them and not just be like a one deck kind of gal. Using one crone pulls out the other two if you have them. Yeah, the monsters multiply. That's the scary part about the monsters is they can easily, even though they might not have, because that's, that's what kind of almost gives them a lot of extra cards in their deck, right? So if you get multiples as the monster, then you can win a lot easier. All right, so we're doing this. Investigate all remains, le uh, all remaining leads in Velen to find the Baron's wife. What are the remaining leads? Is there something that I'm missing here? Hmm. Did I ever do? Did I finish Shiri's quest, by the way? Oh, guys, let's do this Woodland Beast real quick. No, that's the Bridge of Novigrad. That's a long way away. Talk the crime. These are back where I was. But with the Scorch or Burn, you can easily destroy all those cards in one. That's what I'm saying. That's why I'm like, I feel like the monsters can be, but you have to know who you're going up against. So if you go up against somebody that has Scorch, and you can get Scorch for any deck that you play. So actually the deck doesn't even matter because Scorches can go this one. Investigate all remaining leads. Oh, is Kira? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're right. Kira is our last lead. You're right. I think I have to. I think Kira is the lead that I'm looking for. This is not the lead you're looking for. Yeah, we met Kira at the end of last stream. Uh, you started the quest and stopped after meeting her. Yeah, so I think that's my next part that I need to go. So I need to go back to her. So instead, I think it will all lead to the same thing, right? So we need to wander in the dark. To the dark. All right, let's go over here. So to fast travel, I could go to mid... I want to call it mid corpse. All right, so let's go out and go to mid corpse and then go from there. I didn't see a secondary quest by her. <laughs> Have you done the devil's pit? I don't think so. I don't think I have swords from the Netflix show. Maybe I should send you man to the creek. 
See, I need to go back and rewatch the Netflix show, but we're starting with the books first. So we're starting with the books first. Real welcome in. Sorry, what? He just said try to win them all, but I won't. There was a secondary quest for... Oh, Wild at Heart. That is the secondary quest for her, right? Because my main quest is Wandering in the Dark. I guess do I just need to complete any other... Defender of Faith. Fix all the damaged shrines. Fist of Fury, Velen. Gwent players? Gwent players? The Midcorps. I know, I just want to call it Midcorps. Mm hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna do... Hmm, I think we should take on this wild at heart real quick. Hold on. While muddling around in a well-shaded village of Blackborough, Geralt happened across a notice. It stated a hunter named Neelan was looking for help he could help get to finding his wife, who had disappeared in the nearby woods earlier that day. Geralt, also deep in a search and rescue vein, decided to help find the poor woman. Let's go do this side quest real quick and then we'll go back. Yeah, because actually this takes us one step closer. Yeah, this is my first Witcher and first playthrough of this. Python, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. I'm excited for that area. Like the surprised. amount of times that I hear I this. A Novigrad whore. I feel like I hear it every single time we're in this game. All right, so we fast travel here. We finish this quest and then we go and meet Kira. Wandering in the Dark is such a good quest. I think that's who, that's gotta be the next quest line for our person. Buy in or just peruse Tamaria, please. Show me what you've got on offer. I don't know who I've played and won from and who I haven't. I need to start leaving. Uh, you so know what we're going to do? That's, what we're gonna... That's actually really dirty. You can't tell who you've played against before. All right, replacing custom. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're going to place custom markers. No, that's why you got to play. Well, actually, you would be able to tell because that should be that should be blacked out. Yeah, see, see, see. Okay, they're not yellow, so I played them before. Yeah. So long. Hmm. I've got to play as everyone. Except I don't know if I played this person. If it's grayed out, yeah, I've already played them. It says that there's somebody right here. Maybe it's the time of day. Maybe because it's six o'clock, they're not here. I know there's so many quests and you're like, Maggie, put the Gwent down. Sorry. Roth, what's up? Welcome back in. Yeah. All right, yeah, so I've played this person as well and that means I bought so from long. this person as well. Okay. As long as I actually stick with playing against them, when I meet them, then that's a good method to go by. Otherwise, you could play them, lose against them, and then have to remember to go back. Oh, I'm here. Yeah, Maybe the I'll area is blacked out. Okay, here we go. Looking for a hunter named Neelan. Find him. We're gonna help him want? find his wife. Your wife's missing. Hear about your notice. I'm a witcher. When do you last see your wife? My hair needs to grow back or today. Before dawn. On my way out to hunt, she were asleep. We come back. I'm no sign of her. Hmm. Noticed anything strange? Notice anything strange? Maybe her behavior? No. Gunter. She were her happy, smiling self. Nothing different of late. She's not run off, if that's what you're asking. I want you to slowly put the Gwent down. Oh my gosh, Ginger's passed out. Maybe she went to the neighboring village, forgot to tell you. No. My sister were never gone this long before. Tried looking for her? Asked around the village, none saw her go. I'm just saying, when your sister-in-law looks see. like that. No, I'm just kidding. Told her time and again not to wander off on her own. She never listened. I must have some men folk with scour the woods. Nothing. Sometimes you have to be shaved for certain quests. I hated those. It feels weird. Like, I don't like it. I feel like he's like a dad. Monoxide, welcome back in. And also Dark Gale, welcome in. It gets annoying at times when you get further on. Oh, I do think there's a lot of Gwent games. Might have missed something. 
Like, there's no denying that it can be she have any exhausting if you do it too much. Keeps to herself mostly. I think I played three Watches rounds. The blacksmith's young ends of times. And in the village, Glenna, the butcher's wife, she likes her best. Thanks. I'll try to find her, but no promises. Aww. Margaret. Let us mourn in peace. Sorry. Okay. So we're headed out over here. I know, I, I don't... What other game puts so much effort and just heart into the dialogue of side quests as this? Is it Glenna? Greetings, you Glenna. Hi. The gristle and marrow is all I'm willing to sell, and you'll have to wait till I'm done carving it. Butcher and Velen somehow seems a luxury. You the butcher's wife? Butcher? Please. Might have called him a butcher when we lived in the shade of Novigrad's walls. Now he deals in carrion. A brawl who animals. needs one? Their bones still fit for soup. So, buying something? I don't. Uh, she's got the pasties, okay, Anna? She's got the pasties on. Wanted to talk to you about Hannah. <laughs> Here you were friendly. She Quest. come by at times? We talk? She seems strange lately. Any idea where she might have gone? Hmm. Strange. No? A cheerful soul always. If I'm to judge, it's the wolves got her. Been howling the nights through lately. Even the Baron's men are feared to come by. Hannah must have gone to the wood to gather mushrooms, maybe. Straight too deep and the howlers got her. Her voice does not match her. Also, I mean, that's another, that's another thing to mark on this game, too, is like, they do a lot of detail into every character like it's strange to me how different all the characters look like i'm actually really impressed by that five series have a good night thank you so much for hanging around and Thanks. i hope i see you on Farewell. monday bye you'll get the option to kill her or let her go in peace the woman you're talking about when we find possibly <laughs> she reminded me of beth oh wait a minute wow my dad used to make swords like yours. I've seen this kid before. Can I touch it? It's sharp. And that girl. No, they reused the same kid. I forged swords once. Now it's sides and o's. For good arms, you'll need to go to Novigrad. I've seen those kids before. First of all, one is Gretel. And the second one is the fisherman's son. You need to ask about Hannah. Wanted to ask you about Hannah. Heard she looked after your children. Right after I said they're you. Hannah? Do you know where she is? No, that's why I'm here. She maybe Except tell you where kids. she was going or anything else? She said turnips are healthy and we ought to eat them. I saw her go to the forest with another lady. It was dawn almost. I'd gone out so I wouldn't wet the pallet. The forest? No. <laughs> so I wouldn't wet the pallet. Why? <laughs> A huge pack roams the area. None from the village dares go in the forest. Neelan's only one not afeared, but then he's a hunter. Hmm. I did speak too soon. Somebody was with Hannah then. Hold well, on, let me let Ginger out. Mr. Dill Pickles, thank you for the follow. Welcome. All right, I love you. I love you. Okay. Hey, Hannah. I'll see you later. Oh. It breaks my heart when I hear her walk because of her arthritis. She has like a clicking noise in her back leg and it just breaks my heart. I'm actually impressed at how unique the NPCs are. <laughs> I haven't dealt with a lot of children in my defense. I haven't dealt with a lot of children. So up until this moment, Eric, I know she sounds like an old rickety roller coaster. It's like creaking and now her front legs are getting stiff too. Did you get a I need to stop picking her woman? up, honestly. Know who it was? No. She walked in front of Aunt Hannah. I couldn't see. So there's another woman. Okay. Thanks. Farewell. Off to the woods. Let me see where in the world map we're headed. Anna. Anna's just ready for the moment when I cry her. Cry her when I cry to her about Ginger. Anytime I say I'm upset. Is Ginger okay? Like catch something. Is Ginger okay? There's such a huge amount of NPCs in this game. It's impressive that they've reused even a few. Yeah, I can admit. Yeah, I agree with that. The kids get overlooked, but that's okay. I think also... I guess I... I it's weird that I remembered them so clearly, too. 
considering my lack of focus pretty often. Oh, Eric. I'm so sorry to hear that. We need a code word for the moment. A code word for the moment? Uh, can we just play the Titanic song? Na, 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 na. I just know. I don't want to think about it. We're not talking about it. Anna's first and last trip to America. We were having a whole conversation about uh, how funny it would be to do like a, a video of me showing her around. I told her I'm going to take her to Target and then she goes, she, she goes, wait, what about that other game or that other uh, store that you always talk about? You always talk about with your stream. And I was like, Taco Bell, Chick-fil-A. And she's like, no, no, the other one. It starts with a T. I was like, Trader Joe's? You want to do a Trader Joe's and Target date? Yes! <laughs> Be still my beauty night. Mm. A lot of neckers. Woo! Oh! Pesky. Okay, there are so many here. They're like little... They remind me of those creatures in the bottom of the... The swamp in... In the fourth Harry Potter, <laughs> like the uh, they're not mermaids. They're really tiny. That drag them down to the bottom. The cast is American tour. And my one request, because like I've never, so I've never been. I've been to the UK because I've been to Scotland, but I've never been to London um, or England. Period. And so my one request from her was, uh, I've, I've heard that there's a cere there's a restaurant that's all just like a cereal bar. It's just cereal food? That's all I want to do. <laughs> or I guess... Fish and chips. Like a proper fish and chips. Not the Dementors. No, you know in the bottom of the la uh, the lake? And they start dragging Harry Potter down? See, I don't have that many donut places anymore, Trivial. You've been getting better donuts than me as of lately. I've been slacking, okay? What about Ireland, Sag? Um, I wanted to go to Ireland a long time ago and then it never happened. And so now it's just kind of like, I guess it kind of fell off of my radar for a little bit. To be fair, I, since I grew up doing like Scottish Highland dance, that's why I've always wanted to go to Scotland. So that was kind of like the side of that. Mm. Oh yeah, Pixel. Oh. There's a lot of, that's like um, like Eastern Europe. Like I was surprised at like Romania. Everything was so cheap there. Uh, a tricky one is Iceland. The tickets are always so cheap to get to Iceland, but then once you're in Iceland, it is so expensive. Zwill, thanks for the follow, welcome in. All right, let's see what happens here. I hate overalls. I just don't wear them with straps. Wait, what? You just don't wear them with straps? So you let straps just dangle by your side? That's the most you thing I think I could ever hear. Oh my gosh. Anna had the chain wallets when she was younger, confirmed. If she's okay with straps hanging around her. <laughs> had the chain wallet. <laughs> the floppy pickle. There we go. All right. Cooper, what's up? Welcome back in. Yes, I loved it. So I've talked about this before, but my mom taught English abroad in Romania. So I've been there three times. And each time, like, I just, it topped itself each time. I always tell, I always recommend Romania. I truly enjoyed Wait, my time there. What are you doing here? Gamer Shouldn't Jordan, welcome alone. back in. I came to tell you, you needn't look for Hannah. She'd have returned long past were she alive. I'll pay you twice Neilan's pledge. Just tell the man his Hannah's dead. Don't want to know what happened to her? Does she want her husband? Make no illusions, Witcher. In Velen, you're gone as long as she's been. You don't come back. Hannah's dead for certain. Neilan ought to accept his loss. She wants Neilan for herself. Yeah, it's Bron. It's Bran's castle, Bron's castle. Yeah, in, uh, Brajnov. Yeah. Uh, I'll find her. Don't care about your sister. There's something suspicious when she's offering to pay double for me to just tell. Uh, what's his name? That she's dead. 
Soon, soon. No, I can't speak Romanian now. Okay. Strange. People usually prefer to know the fate of their loved ones, whatever the cost. What good will it do? I'll not get my sister back. And Neelan's all I got left. I can't lose him too. And, mm. well, he'll not rest till he avenges his Hanner, even if it eats up his life. Vlad the Impaler's the castle? Deserves better. Oh. See, I don't, there's something suspicious here. Maybe I wasn't so far off with my guess about the whole uh, sister-in-law thing. But we'll see. Mm. Aaron, welcome in. Oh, I do. I do banana-ish. Um, I want to go to Chile for, like, I really want to climb just a piece of Patagonia at some point. Sorry, not in the habit of leaving jobs undone. Folks speak true about you witchers. You're heartless beasts. We're not going to dig up a grave. We're going to dig up the dirt that she's trying to hide. 750 hours in Witcher, and this quest gets me every time. Oh, um, okay. Let me give it the proper focus. Let me give it the proper focus. Hmm. Plants. There's something weird. Yeah, but my next one, like, I, I think this is going into my third year telling you guys how much I want to go to Ecuador. Like, I need to make it happen. Mushrooms. Hmm. Um, I don't know if I've ever thought about it like that, like islands or more like historical and monuments. I do love history, like I've always been a big fan of history, but I think I would just say I like adventure vacations a lot more than I like, like, I just can't sit still. Oh, tracks. So I hate like beach trips. I get bored with them after a day of sitting on the beach, soaking up the sun. I love it, but after a day I'm done. No, oh my gosh, Australia would be a dream. I don't know if I'll Smell ever get to go that corpse. far. Blood spattered all around, must be Hannah. A rotting Torn corpse. to pieces, literally. Aww. The wolf. Mm. Mm, no man did this. Inspect corpse. Hmm. Cuts, made with long claws, flesh torn clear off. Made with long claws, flesh torn clear off. This is getting I didn't interesting. Hominator, welcome back in. I don't know how people go on vacations only to the beach. I also am like Anakin, where I really hate sand. Claw marks deep. Mm. Werewolf, no doubt about it. Got to be careful. Is Hannah a werewolf? I will say that the only downside to that is doing adventure vacations. Is yes really fun and it can in fact yield some of the best memories but i think at the end of the day you don't come back nearly as refreshed as you'd be if you probably did nothing all week i think a lot of times i come back and i'm like oh i need a vacation from my vacation i've never really thought too much about brazil tough to fur raging would love it uh, whatever lost it hasn't bathed in a while it's got to be hannah and we're getting closer oh sense follow it okay so we saw that one so it goes back over here i love the witcher senses like being able to see the scent trail is one of the cooler parts i think mm. okay is it up in this tree scabbers oh no it's over here here we go All right, I'm picking up. I'm picking up good vibrations. It's got to be over here. Okay, I'm doing a horrible job at tracking this. I'm pretty sure it's that thing that I'm sensing all the way over there. Yep. Okay. Well, we we'll loot this first. Looks like a It's my favorite quarters. thing and least favorite thing about the game so far. Oh! Oh! The isolated shack. Oh! <laughs> okay, I was not expecting a bear. It did talk about... Yeah. 
I did talk about claw marks. Bad. You've been a very bad bear. Oh, my favorite thing about the game so far and my least favorite thing. Oh, I think my favorite thing about the game so far is just you so far. There isn't anything that I can pick up on that I feel like was half assed. Like they truly put their heart and soul into this from the dialogue to the posture of the people to the quest, the side quests, visual, everything. My least favorite part about the game how easy it is to get addicted to Gwent. I think that one's pretty safe to say. Hmm. A hunter. Lots of skins. Let me loot real quick. Gwen's got a strong goat hide. I don't think I have a goat hide. I can make burgers there. Ugh. I'm craving a burger now. No. Oh, the jalapeno burger that I told you about. Did you ever go get one? Did you ever go get one, Raging? Crossbow. We need to sell soon, by the way, guys. I'm getting real. Oh, nice. I'm going to leave the wolf sliver. I don't know how. Locked. We need a key. There. Notes. Mysterious Rose. notes. Mm. I am who I am. I can't change that. Shirts woven of parsley and potions made of virgin's tears might work in an old wives' tale, but not for me. It is time I come to terms with it. With Hannah's love and iron discipline, I have found a way to manage. But I must remember to hide in the woods before the full moon rises. To go somewhere far from others, far from Hannah. He's the werewolf. The attack comes and then passes. I wake up with wounds on my hands and the taste of blood in my mouth. Perhaps it is for the best that I don't remember. Killing prey with bow and arrow is one thing. To tear it apart with fang and claw. At least here, deep in the woods, I won't hurt any people. Merciful Melitelli, watch over any of those who stray too close. He murdered his own. The hunter, right? Uh, what is his name? The quest that I'm on. Um, it's Neelan. Neelan is the werewolf. It's gotta be. And there's a key somewhere. There's a key somewhere. Hmm. Unless the key is on him and we're not able to actually open it. Did I loot everything? It would be... The key would be red, I think. But actually, that loot isn't a red item, so it's not for the quest, necessarily. Oh, that's a lot of hides. That's a lot of hides. Brings back Last of Us memories. No. I still am having withdrawals from that game. I think I'll have withdrawals for a couple months. All right, well, there is something left that I'm missing. I haven't discovered everything. Is there something out back there? Oh, gosh. I think it's... Mm, blood's just barely dried. He it's gotta be kneeling. Here. Wonder where from. Hmm. All right. Do I have to break it? All right. I can't break it with my fist. As Garrett, we can't just break it with our fist. Oh, I wasn't even tracking the red markings. Oh, good point. Good point. Good point. Thank you, Sway. For the love of ginger, save. Mm. I needed two weeks without games to recover from the last of us too. Uh, it was a really good time to take my winter break. I will say that helped a lot. I think that really did help a lot. And horror, welcome in, and bollard as well. Just wolves. And a werewolf, and a werewolf. Well, it's just wolves and a werewolf. Okay, so it can't be him. Unless, well, we didn't see him go over here, so. Not dodging right. Oh, oh! Take a swallow, take a thunderbolt. Oh, sh uh, shit is right. 
Dude, I just ate that. Mm. What is that? Just a flesh wound. Did you just call more? You know, I've never seen what a werewolf is susceptible to, but I know we fought one. He's regenerating health. That's what he's doing. He's able to regenerate health. No! Stop! Don't harm him! She knows. She knew? Well, we know it's Neelan. Time to make hard choices. What's going on? I think we need to talk. Look at my sword. It's Neelan! Lycanthropy can afflict anyone, but it is a curse. So sorry, but I have to. You don't understand. I love him. I called it. I told to you. I mine can... till you came along. Go away. Leave us be. Do you think she led her sister out to get slaughtered? Uh, Anna, cyberpunk. You're raving, woman. What are you saying? We'll let her Not explain it. Find out what's going on here. I love him. Always have. Even after I'd learned his secret. God, I love freckles. You... You knew? Did you know I shot myself in here to wait out me change? Wasn't expecting knew, that. And I didn't mind. But you chose Hannah. I wanted her to see you. I wanted her to fear you. She'd not have stayed. And we could be together. You brought her here. That night. It was the reason I had the taste of blood in me mouth come morn. I did it for us. She was to see you turn, not more. I didn't want her death. You've got to believe me. I actually I called that. And I'll kill you willingly. First time for that, in fact. Oh. Oh, time to decide quickly. This is between the two of you. I refuse to meddle, but cross my path again, and I will kill you. Do you see the po is the poison? No! Mercy! You have no mercy for your sister. I'll have none for you. <laughs> I am a witcher. I do not meddle. All's Told fair you kill you. in I love and war. In love and war. Love and war. Do death. If you want death, find some reins and a tree with a strong limb. Wouldn't work. Couldn't do it. Always been a coward. Don't look at me like that. Do it. Please. Nah. <laughs> Oh, so basically it's like, does she die or does she not die? Uh, so here's the thing. She knew what was happening. This bear is respawned. Or there's just a lot of bears here. She knew. She knew everything. She did it selfishly. She deserves what got to her. Like, what came to her? Karma, okay? It's called karma. And it schwacked her at the end. Ernie, thank you so much for the 100 bits. And also, no, it wasn't too easy. Maybe we'll talk about the possibility of being to death march later. I let her live with the choices. So I thought about that, Arminus, for a second, for like the smallest second, I thought maybe she should live with her choices and then suffer by being, al by being alone and she would have lost her sister and lost the only person that she loved. Um, but this way she actually gets to face her sister. So I'm gonna let that reunion happen. And I'm also trying to remember that witchers don't meddle as much. I'm telling myself that at least. Witchers don't meddle, witchers don't meddle. Uh, okay, that actually would make me go down. We're super close, we're four points away. Almost time for marbles. No, I think everybody wanted to, um, I think everybody wanted to have more than just one game. So I think, did you, didn't you guys say that you want to store it for later? Like store it for next week if I have more deaths? And Wookie, thank you so much for the reset for seven months in a row and welcome back in. Hello. Hannah avenged. She got what was coming to her. Okay. That's the Geralt isn't a very good witcher then. He meddles all the time. I meddle all the time. Do you think him? Wait, maybe in the books he meddles a lot too. Interesting. 
I wonder if the books talk more about that then. Because he definitely... I think you're right. Just based on the movie and the game, it seems like... Do other witchers struggle with the same emotions and worries that he does? He meddles in the books as well. Winds howling. Mr. What's up? Welcome in. Wookie, seriously, welcome back in. How's it going? All right, take the marker off. Green hell? No, I'm not familiar with that game. He does meddle in the books as well. All right, let's go over here, and then we're going to... I think we should do Kara. I think. Mm. Or we could do some side quests. Let me go over here real quick and hit a couple of these, because these are... These are plenty, so let me just smack a couple of these. Green hell, is that like the more extreme forest? I feel like I've heard Anna talk about that. Does losing a Gwent game not count as death? Is... The only problem is if I make that a thing, you guys are going to like actively try to make me lose Gwent games. And I like doing them together. I really like how we've been playing them together. Mr. King, welcome back in by the way. And little Dane, hello. To play Gwent. <laughs> no. I need to stay focused on the quest. Unless Kara will let me play Gwent with her. Unless we take a bath with her. Jackal, welcome back in. Mulky. Mulk? I know you don't smuggle no more. That you've set aside plenty of coin and ain't interested in the risk. Just want to enjoy time with your wife and kitties. But I gotta ask you a favor. We gotta move one more load, and it's the last, I promise. Why do I feel like he said that before? It's a simple job, a couple of chests, risks minimal, and rewards substantial. Please do it, if not for the gold, then at least for old time's sake. Bert. Sunken treasure. It's gotta be out there, right? It's gotta be somewhere out there. Kara has an interesting quest. I just don't know if I should start the Kara quest line because I'm really... We're kind of getting close to the end of today's stream. So I don't know if I should start that so quick. All right, swim swiftly. Bow, what's up? Welcome in. All right, so I think what I learned is if I go down deep and then swim, they don't bother me. What the heck? I don't want this missing pipe. Ooh, okay. We got it. I need to go back. I think they only bother you if you surface right by them. Yeah. They always circle like right above it. Mm. Yeah, I haven't I have never fought anything underwater actually. Chat wouldn't do that. I didn't do it. The cure quest isn't is too long to finish before nine, but it's a good one. So you're saying at least start it. You're saying at least start it. Or should we pick up some of these small little things, play a Gwent game, have a little fun? Ooh, this has to be. Oh, wait, there's another haircut person too. Care quest is quite long. I also need to find Anna. But I don't know if Kara is helping me find Anna at all. At all. I don't know what I picked up, but it was fun. Don't let him catch his breath. As if catching my breath is what I need. All right. They should just be melee from here on out. We still have 1.5 hours until 9 p.m. Guys, I'm on a gym grind. I'm on a gym grind. Okay, yay! I love when you help people restore back to where they were. Yeah, a few points of interest, and then we'll get ready to be, like, right at the quest. Do maybe, like, a Gwen game. Come back. Dresden, I thought you went to bed. What are you doing? Let me meditate real quick. I thought you went to bed. Uh, let me finish this. Liberated. You have to find Siri and not Anna. Oh, I'm looking for Siri. Before I'm looking for Anna. Did I already let Ginger out? Riddler, have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. I hope you had a great week and I hope I see you Monday. No, Gerald is not getting a haircut. Although, okay, I think that's what he looks like with the ponytail and the sides cut. Uh, in that meditation. <laughs> 
<laughs> so go to the gym, get some dinner, and come home and stream more Gwent until 2 in the morning. <laughs> I thought we're trying to have me focus on completing this game by March. You guys are not helping with my Gwent obsession. Miro, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. <laughs> I keep thinking you mean whilst I'm lurking. FFS. <laughs> yeah, the Anna in the game. There's not a lot of Annas good, in games, actually. I oh, when I say oh, I got a razor. Wait, if I have a razor, can I cut my own hair and my own face? Hmm. We already saw Yennefer, actually. All right, I know they have nothing left in their name, but let me take whatever is possibly left. I don't need the silk. No, 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 no. If we come across, look, all's fair in Gwent and more. If I come across more Gwent, I will be playing it. It's just, I'm not gonna seek it out. Hannah with the silent H. <laughs> oh wait, baby brother, I got your letter. The children are healthy, thank you. Little Reckleths, Reckleths? <laughs> not so little anymore. He is almost as tall as my shoulder. Kids sweet as ever, but enough small talk. I'm so glad you were able to return to your own home. I'm worried though. Are you sure those pirates have gone away for good? Best have eyes in the back of your head and don't burn any lights at night so that no one's cruising the coast can spy on you. You're Lessica. You're Lessica. If she could play her, she's a really goofy character. You said Yennefer is a goofy Everyone character? Is curd. Uh, Bye. Curd. That would hit the spot. Curd would hit the spot. Ooh, like some good lemon curd. Oh, I need to go to Trader Joe's tomorrow, actually. Now that, now that Anna brought it up. They have some of the best cheesecake in the frozen section. Like, it is perfect for, like, if you need to get a dessert and a pinch. And I gotta pick up a... I gotta get birthday candles, too. All right, let's go over here. Oh, good character. I was like, she's a goofy character? I know she has a little bit of a, like, bitching attitude from time and time again. But... Come here, Drowner. I'm kind of eating all these hits real quick. I'm not doing much dodging these days. Smuggler's notes. Oh, this is all along the same quest line. Luki, have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around and have a great, fantastic weekend. Those were the days. Here we go. Those were the days. You'd smuggle a few bottles of hooch in Oxenfurt, then loiter around the dormitory selling it to students. You'd come away with a hefty sack of coin, and they'd have their spirits fortified for study. Then along came Radovid, who shut down the university, chased the students away, and positioned Ballista, Ballista on the riverbank to sink every floating up or down the Pontar, swans included. But there's not been a dark cloud yet that didn't have a silver lining. Yesterday, I saw our brave soldiers sink a merchant vessel. Went straight to the bottom, it did, along with its whole crew and its cargo. A shame, <laughs> I love how the accent's forming. A shame about the men, really. It would have been a, just a big shame to let all those goods go to waste. So me and Martin will fish them out and dry them off and sell them. And maybe at last I'll have something to put in my pot. Just started like, the more I read, the more it came out. A costly mistake. So if I track the quest, where is it taking me? Arr. Oh, a costly mistake. Indeed. Oh, there's a whole pirate ship. Infinity and rat guys, welcome. All right, so we've got some drowners. We've got a lot of drowners. I'm just going to back away from that for a second. Uh, let's go ahead and save real quick. Let me heal too. Oh, he is. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Let me let me meditate and then heal with full health. So if I do have to do it again, at least I don't have to meditate again. Mm. Did they confirm they're working on a Witcher 4? I know we've talked about this before. I think you guys said yes, but it wouldn't come out. Or no, the remake of Witcher 1 wouldn't come out till years and years later. Is that what she said? Oh, well, what's up? Welcome back in. All right, let's save her here. Mm. All right, it's the the remake of one. That's what it is. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. This is gonna be our base camp. There might be something actually up on here. Mm. 
Yeah, it will be sometime. I think you guys said like 20, 27. Okay, I can swim from here. <laughs> it's actually just a uh, sparkling drink, but yes, it does have butters. Mm. Witcher 4 is the start of a new trilogy, but they're also working on the one remake. So they're going to do a whole new trilogy on top of one? How? How is there that much story? There's that much story. It's got to be on the other side. See, when you swim at the bottom, I don't think they see you. Like, I think they see you, but they don't get bothered by you. Okay, cannot confirm that. Cannot confirm that. <laughs> Can't confirm. Hold up. I see that. Hold on. <laughs> the trilogy will play around Siri. Ah, so no more. Oh, that would be really cool though. Okay, so how do I fight? I need to, I need to figure out how to fight underwater. That's not it. Oh. You boys? I didn't say floppy pickle. Oh, so you can shoot them from above, I guess? Oh, back here. Oh, well, first of all, this is another point of interest. Let me meditate real quick. I didn't realize this other point of interest. I did not say floppy pickle. Oh! I cannot meditate. Meditation is not happening. Just stumble. Oh, leave it to me to stumble across a night wraith. Okay, they're susceptible to something. To the bestery, the beastry. The bestery. All right. Mm. Night wraith. Okay, so I knew it was the yard and symbol and then we need specter oil. That's right. All right, we got this. To the specter oil. Inventory. I'm going back. I'm going back. Don't worry. I just retreated and ran into something worse. I have those slots filled. Went in tonic. <laughs> Wait, that's awesome. Ooh, that's insane. You can't do any damage until she's inside. All right, we need to wear down her defenses. Let's also do a thunderbolt. Yard and sign it again. That did so much damage. I need them to come in here. Mm. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm just not placing it down in the right spot. Oh, gosh. The enemy's just waiting there while I'm trying to fight it. I think I need to place it closer to her. Get in here. All right, I need to place it back down. Come on, come on, come on. Come here. I think my weapon is damaged too, by the way. The sign's wearing down. Oh, it's actually really close. Come on. Okay, she did the flash. I'm gonna take another swallow to be safe because we can meditate after this. I used Thunderbolt. I didn't use the potion that they saved for my race. I didn't use the potion they said, but I used a thunderbolt. Well, actually, I didn't even look at the potion that they said. Hold up. Hold up. Wait. What was the potion for it? Oh, it's a moon dust. A bomb. It's not a potion. It's a bomb. Night wraith hair and dark essence and a night wraith mutagen. Does that allow me to make anything? No. Uh, Blaze fire. What's up? Welcome in, by the way. Okay. There is some wicked loot here. And then we need to meditate before we go back down. Oh, we got a dried fish. I need to sell some stuff. Diagrams. By the way, I think I realized something. 
I think I have such little to me. Do I have nothing to my name because I haven't been reading them? I bet you that's the case. If I go into books, is it books? It's not books. It wouldn't be books. It would be in, don't tell me. Mm. The area, other. Do I have to read these to actually have the ability to craft these? No. These are just mysterious letters. They automatically go into what you can craft? I just feel like I haven't been able to craft anything this game. Like the manuscript pages and the others. Floppy Pickle. Do I consider Geralt a good looking man? Uh, he's definitely got that rugged look to him. I would, I see, I just, I like dark hair. I just got it, like Chris Redfield. Mm. I mean, I would definitely say, objectively, he's a really good looking man. Just not my man. Chris Raphael. That's another story. Did we do main quest today? Yes, we, we did, Soph. A little bit. A couple. Was that enough to heal? When is taking away from crafting time? <laughs> so we did get a couple really good point cards. But yes. Yes. No, I actually like... I like Chris Redfield when he's in the latest one. When he's got a little bit of the, like, the scruff, the dad bod. I don't know. He seems approachable. Like a good approachable looking person. Mm, I think I also, it's like the stoic. Something about, he just seems, actually no, Chris talks a lot. I just haven't played the games where he talks a lot, I think. Gwen is money for crafting. I'm crafting my Gwen deck, okay? Leave me alone. Okay, so we need to go to open world. No, Sentinel. I'm not playing Death March yet. I think we might up the difficulty here soon. Uh, did I save? I can't even remember, but I'm just gonna double. I'm gonna double save because I don't trust that. Okay. Oh, Leon definitely talks way more than Chris, yeah. Yes. Gotta wear Ragnarok Thor. I have not seen Ragnarok Thor. Hmm. Oh, check it out. Little Ayo. How do I get in there? Oh, there is a chest in there. I don't think I can break it underwater. There's somehow. Hold on, let me surface real quick and then dive back down. This might get me hit. Dive back down. Fast, 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 fast. I need to dive all the way down to the bottom, I think, for them not to be alerted. There's got to be an entrance into here. I didn't regenerate after. Um, I'm trying to figure out, do you have to? Oh no. Oh, we're crossing paths. Oh, we're crossing paths. Do you have to, maybe you have to, um, meditate for a longer period of time? Because I haven't healed at all. But I'm definitely not on death march, I can tell you that. I see that there's something down there. I guess let's go ahead and dive right there. NG, what's up? Welcome back in. Water. Oh, I'm so glad that I found water. Oh, right there. There was just a bigger entrance for me to go to. Woo! Woo! It doesn't heal on this difficulty either. Black magic doll? Oh. Excuse me? Diagrams, diagrams go to Um, I'm about to be heavy. I feel it. Okay, I need to get out of here. I'm gonna drown. Healing doesn't work even on this one. Come on. Before we drown, Geralt. Oh, before we get pee pee smacked by a drowner. Ah, they're coming for blood. Sharks in the water. You guys know I hate water. I do not like this. Ugh. All right, we need to go to that ship. I think it's down somewhere there. Yeah, so I guess on hard you don't regenerate. But on Death March, do you even regenerate like your swallow, like your potions? I don't even know if you regenerate your potions. Ooh. If I'm under the boat, maybe they can't get to me. It is right here. 
Oh, he can get to me. Oh, oh, oh. I gotta go. Oh, they're inbound. Surface, surface. Swim on the surface. I feel it. I'm about to get. Where is this? It's not on the ship. If it's not on the ship, and it's not underwater, I I need to use my Witcher senses. All right, let me let me save up here because we have looted a little bit. I'm gonna get so good at doing saves back and forth. What is trying to fight me now? Nothing. Yeah, I guess I don't heal in this one. There we go. I guess we're wandering into the dark. It doesn't make sense. It's right out there, I see it. Oh no! Ah! I also feel like I, I just swim really slow. Like there are monsters out there. There's no need for Geralt to be swimming this slow. Let's try going down here. Maybe I need to dive right here. Cool. Okay. Yeah, let's try swimming underneath this. Nope. 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 I'm out. What? <laughs> what is happening? Guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. And Vicaro, welcome in. I think the clicking of the left stick while moving makes you swim faster. That's what I'm doing. B Paul, that's what I'm doing. Oh, like clicking it instead of just holding down? That could be. That would make a lot more sense. Sorry, y'all. I know this is like, I'm, I'm, so, I'm sitting here just lost. I need to use the Witcher senses. It's just one quick one and then I'll be good. Natty, have a good one. I can't wait to see you Monday. Thank you so much for the subscription today and just hanging around and being a part of the community. Thank you. All right. We started talking to Kara yesterday. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. You know what? Maybe I have to kill all of them. Maybe I have to kill the drowners. Maybe it's nothing to do with the loot. Hmm. Yeah, Wraith, we were talking about that. I think I need out of the I need to be out of the water to do that. Florida man, welcome back in. Ginger, no. And John, have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. All right, so if that's the case. Mm, all right. I mean, I can try to do. Oh, I've never, I've never tried to crossbow. Hmm. Oh, oh, it's right there. It's right there. It's right there. Nice. I gotta go by you. <laughs> I gotta go by you. Swim, 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 swim. Get out. Get out while we still can. How did I miss that? No, no. Go. Geralt, you are so slow, my man. Please. He's like Maggie. I'm overcumbered. Oh, no. I know. Whew. Okay, we just walked out. We've got a little blood on us. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Let me just go into inventory and blood <laughs> drop. Just drop some of these crossbows. Oh, okay. Drop these. Wait, drop these bolts. And drop this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Back in the day. Okay, so we should be good to meditate. And let's go ahead and save. And then that was a couple quests done though. All right, we got that back. What am I gonna do on my three days off of Gwent? I'm gonna have to turn to Catan. It's not my favorite, no, I'm just kidding. I'll still be doing board games, just not card games. Uh, I never use ranged weapons in these games. I probably should, cause I know we're gonna take on some other ranged creatures, but all right, back to the world map, you guys. That was a really bland quest right there. 
All right, to the barber. Move to the barber. Yeah, I'm just not a big fan of crossbows. Maybe if we had, if we had more magic that was ranged, that would be sick. Person's in distress. Oh, I see. Okay, we need to go for any more ranged. No? Okay. Ow! All right, renegade. Renegade without a cost. Feel the same way I never used it except for drowners. Oh, that's actually a smart idea. Oh yeah, for in the water. I don't even know how to target them. I have to figure out how to even target the drowners. I'm gonna have to get the scuffed mobile game of Gwent. Oh, that's not fair. I was decapitating your friend. Mm, kick him in the knee. Alright. Oh, dude, if we can do damage when they break our Quen too, that would be disgusting. Raven, thanks for the follow, and Kaizen as well, and Kitchen. Thank you so much for the gifted sub to Erlen. Kitchen, thank you. Wait a minute. Kitchen, thank you. Yeah, you have to... You have to use it for them being underwater. I have to target them though. I think I have to use the targeting system to target them. And then, oh, my man, glitch in there. There's so much blood that he's glitching right now. He's got nails on him. Why does he have nails? Are they, they all have nails on them? Oh, locked key required. The barber. Do you think he'll give us a free haircut? Fist touch? All right, we need to look for, there's a key somewhere here. The chest. I don't know if we've ever dealt with people giving us free stuff. Bear, what's up? Welcome in. Welcome back in, I should say. Uh, broken bones, broken something, something dark side. It's one under death march, one under death march. The first time I've come back and you're not playing Gwent. <laughs> I believe that. The sad part is I actually believe that. Nilf bastards must have coin coming out of their arses. They buy every peasant I capture, no matter if he's lame, cross-eyed, or dumb as a rotten stump. Never haggle, neither. They need folk for the silver mine. They say, and no one ever lasts more than two months there anyway. So every hand helps. Fine by me. Business is good. Only thing worrying me is as soon as I'll, I'll caught all the peasants around, then who will I sell? Okay, so they were slavers. We need to find the the key and then let the barber out yeah but i think we might be going back to death march i you know for once erdy's not wrong kitchen thank you so much for the gifted sub to paul and erdy with the gifted sub to bear guys thank you hmm interesting developments on anon right here long swords blood and broken bones no, it's a different bear. Different bear. Another bear. Lots of burrs. Amateurs are armor repair kit. Wait, real quick, let's do that actually. Dream Hunter, welcome back in, by the way. Ah, uh, what should we. Chest piece, pants, my boots. I should repair my chest piece. And then let me repair this real quick. My silver sword for sure. 60% on my silver sword. Let us not go. Go loud. A non exposed. Anon has been exposed. Maybe there's a quest here? Nothing's popping up. Maybe in here. Heavy maze. Mmm. Second attempt sleeping. I hope this time it actually sticks. Trez, thank you so much for hanging around and good sleeps. Good sleeps and I'll see you Monday. Y'all. Maybe it was on one of the bodies, but then it would show. Erdy, thank you so much for the hunter bits. Maybe you'll remember that and choose Gimme God of War when you start Ragnarok. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. 
playing difficult, like, I think doing high difficulties on stream games are not so bad, but playing it on YouTube, ugh. I'm sorry, man, but I don't think I can let you out. I can't even talk to him. Gotta get the gym cry done. Y'all. Maybe this, but no, this is where we went to. This is a question mark. This is a question mark. This person is in distress and needs assistance. It's just not showing red. Nails, common steel sword. Crowns. Well, maybe it was that body that I was laughing at. Need to get her to wrap up before Gwen happens. <laughs> um, yeah, what the heck? Oh wait, there's a body all the way back here. Hold on. I've scattered bodies. This isn't really good. Bread. Okay. Oh. Oh, I see it. Gotcha, it was further back. It was way further back, the, the little flutters. Guys, thank you for the follows, welcome in. Here we go. Sir? I think he's just glitching out right now. I don't think I can talk to him. <laughs> hey! Thank you, master. You saved my life. You ever come through Claywitch, you give us a holler. I'll shave ye and shear ye for free. You said I'll shear me for free? Use the Witcher sense and search Come everything. I, I guess I'm always looking for the red Witcher sense. Roach. Roach. Ah, wait, did I see? <laughs> Roach. Hmm. I should go back to Hangman's Alley real quick. Oh. Okay. I need to go back to Hangman's Alley. I cried when- What? What are these spoils, Mystic? He's like, gotta go by you. Gotta go by you. All right, let me hop off here. Yeah, I do need to get different saddlebags. Okay, Roach, please. Lord Richard, welcome back in. Yes, I do need to get- Well, I need to focus on a build for Roach anyway. I definitely have to fix that. Erty. Why are you rewarding that? <laughs> Ernie with the gifted sub to Mystic. Mystic, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. I'm assuming you're talking about not the, the game. Are but please, no spoilers. Okay, so we have things in here. But the reason why I'm back. Move, everybody move, everybody move. Greetings. I've already seen him. Farewell. A shear and a shave doesn't have the same ring to it. A shear and a shave. Excuse me. Ah, it's a crying woman. Do I help her? Yeah. Do I help her? Oh no, I feel like I need to help her. What? Okay, let's see what he's offering first. Got anything interesting? You should try. Um, first of all, I feel like I should buy these. Wait, quest item. Tristania and Isidore? Oh! Northern Realms? Nilfgaard? Medic? I got a Nilfgaard medic. Another Nilfgaard? Another Nilf? That might actually be enough. It is depleting all of my money, but it's totally worth it. Oh, you're going to the gym with me. All right, let's go. One game to rule them all. A game of Gwent. How about it? One to bind them. Which was don't meddle. Uh, <laughs> uh, I feel like then we can't call me a witcher with how much. Holy. I'm so close to having enough cards. Gwent, take me home, country roads, to the place I belong. I don't know what, I don't know how he, I don't know what he uses. 
Lemur. <laughs> Gwent over helping the crying woman. All right. So we have a frost. It is Nilfgaard, right? Vess. What do we have? We have Scorch. We have three. We have my medic. We have a spy. This is a pretty good, pretty good deck. Pretty good deck. I'm thinking reroll this one. Zappo would that welcome in. And blue as well. I don't know if they're heavy on the front troops, but I have Scorch anyway, so I feel like those are kind of, um... I don't know, because I have Biting Frost. I don't feel like I need... Uh, if that's the case, let me remove Vess. Yeah, I'll take that. A decoy. Okay. I got this. One round. Rule them all. <laughs> Jack Steele's welcome in. I, yeah, I agree. I mean, I have, I think for him, he's going to be pretty easy to fight. Although he sold a lot of great cards, so maybe he's actually cracked and we have no idea. All right, let's see how this goes. Playing a one right off the rip is a little, it's bold. A spy. You know I'm going to yoink that in a heartbeat, but hold on. Erdy, what? It's suspicious that you guys are doing it in unison. This is the second time you guys have done it in unison. I'm glad I waited. I got a biting frost. Um, Kitchen and Erdy, thank you so much for the gifted subs to Sapo and also Jack. Guys, I hope y'all enjoyed the emotes in the subs. Mm. I didn't use the spy right away. We both have 10 cards. I have multiple, I have a Scorch and also... Mm, I'm tempted to use the spy. I'm also tempted to use, yeah, let's use spy. GBA, welcome back in. And also Slyfoot. What do you call an alligator with a vest? An investigator, that's my favorite one. An ocean of orange soda. Turns out it was a fantasy. <laughs> My sister bet I couldn't build a car out of spaghetti. You should have seen her face when I drove past. Uh... I got a decoy, by the way. I have another decoy. Mmm, that one's bad. I'm just gonna get a shit ton of guards. Mm -hmm. King, what's up? Welcome back in. Hard to believe this such a good RPG game around the card game. I know, King. I know. And Anon, wait, the return, wait a minute, the return of Anon. Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Blue. Blue, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. Anybody that has been given a gifted sub today, I really hope you enjoy the gingers. All right, we're just gonna keep using spies. And then I'm gonna wreck his soul with a frost. Might as well frost the spice. Oh, I'm already. Don't even, don't even worry. I'm on it. What do you call a noodle that works? What? Pea stocks. <laughs> oh my gosh. I will say I've never heard that one. I've never heard that. Wiz, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. All right, he's got 14 points. I have one. And now he's got six cards. I have 11. as well as an ad-free cast to entertain. <laughs> GB. Mm, and Erdy with the gifted sub to King. King, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. What are you guys doing? Y'all. Mm -hmm. I should have saved my decoy. I, oh, he got it back with the medic. Anon, Angela, or Angela, Angel, sorry, Angel. Welcome in and I hope you enjoyed the emotes and the sub and the channel. I used to hate facial hair, but then it grew on me. Me too. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I have a medic as well. Oh, he passed. Oh, I wasn't even, I wasn't even tracking that. He has eight cards now. Hold on, I've been getting so excited that I think I've thrown. What did I get? 
I'm about to scorch his little booty cheeks. No, I didn't get the spy next round with the medic. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yes, 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 yes. The level one spy. Oh, you're right. You're right. Okay, I just play everything because it's the final round. Impenetrable fog, no worry. That is such a great one to pull too. Is this Gwent? Because Gwent background music is my favorite thing in the game. I've decided, yes, this is the Gwent music. I just feel like I'm like, <laughs> I feel like I'm just riding a horse all chipper. Like, <laughs> that's all I can think of. <laughs> all right, we're gonna use another spy. Back at it again. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> that's all I'm thinking. Blue, thank you for the follow. Welcome in four cards left and I have an entire deck in my hand. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just lurking here while I watch The Last of Us 2 play through. <gasps> Wait, Texas Shrimp, are you enjoying it? And welcome back in. I'm so confused on this game works. Do you guys want me to explain it next time? I mean, I'm still figuring it out, so I do not have any of the answers, but I actually am at the point where I'm like confident in my abilities. I wish I almost kind of wish that if they played like, like he played Biting Frost, right? I wish if I played it, it would negate it. Like two weather cards cancel each other out. Mystic, yes, get into this game, play the game, play Gwen, you got it. I play an in-card game. I feel like I'm on a horse <laughs> while I'm playing. It's the music. Now I'm in a court and there's a, uh, I just see in the corner of Robin Hood Men in Tights, like the instrumental musicians. They're just light dancing. Chumbo, <laughs> Chumbo, thank you so much for the reset for two months in a row and welcome back in. And also Ernie with the gifted sub to bow to the brow. Bow to the brow. That is a perfect username. With turkey tights, I hope, yes. <laughs> the only ones I could possibly do. All right, so they have one card left. Let's see what they've got. It must be, uh... It must be... Let's end this person's. Oh, I didn't even see what I pulled. Figures. Rawr. Wait, the Scorch ability doesn't happen because he's already passed or because it's fro- Oh, can you not Scorch when there's Frozen? You can't, oh, when there's frost on the ground, you can't Scorch, can you? Is that a new strategy? To throw down frost so they can't play Scorch? I'm not done with him yet. Oh, his total's under 10. I see, I'm not done with him yet. Now I'm done with him. Mm, presents with the welcome in. I, if I can figure out this game, I promise anybody can. Like, <laughs> I really promise anybody can figure it out if I have. Chumbo, seriously, thank you so much for the continuous for I have one ginger hair that sticks to my nose every stream. Look at him. He's fuming. Torrential rain. He gave me torrential rain. Really? What a wasteless. Hmm. Mm. Kitchen, thank you so much for the gifted sub to presents as well. Presents, I hope you enjoy the sub. Y'all, it's 9 for, it is 9.15. Did anybody warn me that it was nine o'clock? Regular Scorch doesn't need a 10 spring. Oh. I'm just hearing cry, oh, the old woman crying. Maddie Max, what's up, welcome in. Oh man, do we play one more? I don't, I wouldn't be great at explaining it. I feel like, I feel like you wouldn't want to learn from me. But at the same time, if I can learn it, I promise you guys, it's really easy. No, we haven't done. We actually haven't done any boxing yet. Okay. I can't believe all he gave me, I put my heart and soul into that game and all he gave me was rain. All he gave me was raining cats and dogs. Multiple people warned you, we decided. Once was enough. I also want, oh, 
<laughs> decided once was enough. I also want to make a point that you guys started this. I was going to skip Gwent and chat told me not to. And because I stuck with it, here I am into, let's see, let's see. Let's actually, this is really, let's do this. Um, you want to know how many hours I have in this game so far? Uh, we have 25. <laughs> we have 25.3 hours in this game. And I'm going to reckon that 10 of those are Gwent. No, I'd say 10 of those are Gwent. <laughs> I have 25 hours in the game and I haven't even finished the Baron quest line. <laughs> <sighs> all right we need to focus up when i return on monday all right you guys when i return monday i better shape up because <laughs> i cannot have an entire like i can't play this into the moment resident evil 4 remake comes out you guys i gotta drop it so that gives me two and a half months oh you can always check your playtime when you check your player shots i did not know that okay that's way easier they're going to be 150 hours in before we go to Novigrad. <laughs> All right. I seriously will tone. I will tone the Gwent play down for the sake of my progress because I'm blaming you guys, but it's actually me. I'm the problem. It is definitely. It's definitely me. Um, yeah, oh man. That's just so painful. <laughs> oh, hey. OK, wait, wait. All right, guys, we are going to get out of here. Everybody, please return your tray tables to the upright position. We are preparing for, I guess I can't say landing because we're taking it, we're preparing for takeoff because this girl's got a jet. I got to get to the gym. And then, yes, I'm going to be gone this weekend. Uh, yes, I love the recent RE games. So I actually recently discovered Resident Evil. So I've not always been a Resident Evil like enthusiast, but it wasn't until I played 2 and 3 Remake and then 7. Seven is what sold me on the series. And I know you say, Maggie, how can seven sell you on the series? Like, it's not, it's not like, that's the like horror one out of all of them. Are they even that good? But trust me, seven for somebody who loves horror. Absolutely. Uh, I, I had just picked Sailor B out. I had just picked Sailor B out just because she's playing Dragon Age Origins. And I want to take a peep at that game. But next time I definitely want to. Next time, we will definitely raid Fox and see him be super uncomfortable. But guys, if you're unfamiliar, Sailor B is a variety streamer. She's currently playing Dragon Age, so I really want to check out that game. So without too many spoils, I feel like Dragon Age is that kind of game that you can look at for a little bit and not be weary of too many spoilers. So that's what we're going to do. Um, but yes, we're going to go. We will definitely remind me next time he's live when I'm ending Sharpie. And I would really like to do that. I would love nothing more than to make him feel uncomfortable. But yes. You guys just wanted to see an eye roll before I left. That's what it was. Y'all just want to see an eye roll before. Thank you guys so much for an incredible week. I will see you guys on... I will see you guys on Monday. Ernie, thank you so much for the 100 bits. If you play Dragon Age before Mass Effect, we will revolt. I think you just mean you. You will do that. Guys, please give her a big cast of warm welcome and hello. And I am looking forward to seeing a little bit of that before I jet off to the gym. But guys, thank you so much for an incredible week. And there have been so many new people and faces. And I just really hope you guys are enjoying the content. Gwent or not, we will get through this game. And I think we might also up to Death March on Monday as well. But I love you guys so much. Thank you for giving me the honor to be here and continue to do this every single week for you guys. And I will see y'all on Monday. Thank you. Bye. Wait, wait, everybody. Thank you for the follows and the subs and everything. <laughs> Bye.